Okie dokie. <laughs> Hello. Let me uh turn on the music a little bit. Things are we're we're trying things out. <laughs> we're trying some things out here. Okay. <laughs> How are we all doing? I hope we're doing well. Um Yeah, we're trying to figure this out. Unfortunately, uh so I'm trying out stramming on both the YouTubies <laughs> and the Twitch. <laughs> Uh, hello, hello. Um, so we're gonna see how it goes. The problem is, is it doesn't seem that I'm able to do like a integrated chat box. Let me try one other thing. Hmm. I don't know what's what. I'm I'm kind of I'm kind of still tweaking things a little bit, but I hope y'all are doing well. Let me see. Yeah, it doesn't seem like I can, uh, let me see here. Live docs chat. There we go. I'll do that. I'm going to do another little test. Yeah, it doesn't look like it's showing up. That's okay. Um, yeah, so I'm like, I've got like a popped out version of, of YouTube chat, which like, there's not really anything going on in the YouTube chats. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but it's kind of chaotic. I guess the only other thing I could have like YouTube chat up on my phone. Maybe I could do that. Sorry, I'm still like this is my very first time doing this, so I'm kind of troubleshooting. Um, I don't know how to do that exactly. Let me see if I can do that somehow. I was I'm not really keeping up with. Test stream, test stream. Yeah. Which, like, there's nobody, like, chatting besides, besides, uh, Comey and I <laughs> doing tests. There's nobody chatting anyway, so it's, like, okay. Because, I mean, they didn't... I only announced it, like, a couple hours ago, and it's just not a usual thing. But I, I thought I'd try it out. Um. How do I, like... Hopefully everything sounds okay over there, too. I don't know what's up. Oops. No. Oh, no. What is this? Oh, okay. <laughs> Things are chaotic. I don't know. I don't know how to... Hmm. Okay. That's all right. We're just gonna... We're just gonna deal with it. We're just gonna do our best. That's all we can do. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Sorry, I, I will engage in just a moment when I'm sorted out. I guess I'll make like the YouTube chat like a little on the top here so I can at least see a little bit going on. Anyway, hope y'all had a good week and or at least a good uh, start of your weekend. Um, I, uh, I had an interesting day yesterday, kind of. I ended up having to... Drive, uh, I had to drive my grandmother to an appointment last minute. And so I ended up sitting in a parking lot of a, like a, the place that she was in. I kind of waited out in the parking lot, which was nice because it's like, it's up in the mountains. So like the entire parking lot is just like has this big panoramic view of, um, it's a little delayed, but yeah, that might just be the way it works. I don't know. It might be the, the way, the way OBS does it to her and stuff. But, uh, yeah, I'll have to figure it out. I'll figure something out for it. Um, but so it's like a nice view of the mountain range because you're like up in the mountains. So it was very nice. But I, 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 my current, my current obsession, like mild obsession is, uh, perusing the eBay secondhand clothing sections. <laughs> I like finding some, some, uh, random like thrifted clothings on the ebay <laughs> so that's my my current thing so that's what i was doing for like 45 minutes in, sitting in a parking lot yesterday perusing the ebay <laughs> that's 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 my interesting life <laughs> among many other things i had to do yesterday i'm gonna scroll up on the youth on the uh twitch chat here 
<laughs> what will I do without my fellow chatters? Yeah, I think there's more chatters in the Twitch side, of course. Um, the most cursed command. Oh my. Let me scroll back down. Oh my gosh. I'm like, <laughs> you'd love the thrift stores around here. So many. Yeah, I know. There's one. I do have one around here that I discovered. I actually was looking or trying to find some actual thrift stores that I could go to. And, um, I finally, I did find one that I didn't even know existed. It's like, a, it's like a 40 minute drive, but it's, it's pretty good. It, it seemed, and I w happened to go buy it on the way home yesterday, yesterday. And, um, it looked pretty busy. Like there was people parked in the parking lot and <laughs> yeah, I mean, there's a couple others, but I don't know. There's one that was like South, but it's like this little tiny place. And then um, I think there was there's one that's a little closer, but it's like not. I don't know. It's more like a family. So it's like all kids stuff. Um, so it's like I don't have a lot of options. Yeah, there's like one. And I think there's another one a little farther north, but it's in an area that's a little bit more like fancy and like touristy. So I have a feeling it's all like kind of like more higher price stuff. So, I don't know. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I, I, I have found some good stuff. The shirt that I'm wearing right now is actually one that I got there. And I quite like it. I finally washed it. And uh, this is my first time wearing it. It's got, like, a cactus on it. <laughs> and it's, I like it. It's just a, it's just a cozy crew neck sweatshirt. And, uh, yeah, I got a nice, I got a really nice um, L.L. Bean, which I don't know how popular the L.L. Bean is in uh other parts of the world but it uh like outside of north america or at least outside of the northeast ll bean is really popular up here but it's kind of expensive like i don't really i don't really buy a lot from there unless you really need something decent but i found a really nice um secondhand ll bean sweater and then it was funny there was this one thing i was just going through like liking things and then waiting until i get back to um my computer to actually kind of look at stuff to check measurements of things and by the time i got back to back home and checked on my computer i had gotten an offer from somebody who because apparently if you're if if you you can see who likes your post or whatever on there and and um like you can uh i guess they can send you an offer like give you a, a cheaper price because they want to get rid of the item or whatever. So I ended up getting a, um, a, uh, a little bit cheaper, a little bit cheaper price on this random shirt that I didn't really necessarily want, but I was just like, you know what? Why not? <laughs> so it's kind of like this grand, this like grand, somebody's grandpa's shirt. But it's like it's a similar to this, like a crew neck sweatshirt, but it has like an embroidered scene of like a deer and like a cabin and like the woods. <laughs> and it's really stupid. But I was like, you know what? They gave it they offered it for really cheap and free shipping specifically. I was like, OK, OK, I guess I'll get that. <laughs> so I got I got a random shirt on the way. And hello, folks. We got some folks on the YouTubies. Hello. This is my first time trying a YouTube. Hello, Steven and Monica. I'm trying to figure out my layout here to be able to see things. It's really, it's a mess. I wish I was able to have a better chat set up. Maybe I'll go... Yeah. I'll do something different here. Alright, I'm still kind of messing things up. Also, I saw, I saw no offense, Ella Bean is old people church clothes around here. Yeah, I mean, I imagine it's different, different places. Over here, it's more like where you buy like a decent pair of boots or a decent jacket if you really need one like that's kind of that's kind of it other than that i don't i don't do a ton uh with the ll bean like there's this one local store that uh yeah that sells it mostly around here and it's all like expensive the store is like a tourist trap type store so it's like I don't really ever go there. But yeah. <laughs> Hi, Not So Pleasant. And hello, Dreamy Lynn and Sandwich from on the YouTube. <laughs> dreamy Lynn, Dreamy from Twitch. We got, we got a double Dreamy situation. Oh, I'm making roasted chicken and squash for lunch. And 
uh, slash dinner. I just checked on the chicken. I realized I forgot the squash. It's in the fridge. Married. Oh, no. Oh, no. Too many dreamies. <laughs> Too many dreamies. It's okay. <laughs> no, you're okay. And what did I see was I'm rocking the flannel I got at the queer market last night. I feel butch today. That's fun. I also am not familiar with what a queer market is exactly. That sounds fun. I so love to thrift, but my biggest thing is I can never commit to, but yeah, that's my, I'm like wandering around and kind of searching, but I'm not really sure. It's kind of considered a luxury brand over there. Yeah, that's, I feel like that's the same thing over here. But yeah, so I was excited to find the sweatsh because I, the, the sweater that I got that was the L.L. Bean one was like, I got it for like, it was less than 20 bucks with, with shipping included. It was like maybe like 17 bucks or something, which I'm pretty sure the sweater in if i had bought it direct from ll bean would have had to have been at least 60 bucks so it was like a pretty nice deal um oh it's a cute little marketplace event that happens at a local place in my area lots of queer folks selling their wares for super that's cool that's interesting anywhere can be a queer market if you're running a store in our that's true that's true I'm still tweaking. We are going to be we're going to be um getting up to some more Calicundia today. Um god, I need to figure out the the chat situation though cuz it's just not working for me. <laughs> She's not working. She's not working. I'll have to that's the thing I got to look into at this point. We're going to try. It's okay though. So I might I might miss miss Twitch chat, especially since it's going a little bit more, it's a little bit more active. <laughs> uh oh, they sell drop bags at the flea market. Oh no, oof, oof. I'm sure that goes on where I live as well. <laughs> I'm sure. Okay, let's uh, see here. Did you finish to find Blobbert a sweetheart? Yes, we actually have a Blobbert creation. We have a creature. We have a Blobbert creature. And uh, she's she's glorious. <laughs> I, was, I finally caught up on last year. When I was laughing so hard at the BJ reveal. Yeah. You know what I want to do? I want to get into making like YouTube shorts to to post on the YouTube of like our little Twitch moments, our little stream moments and um, try out seeing how that goes. And I but I feel like I need to um, I need to like. I, I feel like I need, a, I wish I had been doing it all along throughout Calicundia, and I wish I needed to do like a little bit of backstory for those on the YouTubies that are not as familiar with good old Calicundia, you know, and it's like, do I do some goofy like, <laughs> let's, let's meet all the Calicundians, and then I just like make little videos about each household, and just like give a rundown, and then after that I start posting more clips of like actual gameplay, <laughs> I don't know, but I thought I could at least do like, I thought I'd make one that's like the creation of Blobbert and like the moments of us discovering Blobbert and in Create a Sim and everything. And then after that, I do one about the creation of BJ, <laughs> you know? <laughs> yeah, I thought make a little little videos of each household. I could just do I feel like that would just be like little snippets that, you know, have I have a little bit more going on on, on my main YouTube channel rather than like one video every once in a while, which I do plan to have another video um on uh probably it's going to be like monday is when i'll have another video out it's the cus another custom hoods video that i'll post but yeah so i think i think i might i think i'll try that yeah it'll be great for that's what i'm thinking because i feel like if i just like post some random moment of calicundia people are gonna be like what the hell is this <laughs> and what is everybody over there on the twitch smoking <laughs> what's going on over there <laughs> Did Blobber just appear in Calicundia one day? Yeah, I know. That's true. What is his true backstory? What is the Blobber true backstory? I'm looking at this. My my other screen right now is, is, uh, <laughs> I have, I have BJ on screen and Iris, which Iris has a little bit of a different look because I downloaded a different default for my bald hair where it's like stubble. So she's got a little stubble. Her hair is growing in. Maybe, maybe we'll... We'll, we'll uh, have her get hair eventually. She's growing her hair in. <laughs> Robert awoke in the depths of the desert dune. Yeah, I know. Did he come from another planet? What if he's actually an alien? 
that wait what if he's like a like a like a one of those shapeshifter creatures that's like tries to look like an animal like those not a deer where they like try to look like a, a, an animal but they they do a bad job at it so you know that they're not the, the real thing <laughs> what if he's a really he thinks he's imitating <laughs> Uh, a sim and he's doing a really bad job at it <laughs> that would be really funny <laughs> that'd be funny one of my popular tiktoks is me reacting to the sims 2 cc set which was um a flooring set from gta so i guess it would be funny when making just be funny when making the shorts yeah that's what i figured <laughs> a whole calicundi a cryptid <laughs> he's just a really bad skinwalker <laughs> that's all he is <laughs> okay let me let me uh do this. Okay, we're gonna try and swap over here to the actual video game. There we go. I'll pause my music. I had to. I've been having troubles with YouTube. Um, they got this thing now where, like, if you're using an ad blocker, it pops up and makes you take it off or something. Which, like, you can get around it, but it happens every once in a while. It's annoying. I don't like it. Also, uh. Welcome to welcome to the creation. If you are unfamiliar with with her, <laughs> with her, uh, let's see. I gotta make sure my game sound is on. Let me just do that. There we go. Okay, <laughs> here he is, <laughs> baby, baby. It's her. Iris's serving looks. I know, and she looks. Iris is currently. Oh, I hit the wrong. Oh no, this got really bad really quick. <laughs> Iris is hacking up a lung. She's actually coughing. I think her cough is. Oh, her cough is silent right now just because of the way I just started. And it's like. Oh, there she goes. Okay, yeah. So she's got a little stubble. <laughs> she got a little stubble situation. Um. <laughs> Also, I see a sandwich on YouTube. It says, Blobbert's attempt to impersonate a normal, attractive person would fail horribly in any other circumstances. But in Calicundia, he doesn't stick out that much. You're right. It's very true. Also, hi, October, on the YouTubies. Look at the creation. Look at this creature. I just don't know how she's going to age. I just don't. What is? How is it gonna change with the? What if? What if when she grows up, she just like suddenly has a face? You know. I try to pretend I'm attractive and get humbled real quick. Oh no. <laughs> oh, that's okay. I was like, is this another October or is this the October? <laughs> you know what I could do? I, I what I should do is. Oh, one second. I'm gonna click off. Is there a fight? Oh no, there's a fight happening. Okay. Folks? Folks? Okay, just a sec. I'm gonna, um... Let's see. Black words, um... I'm gonna make, I saw, I'm gonna go and on, on YouTube side, I've made, I've made Toby a, a moderator on there, just in case, and then I made, I've just made Comey a moderator. So you guys should be moderators on on the YouTube side as well. The October feels famous. <laughs> the October. A magnificent little beast. She's flattened like a cardboard box, yes. <laughs> so uh these two have had a falling out, as we can see. That's true, she is like a bow made of skin. Oh there you go, look at that. You got your fancy blue 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 name. There we go. Uh oh, poor and also Lizardina. Oh no, Lizardina is about to like pee herself, ma'am. Oh, you're gonna go play video games instead. Okay, can you just? Uh oh, Marvy caught the flu from fighting with with Iris. <laughs> okay. <laughs> There's been a blobbert breeding. There has. Must be an infamous fifth horseman of the apocalypse. Oh no, the dog just walking into the the chaos. Look at her little face. <laughs> What are your plans for the you mean on stream? Um, our plans are mainly, mainly to finish this household, which we're only playing until Wednesday, so we've just got the rest of tonight and during the day. Okay, in general, okay. Well, for this one, we're going to be playing these guys, then we're going to pick another household to play for the rest of the stream. Um, and then in general, 
probably after stream, I'm going to be continuing attempting to organize my defaults, which I've done. A, I, I finished. I got most of I got most of my um, female defaults covered, but I have some like duplicates and ones that I don't like very much. So I need to go through that. And uh, yeah, I got to I got to sort out my, my default situation. And I got some a bunch to make. <laughs> Female. Yeah, we just started the kit. Yeah, there's a lot happening. This household's filthy and disgusting. As we, I think the end of our time playing with this crew should be um, us having Iris leave Mervy and take the girlies with her. I think that's what she's going to move out and try and they're, they're going to have a final goodbye. That's I think that'll be the, the end of, of their time together. <laughs> hi, hi, Mitty on YouTube. He's just got here. What's wrong with that toddler? Good question. <laughs> good, good question. Um, her father is a monster. Her father is, uh, let's see. Her father is a sim named where is he? He's he's actually here. <laughs> he looks a little kooky. His name's Blobbert, and he's a sim that I downloaded that has a really massive face. The person who made him was able to, like, screw with the sliders in a way that they made his face huge. So we decided to try and breed him with another sim, which we decided to breed him with Iris, who is a wonderful Cyclops sim. <laughs> and we bred the two of them together. And uh, we have created this monstrosity. And I don't know, I think, I'm hoping as she ages, it will, it will, you know, do something. <laughs> but right now, look at, look at this. Look at the, I guess we've got, look at the curved edge up here. I didn't know that we have a, a, a curved edge on the uh, thumbnail limit here. That's kind of fun. <laughs> she has to grow into her facial wings. Yeah, she's, I don't know, but I like how her little bangs come forward. Okay, can we help this child exist? Okay, she smells bad. Can you come? Okay, she's getting into the dog bed. I guess she's gonna sleep. Yeah, she's just a lot. She's a lot. <laughs> she's even a lot for me, and I really like some weird sibs. Okay, it's 1 a.m. How about you go to sleep? And then... You're tired, too. This dog's filthy. I'll, also, the, oh, you know what? The dog is... I don't think the dog's supposed to be in here. I'm going to turn on move objects. I think he got reset in here because I locked the doors for no pets. Right? Didn't I? Wait. Yeah, I have that one locked for pets. Did I not lock this one? No, I, I have them both locked. So I think he got accidentally, like, reset in here. Oh, no. Look at his bed. Can you come and clean this poor dog's bed? Oh, he's peeing. Oh, he was peeing inside the house. Is it going to... Oh, oh, yeah, he... He glitched in there for like a, I, got, I thought I got him one of those chewies. Yeah, out here. This is one of these, the custom chewies that is like a greenie and it helps their hygiene. That I forget who it was that turned me on to those, but they're, they're very good. Yeah, I wonder if it'll smooth out when she's a t uh, an adult like Blobbert. Yeah. I'm hoping. Um... She has to grow into her facial exaggeration. <laughs> Calicundia interiors are quite exquisite. As unique as the faces. That little alien. Yeah, I like the little alien dude. I love this. I actually really, really love how this, this house turned out. I think it's great. Um, Mervy is, is, of course, going to be staying here. We've got this wonderful... I love the... Um, we don't get to see this often because this wall is usually down, but we have like a a cool little... Uh, what, what do you want to say? Like a little... A little detail on the on the archway. So he's got little curtains, like a little uh, cover. Okay. Oh, I forgot you're sick. And you're out here cleaning. That's okay. Um, how about you nap? See, the other issue is we don't have enough beds. <laughs> we don't have enough beds. So everybody's fighting for this bed. <laughs> I think, I don't know. That's a good question. Should Iris take the dog? I'm not sure. Should, I guess, I guess... I feel like, I think I might have Mervy keep him. I f or her. I think it's actually a her. I think the dog is a she. Yeah, it's a girly. The snorkel's a girly. I think that I might have the doggy stay with Mervy. 
<laughs> Iris needs to take the alien, yo. <laughs> I, I'm gonna end up forgetting. Iris is gonna take the alien with her and then use it as a, a decoration. She's gonna put it up in the window of her new house so every time Murphy walks by, he sees it. <laughs> All I know is that, uh, oh wait, I read that. <laughs> lays on the couch, toddler lays on the dog bed, other sims lay in bed, yes. Oh, par Snorkel's starving? Oh. He's got food. Come eat. Why can't I, uh, have him eat? There's something wrong with this? He's not finicky. She's not finicky. I might- I'm gonna cheat her hunger a little bit just because it's a dog. I don't care. It's a dog. Yeah, that'll work. Custody battle. Not for the kids, but the inflatable alien. Yes. <laughs> yes. There we go. We got some fresh food. Maybe he'll... There we go. He'll go for it now. Can you go here? Maybe fill this in? Maybe take a nice little shower? I guess in the morning we'll have Murphy go to work again. I feel like Iris is going to refuse to go to work with him. I feel like they're at a place where she doesn't want anything to do with him. But maybe she should come anyway. Just... Just because, I guess. <laughs> Just because. <laughs> Hello, beauty queen. <laughs> My cat will only eat fried food, so it's not unrealistic. Eat fried food? Oh no. <laughs> Where are the enemies now? Yeah, that's a good question. So what ended up happening was, um, it was actually when Iris and Blobbert got together, they woohooed and um, got, got uh, created BJ they um oh fresh food <laughs> i was like is your cat okay <laughs> is your cat alive still <laughs> um but so blobbert and uh iris woohooed in here and murphy was right here and apparently he de decided he didn't like it he came running in and like like screamed started screaming at her and they started having a slap fight so that's what that's what ended up happening between the two of them and they've just hated each other since, which I wanted them to start having a falling out anyway, because I think Iris is outgrown this house. So, and I think she's going to readopt her kids that she put up for adoption. She's going to take them back. And then, yeah, going to find herself a new house. I think that's what's going to happen. She does like sweets, though. And, oh, she'll eat cake if you leave it out. Interesting. I kn I've known cats that like lick butter. I think that's common for cats to, like, if you leave butter out, they'll lick that and stuff. Um, also, I saw Dino, could, could she leave him while he's at work? I think that could, that's also actually a good, maybe she won't go to work with him today because of that. Like, she'll, she'll stay home because it's Wednesday, so this is the last day, so we'll have him at work. And then when we come home, we'll have her leave him. Maybe we'll have them argue one t last time. And, uh, that'll be that. <laughs> oh, I hear cats have a creams tooth instead of a tweet sweet tooth. Oh my god, I can't say words. Trash the house. Oh no. <laughs> Unfortunately, I do have the... Can you just go to the bathroom? Oh, I forgot I have my little shortcuts. Why are my... Are my sims... Free will is on. I don't know why they won't... That's the second time that one of them has, like, complained and not just gone to in. I don't know. That's okay. Got it sorted out. My cat once stole an entire box of 20 McDonald's chicken nuggets. I had to wrestle them from his jaw. Oh my goodness. That's funny. <laughs> I could I could see that. I could see a cat doing that. Yeah, we'll have to have them uh have her kind of pack up. What 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 is Iris gonna take? We know she's gonna take the she's already does she have a bunch of random no. Okay, we can take this. She's going to gather things before Murphy's awake and then hope he doesn't notice. I think this was originally from her inventory. Remember, she had a bunch of stuff. I think this was also. Um, I don't want to mess up the decor too much because <laughs> I like the look. But I don't I think I think this was Murphy's. But would she take this? She might take this TV. She might take the TV. Oh, she needs this. This is her picture of Perb and her. That's her and Perb doing doing stuff. I think maybe the TV. We'll, we'll do that. We'll, we'll keep thinking about it as we're going here. 
Okay. It's almost morning time. Um. <laughs> my oh my old cat once stole bacon sandwich, not the bacon, the whole sandwich bread included. That's funny. My cat always steals bits of cabbage and then runs around growling with it in her mouth. Thank you for the follow, Squeeps. Also, just a sad egg followed 21 minutes ago, and I forgot to say thank you. I, th I think. Thank you. <laughs> thank you, thank you for the follows. <laughs> oh, he's the same one in your profile picture. Okay. Interesting. How many nice points is she? Ooh. She's low. She's four. She's four nice points. <laughs> and she's hacking up a lung. I did take a rock out of a kid's mouth two weeks ago at work, so I get having <laughs> get having to take nuggets. For it. You know what? One time I did take Olive. Um, I we took I took Olive for a walk around just around the the edge of like our, the property, which is like there's a big field and stuff, and it's like woods and like a ravine. So there's like a lot of wildlife that comes and goes, and apparently. At some point, a fox had gotten into, like, my neighbor's chicken coop, because it wasn't one of my chickens, it was somebody else's. And I was walking, and all of a sudden, Olive had something in her mouth. They're fighting again. <laughs> These two are a mess. Good morning, Mervy. Um, okay, October, October, Toby, <laughs> I don't know what to say. <laughs> no problem. And, uh, I was walking, all of a sudden, Olive has something in her mouth. And it's, I, I tried to pry her mouth open to figure out what was in her mouth. I finally got it open enough to pull it out and a entire like severed chicken head came out partially out of her mouth. And then I had to fight with her to get it all the way out. It's like, just like the whole chicken head. <laughs> it was a mess. It was gross. I don't know what picture. Oh, the olive, the baby. It's a baby. Yeah. <laughs> it was gross. It was very gross. <laughs> okay, thank you for the, for work in Gabriel. <laughs> uh, for what in universe reason are Iris and Murphy fighting? Did Iris decide she's better? I think so. I don't know. I guess I don't know if we want to use the moment of because Murphy, of course, actually got mad at Iris because of her woohooing with Bo Blobbert, but um. The, I don't know if we want to like say that's truly it, if they already, I think Iris is tired of Mervy and his crap. Like she's, she realizes she's better. Like she was originally a townie wandering the streets and then she got, she got lucky and, and got a home with Mervy. But then she was like, you know what? This guy's not all he cracked, he's cracked up to be. She can only focus on one man at a time. But like, I feel like Iris is like, he's a, he, Mervy is simply a stepping stone on Iris's path to success. <laughs> BJ in the background just uh oh. BJ's in the toilet. You know what I mean? I think I think that Iris is gonna be making money off of people's for child support. Like that's her thing. She might she might get into a little black widow business down the line maybe a little bit of you know making money off the folks. You know <laughs> by by killing them. Who knows? She might, you know I forget is she a swiper? Does she, what are her traits again? She's not. She is a born star. She's star quality. We talked about her getting into show business career, which I'm, I think would be cool. Um, she's mean spirited, though, which is interesting. But she's flirty and irresistible and charismatic. I feel like she's a little swindler. She's she's something. Anyway, I think it's time for Mervy to go to work. Mervy wants to fall in love with Melba. Look, he wants and he wants Melba. <gasps> he wants Melba. OK, we're going to have you go somewhere, buddy. I'll have Marvy go to work for the day. <laughs> PJ in the background out of context. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> you know. We'll just it's just gonna be him. Uh <laughs> also he brought me live spiders, which I have a fear of. Oh no. I think I missed the most of that conversation. Oh, I had the same 
The same cat I had uh, was also a crab hunter. He didn't bring me mice or anything, only worms and wet wipes. I love that, though. That's funny. That's funny. Yeah, Olive is a... If Olive, if I'm walking and Olive starts to roll on something, it either means it's poop or something dead. So that's all, that's all I, uh... <laughs> that, that, I, that's all I know. <laughs> Hi, Kaylee. You just finished catching up on last stream and wiping away the tears of laughter from PJ's face reveal. <laughs> Happy to see more of this creature so soon. I can't wait for her to age up. I really can't wait. <laughs> Hi, Miss Player. Okay, glad to see you streaming on YouTube. I don't have Twitch. Yeah, that's what I figured is for people who prefer YouTube, maybe it would be a cool a cool thing. Let's see how it goes. And I am I'm streaming on both in case anybody who is new is here and does is confused if if you see me talking to to somebody in chat who's not in your chat, it means they're probably in the other chat. <laughs> I'm I'm simul streaming on both Twitch and YouTube at the same time. Although YouTube folks will be able to see the Twitch chat on screen. So that'll be, that's something. It's too bad that the Twitch folks can't see the YouTube chat on screen. <laughs> that would work. But, okay, you're, you're here. Also, ha happy, happy early birthday, Miss Player. Miss Player 30 in the YouTube chat says it's their birthday tomorrow. <laughs> yes, happy birthday. Okay, let's call in employees. I'm going to move our sign back around. I had to move it before when the... Oh, also, there, I, last time I was having an issue, um, let's open business and call in employees. I was having an issue, like, where whenever I clicked on his car, it would, like, glitch out and stuff, and, like, I had some weird issues last time. I realized that I went and installed, I'm glad, that, I'm glad my game didn't explode, but I went, I accidentally installed the standalone Visit Sims mod, and the, and the, um, Regular story progression at the same. I had both of them at the same time. Plus, I also had had that other thing. What was it that I had? Oh, I had the community time mod by accident too. I went and shoved them all in together. That was so stupid. <laughs> I figured it out. Wait, so is Dreamer still the most beautiful creature? Twitch and YouTube crossing the streams. Yes. Um, I don't. I think. I think the Dreamer is still the most. I feel like. I think so, because I like that Dreamer still looks like a human or a sim, right? Whereas it's so hard with with like the creature that we've created, BJ, to see them as a human. OK, this girly Leona needs some help. Can we talk to can we talk about Leona? Can we do Gussie up. Um, can I do like a quick plan outfit moment? OK, we're talking to Abe. I don't know if it's a mod I have. Oh, this is kind of a nice little old lady shirt. There we go. There you go, Leona. Also, your do she doesn't have her right hair. I'm going to give her a different hair. Um, One of the things, I don't know if I have a mod that causes it, but I have like a lot of NPC sims showing up. And of course, in, in attempting to make Calicundia kind of a integrated hood, I did... Um, I did try to have like townies do npc jobs so i did the thing where you put like a townies appearance onto npcs right but that means that technically there's like two of those townies existing one's the npc version one's the real version if that makes sense and i don't know how i'm liking that especially because i'm having them show they, they keep showing up on my businesses so i'm getting like i don't think this is the real abe i think this is npc abe that's down here below and I'm not really liking that. I think I might go back, backtrack a little bit on some of the integrated hood stuff. I don't know. I'm still figuring it out. I do, I'm pretty sure I have a default replacement of pretty much the same hair. Yeah, this is the exact hair Leona had that was when she, when I had the custom hair in. So we're going to give her her hair back. Give her some brows. There we go. But... Dreamer and BJ have to have a beauty contest when they're older. We gotta have like an overall beauty contest. That'd be fun. Put him in a room with a bunch of compatible sims and see who gets the most swoons. Wait, that's that's really good. Yeah, how would you... Like you could have him dress up and do like... Do a back and forth, do a little like walk on a catwalk or something. Ooh, I'm gonna turn my headset down just a little. 
Let me know if the game is too loud at all, ever. I, so it seems like sometimes it's loud and sometimes it's not. Depends on what's going on. If lots of sims are talking, it's one thing. I'm going to have him go business, be salesperson. <laughs> oh no, Laszlo's wheat. Oh, Laszlo's herbs. Laszlo's herbs aren't doing well. Uh-oh, is that that's the business? Oh, I didn't see. I don't know if I saw your message. I might have missed it. Oh, your birthday is tomorrow too. I think I did. I might have got got talking. <laughs> I might got. I might have got talking. But happy birthday to you as well. Well, birthday twins. <laughs> did I? I missed the part where BJ was introduced. Oh wait, I missed that message too. See, my chat is a little bit smaller be because I've got the YouTube chat up too, so I'm missing things. So feel free to remind me if um, I do skip past something by accident. Wish I can like see a thread. So, oh, okay. And now I wonder if I should just ask who they are or just wait. You'll see very soon. <laughs> You'll see who, who BJ is. BJ is a wonderful creation. Dreamer is body horror while BJ is eldritch horror. You're correct, Sandwich. I think you're correct. That's that's a good way to there there are two different kinds of beautiful. <laughs> two different kinds of beautiful. Oh, he has to grow the herbs for it. Okay, so the actual growing isn't doing well. What are you having him grow? Where are you like is he are you do you have like some kind of just like random plant that's like his 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 herbs? Or do you have do you have like an actual custom It's a mod. Okay, interesting. I didn't know that that there was that out there. <laughs> it is a dark and terrible knowledge, I must warn you. Okay, Murphy's... I think I might... It's possible that at some point I might re reorganize some of this because we have a lot of congestion here. Because I don't know if it's... I don't know if Sims prefer to shop closer to the register. I mean, we get some folks out here sometimes, but not as much. I'm thinking about... I don't know. What if we made, like, a bigger counter space? For, for our man Rio here, our main man. Rio's like the one carrying this business on his back. But if we made like a just a, a bigger space here without with nothing to buy, just decor, and then have this all out here, I think that might be good. Um. Oh, you can get Garden Plus from Garden Kaga. You can only grow weed in it. Interesting. Yeah, somebody um, in the Twitch chat is going to have a, uh, a birthday tomorrow as well. <laughs> yeah, I wish there was a way to have an inter a, uh, integrated chat all in one moment, but... Oh, we got a rank 6. How high can you... I th for, why did I think that rank 5 was the highest you could go? Is it 10? Is 10 the highest? That's interesting. Where's you? Okay, cleaning up. What are you cleaning up? Was that like cockroaches? Oh, you're hungry. Oh, you're kind of. Oh, you're kind of a mess. What can we? We have anything? Is there anything? Maybe that's what I really need to do. Is like, here we're gonna do some business re rearranging. Oops, I didn't mean to grab that. I want the whole table. Let's do some rearranging here. We're gonna put you out here. Murphy has has made some money and is gonna kind of put put the money back into his business for the first time in his entire life. Goes up to 10. Okay, I didn't even realize. I think I was thinking 5 was the top. I'm just going to delete some of these silly little random stuff. Okay, we're going to do this. Let's take... Oh, I just realized that my, my game music is off. Let me turn that back on. Listen to love music in Greatest Sim here. Not create a sim. There we go. It's it's kind of quiet, but let's see. Like, can I get away with? We want obviously we want space for people to uh, line up. But what if I do like this, and then I do like a a wall? Um. And then another door here, and it's like their little space where they can go take care of themselves and stuff. Like their needs. I think that could help. Thank you for the lurk cursive.
Do, 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 do. I think that worked pretty well. Soon his shop will be the best shop in the hood and he'll become rich. Even though he still lives- yeah, I know. I think he's, he spends all his money on, like, probably on, like, beer and women. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like that's that's what that's Murphy's money doesn't go into his living situation. It goes into other things. Oh, I need to obviously I need like something. Well, I could just do that. I guess that works. I don't know what to do for like a wall. I guess I can. If we did like a little wood, or just like all wood, that'd be kind of funny. They just put up a quick little wooden wall. like little moment here and then they can just have like a mini fridge and stuff here we gotta get we gotta get this in here place to sit or maybe maybe a couple of little ones just a couple of random chairs I think that could be good and then we just need, like, a little fridge and stuff. No, I don't think you missed much, uh, not so pleasant. I think we kind of just started our day at Murphy's business here. I guess, I guess. Nothing really important. I just want, like, a random counter piece. Something like that. Um, I don't know what else would they need out here. Maybe like a little see if I put a TV, everybody's gonna be trying to get to it. <laughs> yeah, Murphy doesn't want doesn't want to go home. That's why he's got his little business. He has the vibe that his taste in alcohol would not improve as he gets richer. <laughs> He'll buy the same cat piss flavor beer, he can just afford it. <laughs> he just oh, he can just afford more of it, yeah. That's <laughs> I think that's correct. I think that's true for what he would be up to. Let's have like a, a phone back here. And I don't know. I don't really know what else. Maybe a little radio? I got a little radio going. Have that. Maybe something. Maybe just like a poster. We need like. I need to. You know what I need to make is a bunch of like recolors for some of these like these type posters. And it's just like little pinup pictures like like uh, of random sims and stuff i think that would be fun i bet that exists somewhere but i feel like that's what they'd have is like some pinup old-fashioned looking pinup of some lady back here i don't know that i have anything really like that i have this random picture of bella goth <laughs> there we'll put a picture of bella goth laying down that's their pinup picture <laughs> we need a poster of herb oldies arrest you're true you're true. You're right. <laughs> That's true. That was a combination of the two. <laughs> also, I miss. Also, Laszlo and Vidkind just had their uh, alien babies. Vidkind had a girl named Venus and Laszlo, a boy named Jupiter. I like those names. Um, wait, do I have one? Of oh, of like a pinup thing? I don't know. You have. You true. <laughs> you true. Anyway, we'll do this. We'll have a little bit more space. I don't know what else I can put in here. What if we put like a little fake plant? Like a really ugly, obviously fake plant. You know what we could do? Do I have... I have... This is a Sim Blender. We'll put that there. We'll get, we'll get some use out of it. And then we'll... Make some space. I'm trying... My, I need to get a new mouse. My mouse is driving me nuts. Whenever I try to use my scroll, it doesn't work right. I don't know... I don't know why. Um, let's delete a couple of these less popular things that don't really sell. We'll get it. We'll get this in here. Um, I feel like it's just crap everywhere. That's just kind of Murphy's vibe. It's just crap. Okay, well, I love this chair, but uh, I guess we'll get rid of it for now just because we've had it there a while. There's probably like 20 versions of that chair in people's inventories by this point. Are these not for sale? Oh, they are. Okay, make sure everything I just... Everything's for sale. Okay. 
Oh, whoops, there's like a little coffee maker. I can shove that somewhere. Okay. I guess I can delete this dog stuff for right now. Okay, I think that'll be... That'll be good. And then I'm gonna pause this lock. Employees and household only. Lock. Employees and household only. Oops. There we go. There we go. Have some lunch. Have an instant meal. Uh-oh. This girlie needs help. Lucia, you gotta wait. We're eating. We're eating, Lucia. Oh, there's a pinup poster made by DD Sims. Okay, I'll have to try to remember that. I mean, I, I'm not surprised. It's gotta be out there somewhere. Okay, there we go. Uh-oh, not the cat getting in the way. Hello? I'm gonna delete this friggin' cat. I don't care. <laughs> I don't know, that's probably bad, but I don't care. I was trying to get to the couch and scratch it. It was a familiar. Oh, it's a recolor of a poster from uni. Okay. Sir, what are you doing? Okay, you're headed... Okay, he just walked right through all those doors. Oh, she just brought her cat back. <laughs> She's laughing. Okay. She's like, oh, you want to delete my cat? I'll see about that. <laughs> I'll see about that. Oh, it's the man, the myth, the legend. Look, it's the face. It's Mr. So this is for those who are, are not so familiar or like, what the hell's going on? I nut her. <laughs> okay, butt spot. This is Mr. This is Blobbert T. Nuttis. And uh, he's he is the father of BJ. So just just as a <laughs> some an educational moment here. <laughs> this is the man, the myth, the legend, Blobbert. What did Buttspot say? I've seen custom calendars around. C would be Sir Nuts, Sir Nutsid, if no one made a nut up version. Ooh, a nut up version. Okay. I still gotta fix Blobbert's shirt situation. I forgot about it. Uh oh. Everybody's getting mad. Uh oh. We're going downhill. Murphy's Murphy's being a flop. We gotta go help the folks. Lucia's still over here wondering. Oh, Murphy wants to buy a hot tub. Murphy's like, hmm, I need to invest. <laughs> Great, now I gotta draw a nut as a nut as a pinup girl. <laughs> that, that that would be that would be cute. <laughs> okay, no problem, Toby. I know you can't hear me, but okay. <laughs> I'm really crying. What is that? He is a creation. <laughs> He's supposed to have an invisible shirt. Um, but I accidentally took out, I guess I accidentally took out the CC for the invisible shirt, so I gotta put it back in. I gotta dig it back up. Um, that's that. He's supposed to just be a floating face, but it's goofing. Sign language appreciated, okay. <laughs> okay, are we helping the folks? Alright. What are you doing? I'm gonna make him just happy for now. It's because he's being obnoxious. Oh my god, what did- Oh, oh my god, Doomface, your color is the exact same color as Buttspot's on my screen. And I was like, oh my god, what did Buttspot say? And then I said, and like, there's no nut in that, in that sentence. And then I realized it wasn't Buttspot. <laughs> Blobbert said it's the shape of a toilet seat. That's so true, though. <laughs> That's so true. <laughs> also, Buttspot above said, what a plea nut. I see Blobbert's face. Okay. Okay, fun spot. Also, BJ is short for Blobbert Jr. <laughs> the mystery unfolds. Yes, Blobbert Jr. What was our other... Oh, somebody said that... I think we were in the Discord. We were talking... I think it was Bex that we were talking about. Uh, she compared Blobbert... I mean, BJ to the Demogorgon from Stranger Things. And I feel like maybe BJ's full name secretly could be Blobagorgon Jr. <laughs> but we'll have to see how she ages if if that stays as she gets older. Uh, she she swapped his clothes with a torso less lady. Oh, yeah, that's true. That's what. It's not fair. He needs his invisible torso, man. Doomface, the local butt spot cosplayer. <laughs> oh no. Okay, he is restocking, which is good. Yeah, we might need to hire a restocker. 
Okay, things are... Ooh, it's like a little bit choppy. My game's being like a little bit choppy. <laughs> yeah, the, 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 the sassy alligator. I think this is from... I don't know how to pronounce their... Oh, oh I, I selected the wrong thing. Top Hat Alligator. I think it's from The Sims 3. It's a conversion. Yeah, by... I don't know how to say their name. Hafiz. H-A-F-I-S-E-A-Z-A-L-E. I know they have a couple of... Like, I think they have a live journal and another website. One of them, all the links work, and one of them it doesn't. <laughs> but yeah, Top Hat Alligator. Probably if you looked up maybe that for, like, Converted for The Sims 2, you might find it. <laughs> He's a pretty great little guy. I don't use him enough. Next year, Halloween costume, a toilet seat with nude stockings stretched over the construction and construction paper facial features glued on. Oh no, <laughs> that's so true. Yes, the Blavagorgon. The Blavagorgon. I love that. I love Blavagorgon for her. See, my other issue, I'm gonna... I'm gonna edit... Let me edit my layout. I can't see if I need to like roll ads and stuff. That's my other issue. So we're gonna we're gonna do this. Okay, yeah, it's like I got like a, a minute before I have to roll an ad on the Twitch side of things. There we go. There we go. Okay. Sorry, it's quiet for a sec because I clicked off the game. <laughs> Blaba Jorgen. Wait, that's pretty good. Blaba Jorgen or BJ? I'm reminded of someone preferring cheap fast food over expensive high-class meal. <laughs> Next Halloween, everyone has to dress up as Blobbert. <laughs> Blobbert Halloween contest. Oh, next year? Yeah, I already read the, the, the toilet seat with stockings. That's the smoothest alligator I've ever seen. Need a Blobbert contest or just a Calicundia <laughs> Halloween contest. I feel like this workday went by fast. Yeah, see, everybody's trying to get in here. That's annoying. Maybe we need... Do we need some vending machines? Is that the next step for our business? A couple of vending machines? I don't know where the best place for them to be is. It feels like they could squeeze in here, but then everybody's going to be standing here. Because they, they attract a lot of attention. I also have these custom ones that are fun. I think these are from The Sims 3. Maybe right here. We'll put some fun ones, and then I think do I have to just go like this? Yeah, eight, six, eight. Yeah, okay. That way, maybe the folks can like take care of their hunger a little. Is she go headed for that? Not this cat again. I'm gonna ban the cat. Are we gonna have to? I'm gonna, gonna uh, maybe maybe to control the cat. I need to. Let's see. What if I did this to stop the cat from doing what it's doing? Because <laughs> the cat's trying to go scratch stuff. And he can't get in there. That's what, and then he bumps everybody out of the way. Here you go, cat. You got, you got your own personal scratching post. Go for it. Go for it. <laughs> Everyone has a piece of blobber of the blobber costume, and they all merge together to make one giant blobber. <laughs> there we go. I think that this is maybe a good, a good decision. Uh. Diego has apparently shaved off his eyebrows, which is which is interesting. How about we give his him his eyebrows back? <laughs> I like how Diego is like he he just he's got a he's kind of one of the cute ones. Like Diego's one of the good looking boys, you know. <laughs> he's he's one of the cuties, just a little bit. I'll give him some thick brows. So I use the Cinema Secrets lighting mod, but I also use Reshade, which bumps up the saturation and stuff, too. Um, let's see. I think that's my, my default command on, on that page. My, uh, just on my website, sundogsims.com, there's a, I have a page of, like, all the different mods, and there's, in that listing of mods, there's a, oh. Okay, Diego just kissed this random girly. Okay. But yeah, in that listing is my my lighting mods. 
He's got the big doe eyes. He does. Also, Millie witnessed this, the the kiss. Millie witnessed. She and Millie's the Millie's the right hand cult leader. Millie's the, one of the cult, like the higher up cult leaders of Wisdom's cult, which Wisdom is Diego's girlfriend, and she's like working on killing Diego. <laughs> Diego enjoying his last days of freedom before being offered to a cow plant. Yes, exactly. That's like, literally, I feel like Millie's spying on him. You think that maybe Wisdom won't let Diego leave the compound without, without, like, a chaperone. So that's why Millie's here. <laughs> what are we going to do with the pretty NPCs that spawn in this hood? Surgery them? Yeah, so at this point, there's pretty much no pretty NPCs. This one sim that is prettier looking is actually... Uh, one of our pretty sims that I gave an NPC job to. So she's one of the few, like, pr normal sims. Um, so that's why she looks like that. But at this point, I all of the NPCs have either been um, given plastic surgery to look kooky or have been had their appearances replaced in, um, in Sim PE with some of my townies to make it look like the townies are working the NPC jobs. However, I've, like I, I was talking about it a little bit earlier, I didn't, I, I don't love that as much anymore. I think I might go ahead and just make up some random Calicundian Sims to throw into those NPC jobs and not have them be like sharing an appearance with any other Sim. They're just their own. Um, so I don't know. With an eagle eye, a sure hand, and some sh sure, some pure stick to itness. Murphy can keep merchandise flowing to a serious crowd. Congrats on earning a gold stocking talent badge. Okay, we're getting all the badges. The only one he doesn't have gold is register, but he never runs the register anymore, so. And I think I think Rio has a gold register badge. Yeah. So we're doing pretty good. I think maybe we need to hire somebody else though. I think uh we'll probably close up the shop pretty quick here too. It's like 9 p.m. Diego reminds me of the precious moments figurines. Oh no. Also, last time I checked in with the Calicundia Wisdom was plotting to get rid of Diego, so I'm glad to see he's still kicking. <laughs> yeah, we haven't replayed their household yet. Um, we could. We could play their household. Um, we gotta figure out who we're playing next after this, because this is the last day of this time with this household. That person was swooning Blobbert. Oh, were they? Where did Blobbert go? Where? Oh, Blobbert's over here. Hello, Blobby. Blobbert T. Nuttis. Oh, you're all right. No problem. <laughs> you don't need to. You don't have to say that you're lurking or anything. Some people like to just just because, but you you don't have to at all. <laughs> I can't wait for the inevitably and inevitably use university for this hood. Your community will have fun creating. Yeah, that's the thing. We gotta figure out how I'm gonna do the university, cause that'll be fun. We could make we can make dormies. Um, we might wait a couple rounds. We'll see. We'll see how it goes. Um, we got olive oil. What do we get? Oh, did it not pop up or did I miss it? Oh, it's a little broken picture. Oh no. Wait, I'm gonna refund you that. I'll refund you your points. I don't know why it's a broken picture. There we go. You got your points back. Not so pleasant. I don't know. That was broken. You can try it again if you want to. <laughs> or I don't know if it'll let you. Well, maybe if I refunded it, it would. It might be a cooldown still. <laughs> okay, we're having a... These two are having a silent moment here. I gotta figure out what one is doing that and why. Okay, you're doing that. Okay, I think we gotta shut down business. <laughs> okay, yeah, let's try again. I wish I could re-roll it manually, but it doesn't let me. Yeah, I gotta figure out what it is that's making it do that. Okay, we're gonna... Okay, can you just stop for a sec? Just calm down, sir. Just take a bre bre breath. <gasps> maybe we need a... Maybe we need a toilet. I mean, not a toilet, a little shower in here. Okay, yeah, there, there's probably a cool down for it. Cause I didn't want some somebody some jerk to come in and spam it because since it's only the one one point redemption, I didn't want somebody to come in and spam it and just like block the screen. <laughs> you know what I mean? Okay, we're waiting in line here, sir. 
are you are we are we um are we gonna do the thing i think that somebody's having a meltdown management sent home for the day uh-oh he's he's kind of going through it right now do i need to i think rio's having a breakdown he's disgusted by her Let's tell him to go, and we'll we'll ring up these customers. There we go. Okay. Uh oh, they're having meltdowns. No. No. Do you think that weed should be legal in Strange Town? That's a good. Hmm. I feel like. Oh God. Flora's having a, a breakdown. We just lost customers. We're losing customers. Ay ay ay. <laughs> All these gorgeous sims in one room got me acting on why. <laughs> this is going. <laughs> um, but I feel like I feel like Strange Town, because it's like is like an old military town, it's probably still run by military. I feel like maybe it isn't yet. Um, but I don't know. Maybe it would be at the- I think it, it wouldn't be, but literally no one cares. Yeah, that's- I feel like- I don't know. Yeah, something like that. I'd fire him. Yeah, he- well, I think he just had, like, a glitched moment. Like, he- I think he's stuck. Is it because I- is it because I moved him and he'd never really sort out- has he not been doing his job at all this whole time? Okay, see, he just- okay. I- because I moved him with- move objects maybe that's what's goofed him also hi belly aches hello hi contessa can i help you contessa like why are you here contessa I'm gonna chat is contessa our next lover let's drive home stop looking at the werewolf poster i forgot that we had all our posters on this wall that works look at our look at our vidkin uh calendar oops let me zoom out look at our little vidkin calendar Look at all our other posters. I hope General Buzz goes to his weed shop when Lazo sets it up. That'd be funny. Maybe he secretly is uh, getting in on the medical c weed. Maybe that's what it's like. You gotta have a medical card. <laughs> and Lazlo uh, has glaucoma or something where he, he can try and <laughs> he can get his weed. All right, we are finally going home. He's filthy and disgusting, and his girlfriend is about to leave him. Also, it's 2 a.m. on Thursday, so like... Oh, God, look at this. Look at this family. Look at this beautiful, glorious family. <laughs> I never use them. Yeah, I like having a little calendar every once in a while. Hanging out. I think Buzz would uh, be heavily against it in... Um, public, but rips his bonus <laughs> as he's home. Yeah, he does like a little... I feel like he's like a little joint man. Like he's just like a little casual. Like the the bong probably feels like too much for him. So I think I forget who it was that said they don't know who BJ is. Somebody mentioned B, who's BJ, and I'm afraid to find out. Here's this is BJ. <laughs> this is BJ. She's 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 really cute. She's got a really she's got really nice eyes, and she's you know she's just a really cute little little kid. <laughs> Filthy and disgusting. His girlfriend is about to leave him. Yeah, <laughs> that's him. It's legal to own weed here, but not sell it. It doesn't make a lot. Of, yeah, that's weird. Over in Vermont, which I live really close to Vermont, they, they, I think, unless they've changed it, you can grow your own, but you're not allowed to like sell it or buy it. But you can grow it. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> she, she looks like a, I don't know, Dillo, Dill, Dillo, Saurus. <laughs> they want you to put the work in for it, yeah. And it's like, you can only have up to two plants per household or something, or per resident. And I don't, I don't know a lot about weed, but I don't know if that's like, would be enough to get you through like a year or something. Yeah, I think... I've, you know, I've never partook in the hoeed and the weed, but I've always said when I can just like 
order it on the Amazon. <laughs> just go go on to my my the online and just order a box of, of the weed. That's when I'll probably get into it. <laughs> I, I can't be bothered to be out here <laughs> secretly growing it <laughs> in my basement or something. <laughs> like that's too much work. Those frilled dinosaurs. Okay, yeah. <laughs> I was thinking Triceratops, interesting also. Also, it's like past the time that we're supposed to be uh, leaving this household. So what, is there anything else that she's going to take with her? Because she's about to leave. Iris is going to leave the man. Is there anything else she's going to take? We're going to take, because the kid's coming with us, so let's take any kid stuff. Oops, I don't think I put that in. There we go. Uh, we'll leave the dog stuff. We've got to take this. Um, we'll leave the doggy bed. The doggy's inside here. Um, I don't think there's too much else to really take. Maybe we can take, like, a flamingo. We'll steal one. Steal a flamingo. Take his hot tub and sell it. That's true. He's got, like, two at the shop. She's gonna steal his hot tub. I think that's... she. I think this was bought for her, specifically. I think because she has a her lifetime wish has to do with maxing her body skill. We could do that. I think that'll be good. Um, oh, Buzz definitely used to get high with Lila back in high school. I think that's a good that's a good one. I think so. So since your business is like ring six, I wonder if you'll use the business benefits to help with the shop. Yeah, I did get some of the business benefits last time I played. I I, I had a few to redeem. Um, I hadn't redeemed in in at all so i had like quite a few gathered up i think i went down the networking route with him but um yeah i could go down a different route too i think the curiouses are pretty firmly established as the strange town weed men <laughs> but i wonder who would be in pleasant view that's true mr burb that's fun mr burb secretly has a bunch of weed in his greenhouse i like that uh who, who else in pleasant view would be growing weed doing the weed Okay, she's going to use, I guess, she's got to use this find own place like this. She's leaving. They already had a fight this morning. I think he's asleep. Look, she's going to leave while he's asleep. She's going to take all his stuff while he's sleeping. <laughs> Daniel, maybe that's interesting, but Daniel is an athlete. He's a professional. He's a coach. Dust, oh, that's true. Dustin and probably like all the teens. Yeah, Lilith and Dirk. Darren. Oh, Dar that's true. Darren. Darren seems correct for that. Lilith steals Daniel's weed and sells it to her friends. Wait, that's great. Or or Dirk steals Darren's weed and sells it to her friends, too. I feel like that could work. Okay, what? Okay, we can choose. BJ's coming with us and Lizardina. So we're leaving Mervy and Snorkel. He's gonna leave. <laughs> Everybody's just leaving in the silence of the night. Dun, dun, dun. The Brokes, that's true. Canon that Brandy has substance abuse issues, that's true, so she she might be making some money. Uh-oh, he got up and ran outside. I know he's just gonna wave, because that's what they do, but it looks like he's like, oh my god, they're leaving. Look at him, he's just, he came running out, stared at him. Oh, I just watched the toddler. Oh, he he didn't wave. He never waved, he just stared at them through the window. Okay. Interesting. Are we... Are y'all you, are you leaving? Okay. Why are we just sitting here? I, I don't want it to... <laughs> I didn't want us to go too far into Thursday. Are we... Why are they... Oh. She's gone. <laughs> That's all she wrote, boys. <laughs> I'm gonna save. So that's the end of our time playing this household. Um, we gotta pick somebody else. Also, I was supposed to roll a stupid ad on, on the Twitch side here. I'm gonna roll a Twitch ad real quick. While we, we go back out into the neighborhood. Um, she enjoys grape juice and tin foil. She enjoys grape juice and nut in tin foil. What is the tin foil supposed to be? Am I being oblivious? Mervy is like, so long, suckers. <laughs> is that supposed to be... I think Darren is the type of a dad to let his kids drink and smoke as long as it's in his house. Like a, I was about to say, like, the mean girl's mom. <laughs> I think they would only give weed to each other as gifts. That's true. 
I think it's going to be hard to find another house for Iris unless you have an apartment. Yeah, I'm, I'm probably just going to let her buy a house. I do have one house. Um, thank you for the raid, Brianna. <laughs> Welcome in. Hello, hello. I hope you guys had a good stream. Was you playing? Yeah, it looks like you were playing some Sims 2. Were you playing a, a custom hood or a pre-made hood? <laughs> welcome, welcome. My chat's small. I'm going to try and, like, rearrange my chats a little bit here. I've got, I have a YouTube chat. I'm, I'm live on YouTube and Twitch right now. So I have a double chat situation happening for those that are, are coming in. Um, It's kind of weird. Like, kind of, it's kind of quirky and, and kooky. Maybe we'll try some vertical chats. There we go. Hello, hello. Oh, you're exploring Strange Island. Very cool. I started to play Strange Island on my own. Um, and it was cool. I ended up getting distracted because I've got so much other Sim stuff going on. But, uh... <laughs> oh, Tinu is used... Okay, well, that's what I was thinking. I was thinking that's what the... But that seems kind of heavy for, like, a trailer park. That's why I was a little confused. I would, because I, the setup for them being in a trailer park, I mean, I, I mean, I know heroin's like common, but I don't know. I'm just thinking of around here, people tend to turn to, the trailer park tends to be where the crack happens, not the heroin. I don't know. That's interesting. But I didn't know that they, they had that reference in the game. Uh, yeah, I was going to say meth. Meth is good. Meth, meth, no, wait. <laughs> That sound that came out wrong. <laughs> Method would be good for a trailer park storyline. <laughs> Method's <is> good. <laughs> Not that. <laughs> you heard it here, probably. <laughs> where the crack happens, lol, where the nut happens. <laughs> Not this. Not this. <laughs> That's not what I meant to say. <laughs> but yeah, so I have this house here. So how much money does she have? She has three grand. I think we were going to have her steal. Wait, what's going on with... Wait, in this picture, BJ has a different face going on. And it, I, didn't, I don't know why. Maybe it's just chopping... I don't know. That's weird. <laughs> that is good. It's a dog. 2023. <laughs> Calicundia, where the nut happens. That's beautiful. Maybe that's what, our, that's what the Calicundia description needs to be. Can I edit the description from here? There we go. Because I haven't really got one. Where... What should I say? Where... Oops. We're gonna do it this. There we go. We've got... That's our, our official description. I assume it saves. I don't know. <laughs> Intervention time for Sam. No! <laughs> Who is that? Not my PJ nut. <laughs> I was in ads. <laughs> Sorry, Dreamy. I hate stupid ads. I accidentally said meth is good. <laughs> <laughs> we were talking about the, the Brandy's uh, supposed, like, drug use and the tinfoil being a reference to heroin, and I was thinking that, like, it would make more sense for a trailer park kid to be into... A trailer park person to be into, like, other stuff. <laughs> Where the tinfoil begins and the nut ends. <laughs> oh my. Oh my, say my name. I am the danger. <laughs> Oh, no. Okay. But anyway, thank you so much for the raid, Brianna. Feel free to take care of yourself. What is it? That, what's it called? The post-stream care? Post-raid care? Raid and, raid and run. But thank you very much. We're playing some good old Calicundia. We just finished one household, the Lemon Bottoms. Um, we're going to let Ms. I Mrs. I the Icons here chill out in the bin for now. I'll take care of them on my own. I'll find them a place to go. We gotta decide who we're playing next. We've already we've played Brandstone and Lemon Bottom for this round. We're on round four. And I don't know who I want to play. We got the Bongs. We got Zycax. Go check in on the Zycax. We got Rhodes. Uh, we got Twilight Breath. We'll wait on Sundog is the last one we played last round, so we won't bother. I also got the the Schnozzes. <laughs> Zycax. We could do some child chaos. Uh-oh. Clip created. I just saw clip created. <laughs> oh, no. Uh oh I, I also just saw Dreamy's message up above. I'm in ads. Don't say anything funny. Sorry, I, I didn't. <laughs> I, I, I promise I didn't say anything funny. 
I feel like his kid should have stay with him to take over the business. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. I mean, Dreamer. So here's the thing is one of his. So he has twins with her and one of them. Um, one of them is at the orphanage and the other. So he gave up one and he's like a, a very selfish romance sim. I don't I, I should give him secondary fortune if he doesn't already have it. So I don't know if he would. I don't know if he cares about the kids. You know, I'm not sure. <laughs> Hello, Robin. Oh, the keyboard is funky on the app. <laughs> but I did see here at the moment. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. I've made a great mistake. <laughs> okay. So we want to try the Zykax. The Zykax are a very full household. We could check them out and see what's going on in the Zykax crew. Is anyone preggers in town? I don't think anybody's pregnant right now. We've been so eager Whenever somebody gets pregnant, like we want them to have a baby to see what it looks like. I think we always we don't ever leave somebody pregnant. I don't think. Levi might die. You're right, actually. Also, hi, Meebles. Levi might die. Oh. <laughs> what is happening? What's happening, folks? <laughs> I think this are they being possessed? We're going to have to do some makeovers because we have some uh, some uh, hair changes since I went to default only hairs. I know little Miss. We're going to we, we should get Miss Rito back one day. OK, I think she's dancing with one of them. Oh, they're both. There's, there's two teens dancing with the kids and they're just getting goofed. <laughs> they're doing the whip and nay nay seven years too late. Oh, no. All right. Well, the time sink is fine because we're Thursday. Oh, no, that's not fine. We need to change it to Saturday. Um, do I not have a... This is a sim blender, I think. I don't know. I don't know that I have a sim manipulator on this lot yet. We're going to get a little sim manipulator here. And we'll do... Um... I'll make it. I like to make them look like a flamingo. I'm gonna go previous model a couple times. There we go. And then I'm gonna alter time. We're gonna make it Saturday. I'm gonna let it stay at 4 a.m. at 5 a.m. That's fine. I think that's a good time. Yeah, she needs her, needs her mullet back. <clears throat> Rito's kids do got some good genes. They got some good genes. Okay, let's hit play. Let them do their thing. I, there, there's some things happening. Oh, one of them disappeared. Where'd you go? Okay. Who's who's where? You're up here. We got Scoot. Aurora has like, is it like in mourning? I don't know why Aurora got this out, this hair. Uh, his is fine. His is what it is. I gave, I, I think I already changed Scoot's to this one. She's got a little Brandy Broke. Speaking of Brandy Broke, she's got a little Brandy Broke moment happening. Um... This girly, let's change her. Um, I don't know. If, is she going to move out? Oh, that's right. She wants to. Maybe we should have her move out before we get going here. I think I was supposed to do that. Maybe we can have her move out right now, and then I can like kind of play her on her own at some point. What is her? We had her. She, I thought she had orange hair. What are her eyebrow color? Yeah, her eyebrow is orange. I don't know why it's defaulting all my redhead sims to black hair. She could rule her and Iris could share a, a house. If I could figure that out, that'd be cool. Maybe I could try to make an apartment building work. I've been having difficulties with apartment buildings. If I could try. Live in nanny. That's true. Because she's going to have two extra kids on top of the two she already has. Um, I don't know what. I remember we had her being like a goth girly. Is there any, what's under the custom hairs? Um, I think I've got some missing. They have like a cool look. Oops, yeah, that one's broken. We got some broken stuff. This one's kind of fun. That one's kind of cool. Hi, Nick is here. I'm always scared of getting di-, di Okay. Oh, I was like, where's that going? You always look sweeter than sugar. Interesting. <laughs> I was like, is this a fat joke? <laughs> no. Sweeter than, thank you. I, I think, 
and hello. <laughs> there we go. I don't know what kind of what kind of hair she should have. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Riz. I don't know about the rise of the word Riz. Not a fan. Actually, wait, this purple is fun on her. She's got a purple dress. Is that too, like, mature? Is that too mature for her? Because she's, like, a fresh... She's a fresh youngin. It looks like a, a fancy a hair. But maybe, maybe it's... Hmm. Maybe that's it. I like the purple. I don't think there's really... A, there's one other purple, but it's like this one. That's, like, too vibrant. I think I'll just do that. I think we'll go with this one for now. We'll just... She's going to be moving out in a minute anyway. That's true. The lighter lip would help with... She's just barely changed into a, a young adult. So it's... I mean, not young adult. Like, an adult. But she's newly an adult. So, like... I don't know. <laughs> but she looks older than her mom... Under her adoptive mom. So it's like... I don't know what else she could have. Maybe she will just have, like, a natural... Her... Her hair color. Maybe she should have one of those edgy cuts where it's, like, shaved on the side. <laughs> or she could just have, like, this. She have, she have a little shortcut. That one's very old. That one's, like, makes her look older. Oh, she could just have, like, a long hair, a very full hair. Because we, we did a dark lip because she was supposed to be, like, an emo girly. Emo girl. And we could go... Oh, I kind of like that. The long, I think long hair makes her look young. Yeah, that's kind of what I want, because she does have, like, a weird, like, fancy dress that's a little bit dated looking, too. What's this one? Oh, this one's, like, a little bit of a... Let me try, like, something like that. I don't know. I think that's okay. Yeah, I think that's fine. Yips. <laughs> yep. Um, I'm back properly with sound. Welcome back, Toby. You can make, um, you can thank the leaf man for giving her pretty kids. Yes, that's true. Um, these two, which actually they're not, they're not really her kids, but like, yeah, pretty much. Lovely leaf genetics. But yeah, so we got to change these guys' outfits. I don't mind her hair. This is, so this is blue footed booby. I think we are calling her boo for short. And this is tufted tit mouse. We're calling him tough. And he looks okay. I think his shirt's different, but he looks fine. I might change her outfit, because it looks a little weird. I think she had a different shirt on. We're just kind of doing some gussying up here to start off. Um, let's just play an outfit and see what's going on. See what's already in the, the uh, closet. Yeah, so we can just give her like a little shirt. What else? What other pants? Are there any, like, full-body looks she could have? Oh, she could have, like, a, I kind of like this little green look. Like, were we trying to do blue on- I don't think we were doing blue on purpose. What, I could give her this. Are we, we're going into fall time, but that's not too bad. I don't think anybody else is wearing that. <laughs> Loving the exotic name. <laughs> exotic. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I do like Cheeto's outfit, but we, let's give her- Ooh, grow up. Ooh, they're about to age up to, to teenagers. Within a day, is that gonna be? That must be today at 6 p.m. is when they're gonna, they're gonna age up. But yeah, her jeans were cute. I, maybe I could try and make those work again. They were a default replacement that I have. So she had like an edgy cut before. She had like a little edgy mullet. I don't know what options we have now with our limited. Oh yeah, we could give her the flesh tails. <laughs> These are just so cursed. I can't get rid of them because they're so cursed. <laughs> <laughs> They're so cursed. It was the blue on purpose. Yeah, probably probably makes sense. I could try and give her something a little different. <laughs> Laszlo's herbs are ready to harvest. Ooh. Do the Sims actually get to, like, smoke them? Um, oops, I meant to click black hair, because she's got naturally black hair. Go towards the end. I don't know if I might have something that... You get some fun little pigtails. 
she's gonna age up pretty quick so it's like it doesn't really matter that much she could just have like some buns nut yeah bj with the flesh tail <laughs> that that whole sentence <laughs> that whole sentence <laughs> it's giving dobby with the flesh tail. somebody else the, the folks on the youtube chat have both said dobby that makes her look like dobby it's Do dobby <laughs> it's funny the cursed cassandra cattails yes see her her she's got like the I call it the Nina Caliente syndrome because, like, default Nina always has that that forehead that cuts through all of the hairs. She got that. She got that going on. This one's kind of fun. This has got some color to it, and it kind of covers. It doesn't cut through too badly. I kind of like this for her. It's like a little different, little something. There's a bug in my face. Maybe. I think I'll maybe I'll go with that for now. She had eyebrows. I think she's fine. Yeah, I think we'll just go with this for right now. We'll give her that. Like I said, she's going to age up quickly. Gosh, this one's Little Pout. Who are you again? Little Bustard. Oh, this is the... She's not one of the twins. She's on her own. I don't really mind her little hairdo. Look at her. She's like a little pouty thing. She's got like a little braid. I don't know. I think that's okay. I don't really mind it. Oh, it comes with bongs so your Sims can actually smoke it. That's wild. <laughs> Maybe I'll have to I'll have to get get into this mod. <laughs> Chelsea looks like she should uh belong to the cap family. That's that's true. I think I could see that. Were you talking about the other one with the black hair? I could see that. I think I will change. Here, let's do I'm gonna buy her a different shirt so we can have her have those jeans again. Cause I'm recalling that we gave her the jeans with planets on them on purpose or something. Also, we are going into fall time in this hood, so we could do something a little more like warm. Sad burb. She is sad burb. I've never seen a name fit a sim so well. Little Buster. What is her what is her like nickname? What do we call her for short? Lil Lil Bus? <laughs> Lil, Lil Bussy? I don't think we want to call her that. Lil? Lil <laughs> The concert jigsaw cheekbones are haunting. That's true. I do see that. <laughs> oh, you can also make it as joints. It makes them giggle a little bit when it's done. Oh, that's interesting. <laughs> Lil B. <laughs> Lil turd. <laughs> Lil Lil. I I do like Lil. Lil B, I think, is good. <laughs> that little bussy. <laughs> that little bussy. <laughs> Not that. What about like a little sweater moment? I think we'll, we'll go with the blue again. Just looking at, unfortunately, I deleted my thumbnails for Create a Sim, like the cast thumbnails, because of I've been changing my defaults out so much. I couldn't remember what was what, and I, I kept just getting myself confused. I'm like, I'm just going to generate new ones so I know what the hell's going on here. I never use these little vests. So we do a vest moment. They're kind of goofy looking, but I kind of like them. Like, they're like that weird Sims 2 goofy. I don't know. Let's do something normal. But. Hi, Super Chill. How are you? Um, Maybe even like one of these tank tops. I'm just going to gather some random stuff. Let's just see what we can do with her. I got to see it with the pants is the thing. Oh, actually, even this little shirt's not terrible. That's kind of fun. I'm doing pretty good. It was my, uh, it was my first attempt at a proper uh, <laughs> multi-stream. I'm, I'm, I'm live on both Twitch and YouTube right now. So if you see me talking to people who aren't in this chat, it means they're in the other chat. <laughs> Although... YouTube folks can kind of see the Twitch chat on the screen. So that helps a little bit. <laughs> I don't know. I kind of like the little sweater. I think it's got the blue. What was her lifetime wish? Become Hall of Famer level 10. I don't know if that'll be what she actually goes for or not. Um, I remember this was Nacho's look. I don't mind. How do we feel about this hair on Nacho? Should he have a different hair? 
I like this hair on Tufted Titmouse. The hair itself is really nice. Like, it's a good mesh. It's a nice mesh. We'll do a little something. We'll do a little something going on. Oh, I see people connect TikTok and Twitch streams. Yeah, that's... In I, I don't know that... I don't know how much of, like, a... a, a Sims 2 community there is on the TikToks. I know that there's a little bit, but I don't know if it, if it, I've thought about TikTok streams. I don't know how worth it they would be compared to like an actual like a, a YouTube stream like this, but Hmm. He's just he's got the same brow syndrome that his sister has. That's what gives me Alexander Goth vibes. Yeah, that's true. I do see that a little bit. He's like a, he's like if Alexander Goth went through a terrible accident. <laughs> okay, thank you, Dreamy. I'll have to look at it afterwards. This one kind of helps keep the hair out of his his brow. What if he just shaved his? Oh God, I don't know. I feel like the shaved head is worse somehow. I don't know. That feels. This feels. This feels bad. This feels bad. <laughs> oh, okay, he he yeah got fired from work. Oh no. Oh no. I think I'll give him just like a little updo that is out of his hair, out of his his brows. <laughs> you like the long, messy ones on him, like this style. I do like that. I wish his brows would behave. What about? Hey, what if he has the the Levi cut? <laughs> Hmm. This one's broken. Oh yeah, that there we go. That's what we want. I love that this just says bowl cut, bowl cut, bowl cut, <laughs> bowl cut, <laughs> bowl cut, <laughs> bowl cut. It gives me mouse vibes. Imagine the specimen eating cheese in your kitchen at 3 a.m. <laughs> I don't I don't know. That's scary. I but I see that. I do see that. <laughs> <laughs> the bowl cut makes him look like he's a, a future super villain. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, man. I don't have enough. I need to replace some of these. What if he has like a little, what if he has like this little moment? That's kind of fun. Kind of like this, just like a little beanie. He kind of looks cool with his little beanie. <laughs> Alexander Goth mid-transformation into a snail person. <laughs> Wait. I wait. That's the, that's. The, I see it. Mid transformation into a snail person. That's great. Alex went to Gingy. Oh no. Eating nut in your kitchen. Oh no. Eating nut in your kitchen. Oh wait, I missed that. He gives me Vic nut. Imagine the specimen eating nut in your nutchin at three a.m. <laughs> Eating nut in your nut chin. <laughs> Too much. He looks like little Barry. Uh, oh, the YouTube chat is kind of weird. Actor, dude. Oh, okay. I'm not familiar. I'm, I kind of like this little beanie. What if we change his little outfit to match his beanie? I feel like he could. He's, we gave him. We let him keep. He aged up into this. We let him keep it. Now, he. Let's see what's, let's just see what's in the, we have had so many children in this household. Let's see how many kids. <laughs> the Northern German lesbian beating. <laughs> like you could just like do this. Just give him a little bit of this. That's good. Why don't we just give him that? He's going to age up today. So it's like, it's not going to really matter. He, he's a middle anamorph. <laughs> I feel like all of the Sims in this hood are, a, are a, like the middle of the anamorph transformation. <laughs> That's what they all are. Except for maybe except for BJ, she's the she's the dark version of, of the finished Animorph. <laughs> this kid has more swag than me. <laughs> this that outfit gives Sims one kid vibes. I can see that a little bit. <laughs> Object is almost out of food. Better fill her up. Quick! <laughs> what? Object? Is that this? I think our bird's broken. It's like eating while she's holding it. Oh god, our bird's broken. I assume- oh god, our bird's like stuck eating. Our bird's just eating, just like vomiting food. Oh, she's eating now. Leave- oh my god, little bustard will not- is torturing the bird. Here, fill food. 
I'm guessing that's, or are we talk. is there another, oops, is there any other creatures in this household that could be f needing food <laughs> besides the children? Okay. <laughs> the bird's having a serious moment. Um, how about we have you serve some pancakes? I think he's got good skill here. Wow, he's got really high skills. Love the idea of him with a bald head, just eat, eating a pack of American cheese in the kitchen corner at 3 a.m. squeaking <laughs> is honestly an inspiration for me. That's... wow. <laughs> that, that, I, I can see that, unfortunately. <laughs> unfortunately. The birds of this game are cursed. Yeah, they seem to be. And the kids won't leave them alone. But, I mean, it's correct that the Zycax will... You know, they can't leave the kids alone. Okay. Mrs. Scoot's going off to work. Hey, bye, Scoot. She works as a maid. She's a maid level one. I'm doing tufted tit mouse. The children are gonna have to go to school soon. Oh, that's right. I think Aurora is gonna leave. She wants to move out, so I think we should just have her move out before we get going here. Where's the newspaper? Didn't it just get... Did it get delivered? Oh, it's right here. Oh, she's got it. Wait, no. I need you to... Okay. I was planning to study organic chemistry with this playing in the background, but whatever chemical compounds these creatures <laughs> are built on are not found on Earth. I think you're right. I think that's the literally the the storyline behind them is that they've something has gone terribly wrong. <laughs> something has maybe the aliens brought something dangerous to Earth. And this is the result. This generations of genetics. There's something going on. YouTube's, it's got a weird, YouTube has this thing that's like a, it's like a little heart that you can, you can do. And it's like, in the way of me reading the chat, and it's annoying. <laughs> it's annoying me. The thing I like about YouTube streams is that it will automatically save to YouTube. Yeah, although it's hard because like, I have a different channel that I upload my streams to. So it's like, I wish I could hook up the two. I wish I could like, link them. I could, okay, we're just gonna have her leave. I wish I could, like, have it finish the stream here and then send it to my, my stream channel. Um, but... So I'll have to... I'll, I've got to re-upload it, because I don't want it to mess up all my other stuff. Oh no, she's being held hostage by the clan. <laughs> They're like, you are not allowed to leave. <laughs> yeah, you are not allowed to leave. <laughs> the heart is good. Can you... Are you allowed to move it? I wish I could move it. I keep trying to make the chat a little bit wider to see if it helps, which it kind of does. But it's, like, annoying. <laughs> it's annoying. I guess unless you made it really wide. But then it's, like, in the way of everything else. Weird. Okay, anyway, sorry. <laughs> I said a link to the post. Uh, I found the weed mod. Okay, thank you. I'll definitely... <laughs> now I'm seeing little hearts going. People are hitting the hearts. <laughs> thank you. Thank you for the hearts. <laughs> Um, move her in with Iris. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to do something like that. Okay, did she, she left. Oh my god, this household is chaos. Aren't they supposed to, oh, it's Saturday. Duh, I'm like, they're gonna be going to school soon. No, it's literally Saturday. What are we gonna do? Okay, you gotta work at 3 p.m. What if, what if Levi takes the, the clan out on a, on a, on a little journey? Takes the crew, the gaggle, it, what is it? The flock, it's the Zykak flock. They're a flock. <laughs> Uh, how about we... Can we... Am I not allowed to leave the lot if somebody's... Oh no, there we go. Let's go to a community lot. Where are we gonna take the kids? Oof, he is so old. old. He's so close to dying. <gasps> is Scoot gonna remarry? I'm gonna take the whole crew. Where should they go? Um, I imagine the Curious Brothers being stoners. Is, yeah, definitely. Yeah, since Aurora grew up taking care of all the kids, I imagine she's good at it. That's true. She could be a good little nanny. One last outing with Levi. <laughs> Not this. The Zykex would uh, totally be the type of family to have their own bomber slash leather jackets with their family name on the back. Yeah, they've got like those. They're uh, 
like those Letterman jackets, like the sports jackets that like football guys get. <laughs> they got those as the Zycac flock. And it's like a picture of a bird on the back. <laughs> Last outing before Pop Pop kicks it. <laughs> Where the nut happens. <laughs> oh no. Um, <laughs> that most beautiful creation. <laughs> I don't know where we should go. Should we go to the... I feel like the museum is fun, but it's like kind of... Maybe we should... Let's go to Winter Wonders. Let's go Let's go experience winter time. <laughs> yeah, that's a, that's a uh, redemption from the Twitch side of things. If anybody on the YouTube is his confusion. <laughs> that was our creepy little... Our creepy little... Uh, <laughs> our creepy little, little dreamer. One of our one of our uh, most glorious creations. Farewell, oh, farewell outfit. And this is his farewell. This is his his death outfit. He put it on for dying. <laughs> the museum is fun if you're a freaking nerd. <laughs> Be nice to Grandpa. He's gonna die today. See, the thing is, is this is actually Dad <laughs> for all of these kids. This is their father. <laughs> but we can call him Grandpa Dad. Grandpa Dad. He just Scoot ended up marrying an elder man and having children with him. <laughs> oh, we also got an olive oil to cleanse the palate. I didn't see which one. Hopefully, it was actually one this time. <laughs> Put it on for dying. Yes, <laughs> Grandpa Dad. Zycax do three legs. Twenty twenty three. Exactly. They have like the T shirts printed. Okay, everybody. Crew and we. Oh, I just realized she has no shoes. <gasps> She's broken. Uh oh, her little outfit's broken. Cheeto's outfit's broken. Buddy old pal. Okay. Except Ch Nacho and Cheeto. Yeah, Nacho and Cheeto are adopted. Their their father is Green Man that now is a cult member. <laughs> and is is I, you know what? Actually, somebody asked earlier, is anybody in town pregnant? I think that one of the cult members is. Now that I think of it. Or maybe we weren't sure if he was. I literally went to a museum last week for my birthday trip. Aw, oh, dang it, no picture came up? I'm sorry. Maybe I should... I'm gonna refund you again. <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't know why it keeps doing that to me. It was working earlier. It was a joke. Yeah, I wish I wish there were museums around here. I don't have a lot of museums around here. I, I think I'd have to, like... I've thought about before, like, planning a little trip down to Boston, because it's really not that far, and there's, like, a... You could take a like a a bus down. There's a Greyhound bus over, I think, over in Vermont that you can go and take a little trip down to Boston, go to like one of the really nice museums down there. But I think there's also some in like Southern New Hampshire. Yeah, you've got you've got no feet. Look, she's got broken feet. I'm gonna choose to not see it for now. I'll figure that out. Like I said, she's gonna age up soon. That's the other thing. We can't be here for too long because. I don't want him to age up randomly here. Look at look at Mr. Nacho. He's just like, I'm too cool for this place. I'm going to go sleep in the bathroom. <laughs> Vermont, Yeah, Vermont's very pretty. I, I live in New Hampshire, but right on the border of Vermont. And they're essentially the same state. <laughs> they're essentially the same state. So it's like, yeah. Can we go? Let's let's skate. How about everybody? Let's get the whole crew on the ice. Oh, no, wait. The kid didn't come. The The boy. Tuffy didn't come. Little Tuff didn't come. What the heck, man? Tuff stayed home. Did you not? What are you doing, bud? Oh, I'm gonna just bump their energies a little bit just to make them happy. I know. Why did Tuffy not? Tuffy's like, I don't wanna. Tuffy didn't want to come. I don't know what, what his deal was. Can't even join his father on his last trip. <laughs> can't even nutton. Can't nutton join his father on his nut trip. <laughs> Not the nut trip. Why does Buttspot keep doing two in a row? The city where I live has food additives museum. That it, food added a food additives museum. That's interesting. The, the sit nut where I where I live has food additives museum. I kind of want to sit nut sit it. <laughs> okay, okay, Buttspot. <laughs> Literally fits your fall aesthetic, yes. I guess probably most of New England in general would. <laughs> yeah. 
But yeah, that's interesting. I wonder, like, what would that be? Like, I'm, I'm trying to envision what that would look like. Okay, nobody wants to skate. Oh, it's because everybody's tired. I'm gonna... Oh. I'm just gonna cheat it. I think it's just the, the time sink sometimes messes the kid, everybody's schedules up. We're gonna make them happy. That's why they were laying on stuff. I need you to stop. Come and skate. You, you're just as bad. Just make them happy. Their last outing with 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 a uh, grandpa dad. We gotta we gotta make them happy. Oh, okay, to get rid of the live reaction, Sam has to go to edit settings in YouTube and click off live reactions. Okay, the heart. Okay, I'll have to I'll have to look into it next time. I don't know if I can do it live right now or not. Maybe I can. <laughs> Someone joined Granddad in the photo booth. <laughs> Blue-footed booby. What are you doing? You gotta get out of the way. Uh-oh. Where's Grandpa? Oh, that's true. Wait, someone... Sorry, did I read that without even reading what it actually said? But someone does have to join Granddad in the photo booth. So who's gonna take pictures with Grandpa? I think it should be a little mustard. Let's get in. Okay, I want you to get off the ice, though. I know I keep yelling at you to get on the ice, but I need you to get off the ice. Calicundia should have a nut museum. I know. Well, we have the Kund Museum. Maybe I should, in, in inspiration of, of the Kund Museum, I should make the the, the nut museum <laughs> the same style. Make a bunch of artwork with Mr. Kanut Futa. That'd be fun. Okay, are you... Why is this... He's unable to go up the stairs? He's too old for the stairs. He can't go... Why can't you go up these stairs, sir? It's like he keeps getting stuck down here. I don't understand what he's doing. I gotta take him step by step. We gotta take him by the hand. <laughs> he's nut hurt. Not his nut hurt. I gotta save a screenshot of that one. Oh no. <laughs> nut hurt. <laughs> okay. <laughs> You're working that man to the bone. Here we go. We gotta get it. We gotta get a picture with Grandpa Dad. There we go. So is there like a? See, they interesting. So they turn this corner, and it's like they think they can't go. Is it because of this light? Or is it the? Is it this? See, so they get stuck right here. That's so weird. Because usually they step over these lights. Let's just do this and see what happens. You gotta come up here and join Grandpa Dad. There we go. He's going. <laughs> Butt Spot's um, fun. A, Butt Spot adds a lot of spice to the chat. I enjoy. <laughs> I wish that he showed up in the in the YouTube chat as well. That would be although that might be a curse. Having double Butt Spot action might be a little bit much. <laughs> All right, let's let's take some fun little photos with with our our uh, father before he kicks the bucket. Take picture, goofy. We gotta do goofy. There we go. <laughs> nut everywhere. Don't be nut hurt, guys. <laughs> Don't be nut hurt. There we go. Uh oh. Why did wait? Why did she? What was that negative? Wait, what was she was a she didn't want to take a picture? She like she was sad that she took a picture. Is little little B self-conscious? <clears throat> Sorry, I choked on my throat there. <laughs> Last trip of the photo booth. With, yeah, she's shy. Maybe she's like too too shy. Let me see what Wait, he wants Oh, he wants a grandchild. Oh no, he's never going to get a grandchild cuz he's about to die. Let me just see what we got here. Look at these two. Look at this crew. Oh no, she looks like she's maybe... Oh, oh no, I hit the wrong button. There we go. I mean, she doesn't look... Wait, how is he... Wait. <laughs> I think there's a lot going on here. <laughs> Peepa is dying and you don't even want to take a picture with him. Shake my head, my head. <laughs> Peepa. Peepa. I do love the... I love the photo booth pictures. These are great. Her little face in the first one, though, looks like she didn't want to be here. Looks like that's when the aspiration failure hit. 
<laughs> right there. We can't, well, we can't leave these in Peepaw's inventory because he's going to die with them. We got to give them to her, right? That'd be, that's the smart thing to do. Have them in her inventory. He doesn't have anything else but his traits in there, so that's good. Maybe she said that her father is passing away and that this will be the last bit. Yeah, does, is she a psychic? Does she know? What if she's actually a psychic and knows? Nobody else knows. It's something. <laughs> maybe. Maybe Pe she, she's the only one that Peepa told. <laughs> Peepa was in the, the photo booth with her and he whispered it in her ear. He's like, I'm about to die. Smile for the camera. <laughs> Don't tell your brothers and sisters. I'm gonna die. <laughs> Terrible. Oh no. <laughs> I hate when my aspiration fails when I'm with my family. Honestly, mood. <laughs> People have said, let's get a silly one now, and her aspiration instantly took a nosedive. <laughs> the Sims 2 level of detail of her not wanting a picture and looking up, looking upset in the pics. Yeah, I think that's great. A great little coincidence that I really like. Oh, her aspiration's bad. Dance together? She's trying to use the bathroom. I don't see the only thing about this lot. So I made this lot kind of I made this lot back when I was like sick <laughs> and I wasn't really feeling well and I wasn't really thinking too well. And I feel like I made a mistake with Sims having to walk all the way down these stairs to go to the bathroom and stuff. Like maybe I might I might redesign this in the future. But it's still I still like it. Yeah, I do like the little little Christmas vibes, little outdoorsy vibes. Right this now this NPC I tried to I'm not allowed to change her face the local chef I don't think they're a real NPC they're like a a, a, a object person sorry I got the hiccups I have the hiccups off and on all time all day <laughs> thank you for taking these last pictures with me sweetheart wait what <laughs> wait what she still wishes she was potty trained <laughs> wait. Oh no, I have potty train locked in as she's using the toilet. Oops. She wants to be, wait, she wants to be, be friends with Dreamer. She's like, I love Dreamer. Her her idol. Her idol is Dreamer. Look at this picture of Dreamer. She's got her wig on and she's sunburned. I know it's like a tiny picture, especially for the folks watching, but it's like <laughs> Lil B and Dreamer. Did she just wash her hands twice? That's great. Okay. Oh, it's 4 p.m. Let's go home. He's supposed to be at work, but I don't think he's gonna... We'll walk. Let's walk home. Buster Cross Dreamer. Yeah, I wonder... I don't know what they're... You know, they're both still kids, so we don't know who they'll be dating in the future. It'll definitely be interesting to, to see. never wash your hands too many times <laughs> honestly that's true I, I i feel like i wash my hands a lot <laughs> having to run downstairs when you need to pee yes <laughs> yes look at him, look at the crew we're heading on down there we go um i hope this isn't weird but i'm curious to know what that picture next to you oh on my let me pull up my obs Oh, right here, this one hiding over here. This is a this is a painting. I don't know if it'll show up on the camera. Ooh, it's kind of. I'm trying not to get the glare. I guess maybe like that. <laughs> That's a. It's a. Let's see, I can't see the YouTube chat right now, but it's a, a painting that I did. Of it's gouache. I think it's a. Yeah, I think it's just gouache and ink, and then gel. But yeah, I, I don't know. When did I do that? It says 2022, apparently. <laughs> 20, apparently I did that in 2022. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah, I like I like how it turns out. That's why I ended up framing it and putting it here. Um, yeah. It'll stay put. <laughs> It'll stay put. Uh-oh. An instant age up. Oh, God. Pause. Hold on. Nut-oh. <laughs> Not the nut-oh. <laughs> Not the nut-oh. <laughs> but yes, thank you. I, I'm happy with that one, how that one turned out. Nut is nut, nut is life. <laughs> I love that quote. That's a good quote. <laughs> As a person who works with kids, wash your damn hands often, yes. Age up and nut death. 
That's a perfect quote for right now, yes. Is he, what is this, arrive? Okay, I saw his own face and I'm like, is it die? I think when it's die, they get the Grim Reaper's picture. But I think he's gonna die like right now. Good thing she's home. Everybody's filthy and just, look at these two, <laughs> these two simultaneously doing their spin on the side of the lot. Look at this cursed, this is like cursed. <laughs> this is a little cursed. Ooh, that was fast. I'm not even fast forwarding. Okay. Ooh, I like her face. She's got a lot of, she's got a lot of, um, her mom in her. <laughs> they get Grim's face and it says expire. Yes, yes. <gasps> Grim's over here. Grim's over here. No, <laughs> no. <laughs> R.I.P. R.I.P. to Grim. I thank you, super chill. <laughs> R.I.P. to Grim, R.I.P. to Peepaw. <laughs> what is her aspiration gonna be? Should I randomize it? I don't feel like randomizing. <laughs> clip. <laughs> Did the clip work? Oh, there it goes. Okay, she wants somebody who's a hard worker, good at cleaning, but is not logical. Dun dun dun. <laughs> dun dun dun. Someone pull an olive and flirt with Grim. Oh no. Maybe that's, <laughs> maybe that's Scoot's next husband. You think she's a family sim from being at a big family? family because her dad yeah her adoptive dad and her mom her mom died when she was a toddler and then she got adopted by this the zycax these two are uh these are rito snappers kids that she died she was a vampire that died of exposure not no not butt spot making fun what <laughs> Ooh, so, so the youtube uh miss player on the youtube chat says she screams popularity or pleasure i do kind of like popularity for her. I don't have a lot of popularity sims. Um, <clears throat> I think you're in a big family, you wouldn't want kids. That's true. I also feel like maybe romance could be it. Pleasure? Maybe she wants to be her own sim. Maybe po I think I'll do po I like- I like- do like the idea of popularity. I think I'll just go with that for her. Then I don't know her brother. He seems- what if he's like a fortune sim? What is- oh wait. His turn-ons are poor, <laughs> as I say that. Wait, he likes formal wear and poor. I, I don't know if the poor folks are wearing the formal wear, sir. And he does not like a good reputation. He likes them, he likes them bad and poor, but well-dressed. <laughs> he likes them bad and poor and well-dressed. <laughs> okay, sir. <laughs> what spot don't mock our fade? Maybe she wants to spoil people. That's true. Ooh, that's a good way. Like, he wants to... He, okay, I like that. He, aspiring sugar daddy. Okay, I gotta do this, and then we're gonna pause and, and visit Mr... Oh, I can't I can't zoom over here. Everybody's crying. I, I feel great. I can keep feeling this good about life. If I can keep killing, feeling this good about life, I'm sure the sky's the limit. And then over here, Peepaw's dying. Peep, R.I.P. R.I.P. P.P. <laughs> R.I.P. Right, peep pa peep pa There's Mr. Levi. Here he goes. I don't remember if he had... Does he? Did he have good aspiration when he died? I don't know. Everybody, the, Scoot, you better get the hell out here, man. Oh, he's getting the hula zombies. Oh, he look at his... He's getting the hula zombies, but for some reason I have them replaced. But he got zombie. He got the hula ladies. Yeah, is the um yeah the poor as a wanna mod? I, yes, I have a uh, a replacement for uh, some of the turn ons and stuff, which is kind of nice to freshen things up a little bit. Toga zombies. See, I usually don't like defaulting the the hula zombie outfits, but I guess I did apparently. <laughs> this is the <laughs> beginning of oh see, the stupid hearts covering part of oh no, this is the beginning of someone's serial killer arc. Not that. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Also, uh, Nanette just entering. When did Nanette get skinny? Why is Nanette skinny? I don't remember Nanette get- Isn't Nanette a little chunky? Alright, hi Nanette. Anyway, welcome to our death. There we go. This is our first death in this- No, that's wrong. This is our second death in this town. <laughs> oh, I love this. He's getting- He's getting the, uh, the special treatment. Look, he's getting sent off like a king. He's got his little suitcase and he's got a little drink. And there he goes. I love it. 
Okay, oh, we got money. Dang, we got money. Okay, we're gonna get some money. <laughs> Only two. R.I.P. <coughs> Excuse me. Thank you, Toby. It's by Lazy Dutch. I think it's the replacement. Yeah, turn ons and turn offs. Yeah. <laughs> Is there a puppy dog walking by? Oh, did we do? Oh, we did dose of olive oil. That's what the puppy dog was. Did it finally work? The dose, dose of olive oil finally showed up correctly. <laughs> I'm seeing if I missed something. They must be Greek dancers. That's true. They they could be Greek. I like their hair. Okay. She's just waving. Scoot's just like, "Hi guys, welcome home." What are y'all crying about? What are y'all crying about? <laughs> what was wait what was the oh no oh i didn't see that it got covered by the oh, i'm sorry <laughs> i i'm sorry it got covered by olive oil that's okay he got the he, yeah he, he they just gave him his little drink and his thing and, and walked him off i'm sorry <laughs> maybe i should find a way to pause those during epic moments during important moments oh i just got a leg cramp ow anyway <laughs> no it's okay I, I understand no it was just a mistake it's okay it was a cute it was it was a cute olive oil olive oil stole the show she did yeah okay i wanted to stop and read who got what so why did nacho get 10 grand nacho's not even their biological kid and aurora got nothing Levi's insurance policy benefited 10 people. I guess it's all relationship-based? <laughs> I think we've got... Scoot got 20,000. Nacho got 10 grand. Uh, Little Buster got 9 grand. Forrest? Wait, Forrest? Why did Forrest get 300 bucks? <laughs> Why the hell did Forrest? Because he was a best friend, I guess? I think he was best friends. Like, what? I'm going to Olive Garden. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, that's the kid's dad. You're right. It's it's one. It's Cheeto and Nacho's dad. Like, why did? But like, that has nothing to do with Levi technically, other than they were friends. That's so weird. That's okay. Maybe. Uh oh. Maybe. What if Aurora and him were on the outs or something at the end? I think it is relationship based because in my hood, Olive made amends with Nervous before she died, and he got all the money. Interesting. Yes, we've got some some fun names here. <laughs> so do we? I guess we keep Levi here, or do we? I need maybe I need like a proper graveyard. Because that's the other thing I thought about. I don't know what happened to Scoot to uh, Rito's grave. I think it's still on her lot, if I didn't delete her lot, which I hope I didn't. I don't know if there's a way to retrieve a grave like that. Oof. Oh, we got our cat. Oh my god, we got $69,000! What are they gonna do with their 69k now that Peepaw died? Aurora should be the gravekeeper. That's- that's fun. Okay, you can- oh, if you use Hood Checker, you can find it and move it. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, I know. New house time? They could buy a new house. Then those two Aurora for a house, yeah. I don't know, man. Maybe I'll- I, I think I'll still give Aurora a little extra cash to just be like she did get something eventually once I play her, if I remember. <laughs> Obligatory. Nice. Nice. Too bad it wasn't 69 even instead of the 18. Okay. But I feel like, what if, what if Scoot just like, is like, you know what? I got a nice house. I'm going to quit my job. What if Scoot just quits working and takes care of the kids all the time, even though they're all getting older now? Oh no, her, her want is to flirt with Levi. You're going to have to unlock that, girly. She also wants uh, Bubba cured of lycanthropy. I think I need a sip of water. Tufted Titmouse has gained a creativity skill. Because I like our little house that we've built up here, but maybe we could... I don't know what houses I have in... in my... uh, like, in my bin that I could use. Wada! 
Wara wara. <laughs> yeah, Forrest, that's true. Forrest has actually gotten married. He, I think he's engaged or getting married to... Um, <clears throat> what are you doing over here? Why are you two sleeping in this bed? It's not really where you're supposed to sleep. Oh. Fall in love with Cheeto? <laughs> That's her stepsister. <laughs> Ma'am, this is not Pornhub. I don't know if I can accept that. <laughs> Ma'am. I don't know if I can... I don't know about that. I mean, they're not technically... I'm comfortable with the energy that we've created in the studio today. You know, they're not, like, on the family tree together. <laughs> But it feels a little... I feel like it's goofy enough to do, but at the same time, I don't know. Oh no, poor little, little bee is out here sobbing and filthy and disgusting, and my god, she just wants to be friends with little Dreamer. <laughs> uh, take a shower. I don't know about that one. I'm gonna link it- I'm gonna lock it in just because it's fascinating me, but I don't know. I don't know about that. <laughs> yeah, I feel like every time you have to say technically it's not incest, is not good. <laughs> also, yes, makeover for Cheeto and Nacho, you're correct. We need some makeover times. Here, let's save. I haven't even saved since playing this household so far. <laughs> I have not. I think the death of a Levi hit her too hard. Yeah, maybe. Treat as family. That's true. Should I make her treat as family? Because it feels weird. We gotta find somebody else. We don't need to be keeping it in the family. This family is too big for that. <laughs> yeah, if they do it autonomously. Yeah, I like the little... We gotta do like a little grunge out. Let's buy clothes. Maybe I'll change her hair again. I don't know. I like her hair, though. I might keep it, but we'll see what... Because there's more options for teens than there were for children, so there might be better hairs. Well, let's look at... I'm just going to do a full body. I like doing the full body outfits because they're just easy. Like, it's just the whole thing all in one. I don't have to mix and match. Maybe... Um, hopefully my game doesn't explode on me. Because... Um, oh, also we got little updates here. Cheeto is by. And Nacho is straight. Interesting. I heard that there was a weird incest glitch in The Sims 4 recently. Ooh, I think I feel like I did hear a little bit about that. Yeah, she ended up bi. That's pretty cool, though. I, I like having bi Sims in town because it just it's it's useful, honestly. <laughs> the utility bisexuals. <laughs> because we, anybody we in a small town like this where we need as many options as possible. <laughs> it's just it's good so I guess that the the cursed romance is a yeah that's true the bi kind of technically makes it a possibility I don't know man <laughs> I don't know I mean because it's like they technically aren't they kind of just got joined the family I don't know would they actually see them as siblings I don't know I don't know I'm trying to go to the end of the catalog. My game's reloading thumbnails because I know that all like the punk outfits are at the end. So that's kind of what I'm doing. Forbidden loved. Yeah, cursed moments do make these games interesting. <laughs> I just love the phrase utility bisexual. <laughs> the, the useful bisexual. Oh, it was Nacho? Oh. Was it Nacho? Oh no, I got I got confused. I thought it was I thought it was Ch Cheeto. We'll have to see. Maybe my, 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 I misread it. Oh, there's this family wreath. Family wreath. I hate that. <laughs> it's so cursed. We got like, we could go like Goss Girl. But I kind of like, I want to keep going because I know that there's some good punk punk at the end. Yeah, we'll have to check. It's not often that Sims get that specific, like, fall in love with Sim thing. 
especially if they haven't started a relationship. Yeah, the Big Shorts one's not bad. I don't like the colors of some of the Big Shorts ones, but we can always go back to that one. We'll be able to go through quicker once these thumbnails are, are generated. It's just, I deleted all the thumbnails, like I said, so it's like, ugh. Ugh. Cur yeah, a curious Smith family moment, you're correct. That's exactly what it is. <laughs> That's exactly what it is. Oh, here we go. We got, like, these hardcore punk vibes, which I like for her. What if she gets a tattoo at, at like, 16? <laughs> it's feeling very canon. <laughs> Oh, that's true. The big shorts definitely gives bisexual. I could see that. I love this outfit. There's something about this one is just so funny to me. It's just so Sims 2. It's like just weird, and I love it. But then also these are good. Hmm. I thought there was... Oh, we do have these also. Oh, this is this is the schoolgirl outfit with the punk boots. That's kind of what she had as a kid, too. Got, like, big punk boots on it. Oh, we also have these. Oh, I was thinking about these. This is this is fun. Her Avril Lavigne era. Avril Lavigne, if I can say words without <laughs> eating them. <laughs> she could do her Avril Lavigne. I don't know how to say words. Avril Lavigne era. <laughs> Avril Lavigne era. Now they're rich. They can go to private school, too. That's true. Is she going to get them all into private school? Maybe we should do that. I kind of like this for her. Add a couple of these on here. Could go with the, the black pants. I don't know. There's something about this plain red shirt I'm not a fan. <laughs> I don't. I haven't heard much about Avril. Av oh, my God. See, I can't say her name. I haven't heard much about Avril in a while. Oh, we got the camo ones. Oh, the camo is fun. Oh, we also got this moment. Look at this guy. Okay. Huh. That was hiding at the end here. I'm going to add that on, too. Hmm. Hmm. The school fit with the hair makes it look like a black pink member. <laughs> K-pop girly era. <laughs> I don't know. Let's accept that. We'll have it. We have some options. I don't know. Because I like this. This is like the punk and the baggy pants moment. I think I like this with the jeans. She needs some piercings. We could have her buy some. Mm, maybe the gray. I think I like the gray. Look at that. Wait, go here so we can like see you. Go here. There she goes. Look at her. Look at her. I like her face. I feel like because her father has like a normal face. She's got like that. She's got like she's not. 100% Calicundian. They're like, she's got a normal nose. She's fascinating. She's interesting. I like her. <laughs> Back, black, pink in your area. <laughs> she's got her vans on. I think I, I might do a different hair, maybe. Let's just see Oop, if I can zoom out here. Change appearance. <laughs> Bisexual queen. She needs like a shaved head or something. Let's look at the unnatural hairs. Maybe she needs like... A, we, I feel like we have a lot of sims with mohawks in town. Hmm. There's not a lot of options without my custom hairs. We have like a... A shaved punk girly moment. I think we might. <laughs> you like the mohawk on her? We have so many mohawk sims. I don't know if we have any... Other versions of a mohawk hiding in here? Not the tie. I was in high school. I had a phase where I wore thrift store ties and belts. Very cutting edge in fashion, yes. I remember that. I think I had a friend who was like hardcore emo kid that used to do that. Ooh, we also have like a little shaved moment. See, I like the shaved. I like the shaved look. That's a good question. Does she know about her plants and roots? I think she... I think her dad became a plant sim after he joined the cult. I think he got turned into one. So I guess she maybe doesn't really, because I don't think she got the genes. He was a nudist that walked around with a leaf on, but he wasn't truly a plant sim yet. 
Yeah, her brows need to be a little stronger. She needs some makeup. I think her face is good. She, look at how normal her nose is. I think she has the most normal nose in town. I think, I think she has the most normal nose in town. Ooh, I just, so I just defaulted this hair. This is kind of fun. How do I feel about like this hair with the little shaved sides? Her, her, her face kind of ruins it a little bit, but that's kind of fun. <clears throat> Meanwhile, I was wearing the, the belt from a skirt as a tie. <laughs> oh no. That will be a super superlative when she graduates. Most normal nose in town. Yes. <laughs> Most likely to have normal nose. <laughs> I like that the bot. I like that the the auto mod caught that. <laughs> oh, you are back. Greetings from the car. Welcome back. I kind of like. Let's play with makeup on her. I kind of like the look. How about? <laughs> what about? How do we feel? Oh God, the cr the, the crosses. <laughs> I feel like we need something kooky crazy. We need something a little wild. That's like, I don't know about that. I don't like the inner line. Her her eyes don't quite uh, handle the 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 eyeliner super duper well. <laughs> butt spot do my nut nut fashion buddy. <laughs> She's going through it. Oh, what is what are these? Oh, that one's kind of kooky. Smudgy raccoon eyes. That's true. We could do like the. What if I gave her, I'll give her like lash, like normal eyelashes or. Hmm. These are like, I have, I have these default replacements that are like eyelashes, kind of. They don't really work always on all the Sims. Hmm. Those are like an eyelash too. What if I give her an eyelash and then like a strong black. Like maybe she's not in her eyeliner era. She's in like her. Oh my. She's not in that era. She's like in her smudgy, all all eyeshadow era. I guess I don't have a big smudgy black eyeshadow, do I? I used to. Hmm. El Bandito raccoon eyes. The more I look at her, the more normal she looks. Yeah, it's just the brows, really. And I mean, the, this, the little indent, but she's not that kooky looking. <laughs> you mean smoky eye or is that different? I think the smudgy raccoon eye is like the scene kid where they just like they just use half their half their pen on one eye and they just like go nuts. <laughs> I think that's what it is. <laughs> Maybe that's that's why I need to do more of a an eyeliner on her. Well, I kind of like the little this moment. I guess the. Like I could start with this and then we can because I have some layerable stuff. Like that. That's like uh, putting it on heavy. She'd go to sleep with her makeup on and then wake up and rub her eyes and go with that. Yeah. Colored lipstick. Yeah. Something like that. Maybe again, I like giving the teenagers like teenager makeup too. So it looks kind of rough. Like they did it themselves and they don't know what they're doing yet. <laughs> the more I look at her, the more she looks like a slightly messed up version of an early of early strange towns violet. That's true. Like she kind of looks like a little little V. It's true. <laughs> Never thought I would see Consort Cap as an edgy teen girly. <laughs> I love that. That's funny. What about, what about a, little, a little whipstick? I don't know what color. I don't think, I mean, a purple could be fun. What's in her outfit? I'm seeing like she's got blue. What if she goes like dark blue? Oh, that's like a dark green. That's kind of fun. Or just like a dark red. I don't know about that. Or just black. I feel like black is the go-to. What is that? Oh, I guess that doesn't look as intense. Like a cranberry red. Hmm. Maybe just the classic black. That's kind of a, a lighter black. Okay, the, the profile is interesting, though. The, fe the lack of lip. Like the lip in is interesting. 
I remember my cousin killing her hair with hair straightener so she can get the most aggressive side part ever. Also had concealer lips. <laughs> That's funny. I remember the when the side swoop bangs were like the big thing. And like the like you said, the far side part and then like the that was that was big. Oh, I gave my favorite uh emo Lilith tattoos. That's cool. I have a I got a tattoo box for my game. But then I, I have never used it. I always forget it exists. I kind of like this look for her. Does she need any, like... Do we need any ridiculous... Oh, these are all default replaced with freckles. I wish I had, like, the... The full coverage, like, concealer. <laughs> Just, like... Or the foundation or whatever. I don't think she'd have any blush on. She wants to look as pale as possible. That one kind of does it a little bit. Tiny bit. What about, let me look at some of the full face. <laughs> Please don't mention the side swept bangs in my presence again. Oh no. Let me go to the end. Of all these kooky, crazy makeups. I, one of my favorite things is giving Sims little makeovers. I love giving them little, little looks. Yes, we can be a, we can do this. Should we just do that? <laughs> she, her mime era? <laughs> the mime era? Now, where did my... Oh, here. Do I have, like... No, I guess that's not really what I was thinking. I was thinking I had some, like, extra... Oh, the crying makeup. I forgot about the crying makeup. Should she, uh... She has... <laughs> is she just sad? Is this her emo era? <laughs> You met an emo dad once. That's interesting. Oh, you like the side swept bangs. Hey, everybody, there's something for everyone. New school me is crying right now. I wanted natural side swept bangs all through high school. <laughs> I don't know if I like her crying. I think we're going to just go with this. There we go. Look at her. Look how cool she looks. We can just say that, like, this little piece coming through is, like, her bangs just being uneven. I love her. I kind of love Cheeto. So let's see. You... Yeah, she's got Cheeto. Fall in love with Cheeto. So it is Cheeto that she wants to fall in love with. This girly. <laughs> it's never too late to be emo. You know what? That's true. There's a lot of folks that go back to it. That have gone back to it. You know, like the millennials that have gone back. Okay, sir. I need you to get up. So I can give you a makeover. We also got to give them their traits. Do we have our creepy mask hiding down here? Add missing traits. Oh, we got... Oh, do we have multiple missing traits? Oh. Let's add missing traits to all the people that need them. I must not have given to the traits to the others that have aged up last time. That's true. Miranda Cap. Yeah, somebody else in the YouTube chat was saying a cap face. She, was, she had a cap look. <laughs> yeah, the Miranda cap. They got the, she got the cap jeans. Okay, you, Gussie up. Uh, buy clothes every day. So what is his look gonna be? Is he kind of an edgy guy too? I feel like they both could be edgy. She ta she takes after Gone Rule a lot. That's true. <laughs> is he gonna be one of these guys? <laughs> is he gonna be this kid? Is he just gonna go to cosplay? He's gonna cosplay at school every day. Or is he like, maybe he's more like a baggy. I feel like this could be him. I'm going to add that one to the cart. Might come back to that one. I'm going to keep looking though. They have those edgy Rito snapper jeans. I'm sad though, neither of them ended up being vampires, which is interesting. Because they could have inherited her vampirism, but they didn't. Cheeto to Aurora. Why you got to make things so complicated? <laughs> Um, I don't know what the... What if they start a band together and on a Rito? That's true. Call themselves the Snappers. I love that. Is emo still a thing for teenagers these days? Oh, is that... I used to be an emo in my family. Now it's my little sister. I gave her all the, my old clothes. I feel like there is... Because there's a lot of kids that, like, are... They're, like, reliving the Y2K and the early 2000s and, like... That's, like, popular, so is the emo... Are the kids being the emos? Because it's, like, vintage to them, which is scary. I don't know, teens scare me. <laughs> Honestly, that's a valid response. 
Britney Spears. Britney Spears. Let me try that again. Britney Spears is obviously not emo, but she's a 2000 icon. I have a song by her stuck in my head. <laughs> I never, I didn't listen to a ton of Britney. I think as a, as a youngin though, I remember, I remember uh, having one of those, like one of those little radios that had the little, these little chips that you stuck into it. And it would play like a section of a song. And I think I had some Britney Spears songs for that. That was like, I remember running around the elementary school with that. <laughs> and like but kids trying to steal my little chips that plugged in. My sister was just taking quirky pictures in Hot Topic. I had to explain to her <laughs> that was all we did for fun in 2010. Hit clips, yes. <laughs> Hit clips. I heard about Y2K Revival a lot, but uh, what I've seen didn't seem to lean into emo scene. Uh, I think I've seen a little bit of kids wanting that. See, I still love this look for him. Maybe he's just like a chill dude. Maybe he's got like this going on. Or is he like full... What if he wants to be a vampire? What if he pretends he's a vampire in honor of his mom? Like he, he's he's mad that he didn't get the vampire genes. And he walks around looking like a vampire kid. I kind of love that for him. He's in his Twilight era. <laughs> he's in his I read all the Twilight books all over, over the summer era. <laughs> I don't know. I was closeted nerdy girl who secretly wanted to be to be a hot witch. <laughs> That's fun. It feels way too soon for trends for my teen years to be back already. I'm not okay. Yeah, I know. I agree. Uh, I've seen a few people on TikTok having the 2000s emo scene style. Yeah. One of my little cousins who's 20 years younger than me tried to introduce me to Fallout Boy over the summer. Oh, no. <laughs> That's funny. There's been an emo scene revival. Okay. Twins must have mission. Resurrect mommy. Yes. They definitely have to have that. I think I'm going to give him this. I'm going to, we're going to do this and we're going to find him. I think, does he not have feet in this or does his feet look weird? Oh, they were there. They were like in the floor. Oh God. Wait, but wait, the, I was going to do his hair next, but like the cap. The cap is interesting. I think I need to fix it though so that it, Gives him the right hair when he's sleeping because he had like a different hair that wasn't shaved. I don't know how I feel about the the beanie. The beanie's kind of fun for this look. I kind of like his little beanie look. Let me let me uh open him up though and create a sim. We'll crack him open. We gotta do an autopsy. Oh boy, look at you. Look at you. His nose is pretty normal too. His chin is just really rough though. As an old, almost 30. Uh, it kind of warms my heart to see the kiddos embracing stuff for me. Yeah, that's also kind of fun. That's a good way to look at it too. <laughs> can I, yeah, I can. I can link it. I I got it off of. Um, I found it on the Sims Two defaults database. Um, I believe it's a default for one of the hat hairs. I wish I could remember which one to make it easy to find it. But I can also link it. I can find it. Yeah, he has a good nose too. I heard from a friend that MCR is not emo. I was disappointed. That's interesting. That they would think that... Are you saying that they, they, they think they're not emo? That's weird. If his sister is Miranda... that's Wait, he's Hal Cap. That's true. He's literally Hal. Wait, why are these two the Caps? <laughs> he's Hal Cap and his sister's Miranda. <laughs> wait. <laughs> it's, it's happening. Okay, let me do this because... So we have this one. Yeah, see, it takes it off and it gives him this, but I'm going to give him the buzz cut. Give him this. It's not quite the same, but it's close enough. <laughs> MCR was the emo, yeah. Literally wrote the emo national anthem, yeah. So whoever was saying that, did <laughs> they didn't know what they was talking about. I'm guessing. And then this, okay, the hat's back. There we go. Oh, Gerard Way himself apparently apparently said that they aren't emo. Emo was different when he was a kid, apparently. Okay. Interesting. I guess, you know, it's also common... Common, like... For musicians to, like, not be necessarily directly involved in, like... The, the influences or the genre that they're, like, causing. You know, if that makes sense. Like, sometimes it's just the, the people take it and do what they will with it, and they just keep doing their own thing, <laughs> if that makes sense. I don't know. There we go. Look at you. Look at this little emo guy. You're not supposed to be sleeping in here. You need to sleep in here. 
Okay, how will we get to sleep? Everybody needs to get sleeping. You need to sleep. You need to sleep. Oops. Oh, you're sleeping in the other room. Where are you? You're... Oh, you're down here. Oh, I forgot there's a room down here. I, I, we're gonna figure out what we're gonna do with this room. I'm gonna have you sleep up here. We got a lot of empty space in this house now. Um, are you not... Okay, you're going. Um, also my parents are 70s and 80s music nerds. Jokes on them, I like 40s, 50s, 60s, 70s, 80s, yeah. I'm definitely- I was one that got wicked into 60s, 70s stuff for a while, and now I just still am vaguely there. <laughs> I just- it's always like my go-to at this point. The style isn't technically emo, but the emo kids just loved them and so they became part of it, yeah. Um, I also recently learned that emo actually started in the mid 80s, but became more mainstream in the 2000s. I feel like there was a lot of like interesting alternative things going on um, in the 80s, so I feel like I could I could understand that. All right, so now we haven't really been paying attention to Scoot. We also didn't look at everybody's traits. What did everybody get for traits? So you have absent-minded, brave, night owl, and angler. And then little tough has brave, loves the cold, bot fan, and inappropriate. He could be a bot builder. Okay, we got angler, neurotic, easily impressed, and schmoozer. And then absent-minded, brave, vegetarian, and great kisser. Okay. And then eccentric lo loner and photographer's eye. Wait, she got photographer's eye and she's got her picture of her of her of of Peepaw in the in the family here. We gotta I'm gonna be sad. I I'm always afraid of putting these up because I'm like afraid of wait, I just realized I just realized this what what is this? <laughs> Why is our TV up on a wait? What <laughs> wait. I thought I, I think I used a different what? Didn't I use, like, one of these? I thought I put one of these out here. Did I accidentally get rid of the TV I was using? That's weird. Alright. <laughs> the TV stand on the coffee. It's like, it's, it's already got a stand. Oh! Scoot? <laughs> Scoot says, I got- it's now there's space for me. <laughs> Scoot says, I'm gonna sit there now. She wants to fall in love. But she's afraid of having a baby. I think Scoot should quit her job now that she's got big money from, from Peepaw. I'm gonna have her call work. I'm gonna do it. Unless she gets a want to get her job back. Sounds like deleted- yeah, I think I deleted something by accident. Which is weird. Cause I never- I haven't changed my build buy stuff in a while. Gotta be brave to crush on your stepsister, not this. <laughs> oh god. How will how will Scoot react? How will Scoot react? Let's close the cage. Also, this for those who may have forgotten, this bird's name is Will Wright. Uh oh, she's crying. Let's have her change into your everyday also. Um, so we have to make sure Will Wright does not get loose around the house. Scoot. If I fits, I sits. <laughs> she scoots on over. She scooted. There you go. Laszlo got fired from his job, paranormal job. Much said. That's sad. I like Laszlo and paranormal. I think that's great. <laughs> you mean the creator of the sim? <laughs> yes, it's his him. Look at this is this is the Will Wright. He made it all. Look at that guy. Look at him. He's. Yep, that's that's him. That's the guy. That's the boy. <laughs> Will Wright? More like Bill Wrong. <laughs> okay. Okay. What is like her hobby and stuff? Also, am I hearing this being- who's out here? Aren't you supposed to sleep? Didn't I tell you to sleep? Or did you get back up? Oh, your energy's not bad, but it's like 11 p.m. I'm not really sure what to do with you, buddy. Charisma. Okay. 
Um, what are we going to do with you, ma'am? She likes arts and crafts. Maybe we need to, I did have a, this out here. Maybe we'll, uh, maybe like this room. This was Aurora's room. Yeah, I can like put some, uh, here we go. Crystal bath. I love those, those two emotes together. <laughs> <laughs> Thank Chris you. Colbert just subscribed. Cat jam vibe. Cat jam vibe. Cat jam vibe. Cat, cat jam, jam vibe. vibe. Cat jam vibe. Cat jam vibe. Cat jam vibe. Thank you, Crystal Bet, for the resub. <laughs> I appreciate it. Also, there's a bunch of homework in here. I just realized. Where should I put it? Maybe this is the homework room down here. Maybe that's what this will be. Turn on the sound a little. Like, what if I put a bunch of little desks in here? How many kids we got? We got like five? One, two, three, four, five. We do. Four teenagers. Remember, it feels like just the other day, we only had, we had like four toddlers running loose. Remember the chaos of having a household full of toddlers here? And now we've got a bunch of teenagers. This is, this is wild. This feels weird. Let's just- I'm just gonna get them all a desk and then use the desk locator. Oops. I meant to have that be white. The chaos. I know, I remember the chaos of this household. Uh, this, and then we got four. One more here, I guess. It's kind of goofy, but it works. Mm, actually, that doesn't work. That, that's not gonna be goofy, isn't it? How do I... how do I... How do I do this? <laughs> I guess if I took out the... If I made this a square... <laughs> Four teenagers sounds like a hormonal nightmare. I think you're right. It's, that's very true. Oops. Do this. See if this will maybe work. There we go. The placement would be uh I'm in the, the city right now. Why are there cell why are the cell towers trash? Yeah, that's weird. That all oh, keeps buffering. Interesting that you'd be like you think in a city it would be a little bit better off. I guess we'll just get them some like basic cheap chairs. Ooh, maybe these guys. I like these are these ones that are converted from the Sims 3 University, and I just love the style of them. Oh, I don't think they're gonna- I don't know if we're, this is gonna work like I wanted it to. Maybe I can actually bring this all out one square? Hmm. I'm gonna do this. I think I'm gonna have to bring it out another square. Yeah, Scoot got too many damn kids. <laughs> for her goddamn house. We're gonna have to upgrade her. I'll have to pick out a new house for her. I got so many maintenance things to do in this in this hood. I gotta I gotta fix things up. We'll have to do it. We'll have a maintenance only stream sometime. There we go. This that'll work. This will work. I'll have to just have like a to do list. I'm like, all right, today we're we're doing this, 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 and this, and this, <laughs> and that's it. Um, can I do that? <laughs> Should we have a bird sanctuary with little huts? I love that. Her family too big for her goddamn house. <laughs> there's there's some same brain happening between the two. Nothing wrong with having a lot of kids as long as you can afford it, yes. Same with having no kids if it makes you happy, yes. Yeah. Because there's like those really kooky families that like believe that they should have a billion kids and then they don't actually have any money for them and it's kind of sad. I don't know if this is going to be an issue. I don't think it will. But I think I'm going to get an above headlight. Just... There we go. 
Okay, look at that. Look at our proper little room. Scoots a Duggar! Yes! <laughs> okay, so this is Nacho. This is Little Bustard. I'm just gonna make sure whoever claims this, it's like their homework is here. We'll do that. We'll do that in the morning when they're all up. Look at that. Look at our look at our little homeschool. What if Scoot Scoot now that Scoot's <laughs> quit work, she can homeschool the kids. <laughs> but I mean Automod. Automod caught that. Automod didn't like the word crotch in, in that message. Okay. Yeah, they have their own personal classroom. Just got some earrings I ordered and they sent me two pairs instead of one. Free earrings? Are they the exact same pair? Interesting. I remember that happened to me once years ago. I remember I ordered a, a, a like a vinyl record, like a, a vintage record, and they sent me a free one that I never paid for. And it was like I looked up the serial number on it. It was an old looking record. It was a, it was Abbey Road by the Beatles was the free one they gave me. I thought, well, maybe they just had an extra and threw it in there or something. And I looked it up. You can look up the serial code number on the, the records, and it was like an original pressing from 1969 of Abbey Road. And I was like, I don't know if I was supposed to receive this, but I'm not going to say anything. <laughs> okay. The custom scheduler is goof. And I still am getting a little bit of errors that I need to iron out. I don't know what's going on. Scoot can teach them how to fly south for the winter. <laughs> Have I heard the new Beatles song that came out recently? I haven't. Is it like a boot, like a something that came out from a, uh, like an unfinished studio song or something? That's it. I haven't. Yeah, freebies. Having kids sounds nice, but I want, I don't want to go through childbirth. Yes. <laughs> clean up, clean up. Have you, now Scoot can like breathe. And just be home and like take care of her family, but she needs to find her a new man before her money dries up. <laughs> also, yes, yes, and Crystal Beth says hello to the YouTube people. <laughs> Crystal Beth. I'm gonna clean this one up. Oh, you're, okay, I see. Never mind. I see what we're doing here. Oh, oh, we're doing it all. Okay. I never remember what they clean up and what they don't. I don't think we need this thing anymore. I'm going to say that, and then she's going to end up having a baby. But she doesn't want to have a baby. If she does, it'll be an accident. It'll be an accidente. Anyway, arts and crafts. I got distracted from what I was doing. The bird is flying free. I'm going to have her come up here and uh, paint a little bit. I'm just going to do an invisible light, because I don't feel like dealing with it. I also have a fear of having a baby. <laughs> Honestly, a nightmare. <laughs> one thing that, like, sends me, one thing that, like, is those videos of, like, somebody where, like, the baby is kicking and, like, you can see the foot coming through, like, the pregnant person's stomach, and that, that's, like, I'm, like, I am an enjoyer of horror movies. I can watch some things, but that sends me. I can't watch, that creeps me the heck out. I can't do that. I can't see those videos. <laughs> I'm like, I cannot. I cannot. I don't remember the pains of childbirth, but it might just be an anomaly. Yeah, that's interesting. Okay, we're gonna... We're gonna do like a little decor. A little bit of this. We're gonna have a little painting section. I think this will be Scoot's new little painting room. There we go. We used up our space well. Ugh, what about the fact that it takes your, a year for your internal organs to move back into place after giving childbirth? Oof. 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 <laughs> I, I don't want to... I, <laughs> I don't know what to say about that. <laughs> I feel like your mind is pregnant right now, and I feel that... And to feel the baby kick is actually really cool. That's... I don't like it, but you can... I mean, you can like it. <laughs> you know? <laughs> that, that can, you can... That's fine. <laughs> I'm just some random jerk. Like, don't listen to me. <laughs> I'm not squeamish, but uh, one time some girl at work were talking about their labor and post-labor stories. And I almost passed out. Literally had to lay my head on the desk. Oh, no. <laughs> I had some kind of a pregnancy phobia, too. 
can be a bit weird in social situations. Yeah, I don't know. It just freaks me out. Yeah, I'm sure it's a, a good thing for those that, that want it. It's a good thing to... <laughs> it's a good sign. Okay, so she's making a wonderful little painting of some lady. That's good. Scoot's newfound love for arts and crafts. No, she, well, that's it's a long time love, but she's finally free because of her man's money. I'm going to lock. Uh, allow me only for right now. I'll, I'm going to try to remember that in case she invites someone over, like she actually finds somebody to love, which I don't know who. who who's the next lover for Scoot? I mean, we have plenty of like towny men that could possibly be with her. God, look at this little beast. Courage Twilight Breath. Look at that little guy. Dang. Mm, I don't know who like As far as chemistry, not her the only person she has chemistry with is is Mervy. I hate this. <laughs> Would have been nice to have an 18 hour pregnancy. There you go. That would be the easy part. But the, can you imagine the overpopulation that will result in an 18 hour human pregnancy <laughs> across the world. That would be scary. Okay. Um, that was a quick painting too for one dollar. Good job. I'm gonna have you go to sleep. Also oh she wants to buy a recliner. Oh she wants to buy a florist bench. Should she get a florist bench? Can I, can I fit it out here? I can fit one out, out on the deck. Scoot's gonna Scoot is gonna um Scoot is going to treat herself. She's going to start decorating the house with flowers. Ooh, there was a weird lag with that thing. Like, it didn't like me putting it down. There we go. There we go. I think the worst thing about kids is that could turn out to be normal psychos and you can't tell. <laughs> That's true. I mean, not normal, total. Yeah. <laughs> That's hard. Oh god, the horror of how quickly- Oh god, I don't even want to re- <laughs> Oh no. That would be- It'd be like some kind of alien- <laughs> Alien monster inside of you. <laughs> My husband died. Better spend the inheritance. She gotta treat herself, man. Also, recliner? I don't really feel like fitting a recliner in here. Let me save. Everybody- So- I just realized we're missing a bed for one kid. <laughs> I just really because isn't he's still down here. We have five kids. We have four kids beds. Um, I guess I I didn't realize that. Oops. What if or no, how about control Z? We'll put this here. Or maybe we'll put that there. Oh, I have the wrong thing. do this and then we'll do I put like this one in here I guess that might work we might have some routing issues but <laughs> welcome back <laughs> welcome back dreamy oh no what did butt spot do the kid can sleep on the recliner the nut can sleep on the recliner <laughs> butt spot no <laughs> This, this whole interaction. How many? I'd like to look up how many times butt spot no has been uttered. Has been uttered in this chat. The nut can sleep on the recliner. Wasn't there a horror movie where time passed super fast and a woman was pregnant for only a few hours and gave birth or something? I don't know. I haven't. I haven't seen it. I, I could see that being a thing. Oops. I'm trying to scroll down. There we go. He ain't wrong, but he shouldn't say it. Okay, buddy, old pal. Oof. Oh my god. How did his how did his social drop so intensely while playing that? Does he have a girly friend? Oh, he does. I forgot his he this, so Mr. Tufted Titmouse here is bestie is is dating um Electra Zipkin, who was one of the orphanage kids who got adopted by the Brandstones. But he's got a girlfriend who isn't his sister. <laughs> Thankfully, he isn't his stepsister. So that's a, that's a start. He's he's got a leg up on everybody else in this household. Huh. Oh, it's called Old. Or, I you know I think I've heard of something like it was a really weird movie called Old. I think I've heard of that. You want to go to sleep or not? Okay.
I don't like her pajamas. She has like these weird pajamas, but I guess I'll let her keep them. Uh-oh. Forest Rain and Cheeto are no longer friends. Forest Rain and her father are no longer friends. Cunned heavens. <laughs> That's a good one. Oh, that was a freaky movie from what I remember. Okay. Yeah, I haven't... I don't think I've... I've I don't think I've seen anything of it. Uh-oh. Who? what are you doing, buddy? Yeah, I mean, if it... I could, I could wait a little bit. I'd like to have you... Oh, no. We got a social bunny situation. I'd like for him to invite his girlfriend over for social. But it's a little bit early, I think. Oh, you can go talk to the bird. <laughs> this just says... Play with Will Wright. <laughs> I like that it just... With the bird. Play with Will Wright. Okay, bud. Crystal Beth has a 40% chance of being abducted by aliens tonight. That's not a... That's not a big percentage, but a 90... You're 99% romantic and fertile. That's... Interesting. <laughs> Will doesn't deserve this. Okay, wow, that's boosting social pretty decently. At least it looks like it is. It's got three arrows. Okay. Okay. Can you look inside the social bunny to see who's in there? That's a good question. Where did the social bunny go? Oh, I'm trying to zoom out. My damn mouse. Oops. Can we can we see? I don't know. Hmm. Doesn't look like it. we want to see who's in there. What if we do? What if we do this? Can I gussy up? Oh, dang it. I was going to see if I could gussy up and change into... Can I make selectable? No. He's, he's just an object. <laughs> Seems like he's just an object. <laughs> nut twist? <laughs> Not the nut twist. <laughs> I need to save another screenshot of that one. Oh my goodness. Not the nut twist. <laughs> Do you think the social bunny has a heartbeat? I feel like... I don't know. Does this thing have a heart? That's a good question. Does this thing have a heart? I don't think so. <laughs> womp womp. Okay, we're awake. You're- you're just- everybody's trying to get to the fridge. I think Scoot needs to make breakfast for everybody. I think you need to stop. Go here. Oh, this chair is goofing. I guess I gotta delete it and put a new one down. Oops. Is that one gonna- there we go. Okay, are you- oh, you're getting cereal. And have you served breakfast? Make some cereal. She does not have very good skills. I think Scoot needs to work on her her parenting, her like housewife skills. She doesn't have good cooking. <laughs> you twisted my nut. Please respond. <laughs> I cannot. <laughs> I cannot. <laughs> like when you hug it, is there a noticeable pulse? Is it warm? I feel like maybe it's eerily cold. I feel like maybe it's just, oh my God, look at it just. Look at it just being here while he's sitting here. Wait, I need the I need the ceilings on. <laughs> I love this little screenshot. <laughs> this is like this should be like I could take make it black and white and make it like some weird avant-garde video. <laughs> I need this Dominique, I don't care about your cursed self. <laughs> oh, thank you very much for the raid, Soul Soul TV. Welcome in. We were playing Life Stories. That's cool. Are you how how far along are you in the Life Stories? We just we were we played it toward the beginning of the year. It's a very fun. I like I like all the stories spin-offs. There we go. <laughs> the bunny grosses me out so much. The bunny is gross. The bunny is gross. We just ended chapter four. Very nice. Okay. I'm trying to remember what chapter four entails. I'm not good at remembering all the different different parts. 
Okay, there we go. We got some cereal. Here, have some cereal, buddy. There we go. Oh, she might take it outside, because we had some outside... outside seating here. Okay, I also gotta fix Skara's hair. I don't know. We got some... this, this... oh my god. Oh no, look at him! Wait, I haven't had him, like, do, like, this kind of... like, idol. I didn't know he just sits here and, like, mocks you. <laughs> he just sit there and mock you? Laugh loudly? Oh my. <laughs> He's terrifying. <laughs> Have you ever played any of the... Oh, Riley just went on a date at the park with Mickey. I remember that. I do remember... Okay. Mickey asked her to be his girlfriend. Okay. Very cool. Okay. I remember that part. <laughs> um, but yes, thank you very much for the raid. Um, but have you ever played any of the Telltale games? I don't think so. What kind of, what kind of, what are the Telltale games? Like, what are their titles and stuff? Thank you for the, the follow, new bet. <laughs> um, I bet the suit has a texture of a really old, worn out plushie that used to be soft, but is now crunchy and smells like mildew. Yeah. It's the mom having her own room while shoving all the children in one room. Yes. <laughs> That's how it works in this household. She's got her own king-size bed to herself. Like, not really crunchy, but just rough to the touch and nasty. Yes, I think so. <laughs> I meant to say, add to sandwich, so visceral. Not sure why smiley face popped up. That's funny. <laughs> Story big ace. Oh, The Walking Dead. I, have, I, haven't, I haven't played The Walking Dead one. Um, they're like, comic books come to life. Okay. Oh, the, yeah, the, like the Walking Dead ones, the Wolf Among Us. Okay. Yeah, I haven't played any of those, surprisingly. Sims 2 Bunny is not as bad as the Sims 1 Clown. That's true. I, I do. The Sims 1 Clown is very cursed. What is his name again? It's... Is it just... Isn't it... Is it Bozo? Or is he... Oh... <laughs> The way he just got up in the camera, in my face, sir? <laughs> Sonny the Clown, yes. <laughs> I just looked and he just like hopped over and he was just there. <laughs> okay, he said, oh, me? You're talking about me? Oh, he's leaving. <laughs> that was scary. I do, I do not like it looking at us. Yeah, that was creepy. <laughs> also, thank you for the follow, Sosil. <laughs> oh my goodness. That was, that was a, that was something. That was something. I'll tell you that much. All right, everybody's, look at, look at all these cool kids eating food. Oh, you just stole your, your sister's <laughs> bowl of cereal. I'm just curious to see if anything would naturally happen between Cheeto and, Cheeto and, uh, also, what is your hair? Wait, what is, what is her hair this? Why is that her hair? Why are you wearing this hair? That's not... She usually has the shortcut. <laughs> Wait, what have I missed? Um, so... So, of course, Cheeto and... Cheeto and Nacho are the unofficially adopted siblings but the game doesn't recognize it so for some reason uh blue footed booby wants to fall in love with cheeto they have, she has a crush on cheeto nothing has happened yet and we're really not sure if we want to go through with it because it's weird but at the same time like it's kind of funny to see if something happens on its own that's where we're at <laughs> so far we've only gotten the want it's it's kind of kooky. Um, but why? Yeah, why is she? Is her hair? I wonder if the hair she has isn't enabled for. Yeah, that might be a me. That might be a me problem. I think I forgot to set it up correctly. Well, I don't know what I should give her first, like sleepwear. Maybe it's a wig and her hair is actually shaved. No, maybe I could give her like a little hair. Oh, here we go. We could give her like a little. We could let her like a little bonnet at night. There we go. And then, well, then it's not on this one either. 
I mean, she's not really going to be swimming. Is there like an updo look I can give her? Maybe just like something? I don't know. That's not, that's too much hair. I don't know. I'm just going to give her something. See, like what? Okay, I'm going to have to go in and fix that hair. It's not supposed to be like disabled for literally everything. I don't know. We're probably not going to see her do that. So we'll just do this for now. <laughs> Booby. <laughs> Booby wants to bump nuts with Cheeto. Now there's a sentence. Butt Spot should jump on that. <laughs> no. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Um, also, hello, Nubet. Sorry. You use any mods? Yes. I use lots of mods. <laughs> I use lots of mods. Uh, let's see. I If I do exclamation point, I think, is it defaults or default? There we go. Um, on that link, I have a list of all the mods I use. I do need to update it for a couple of things, but it's pretty much everything. So I do use lots of mods. My game is more mod than game. That's true. <laughs> That's true at this point. But, like, is there any other way to play The Sims 2? <laughs> you know... <laughs> yeah, no problem. I, I've got, like I said, I have most things listed in there. Okay. You are now tired, but I'm going to cheat your energy a little because I don't want to deal with it. And you already ate breakfast. Look at that. Wow. He wants to buy a car. He could. Should this, this household should totally have like a minivan. I love that Peepaw's grave is just chilling out here. Yeah, I think we need a proper graveyard. I feel like I remember trying to make one, and then I don't know if I went through with it or not. Let's put him out here by the cactus. <laughs> I don't think we need all these kids' toys out here anymore. I don't know if I want this here either. It's just, like, weird. I might just... The problem is, is I don't think that, like, I can actually fit a, a driveway here. We need a bigger lot. Let's see. Hmm. Mm, be, I could technically squeeze one in here, but that's kind of weird. I guess I could move the gate and everything over. And just have them walk right out to the car, right? If I did this. Um, and then like, is it what's four wide? I can do this. And then it's like at the crosswalk zone there. It's not the end of the world, I guess. And yeah, we can put these guys here. Umba, umba, umba. If, if I do this, and then I can use my own concrete, that could maybe work. Oops. Oop. Oh, no. Not the... No! I want the fence. I don't know. This feels goofy, though. Maybe I should just give up on the... <laughs> because it's like, this is wide open, and then we got a little gate. <laughs> It's like, that doesn't make sense. I don't know, because this technically... Maybe we'll just not have a front fence. <laughs> technically like this, I don't know. And over there, kids, by the cactus, that's where Peepaw. Buried Peepaw. Yeah. Right? Like, I could know. I could do something like this here. Peepaw paw. Oops. Daddy Peepaw. Because it just doesn't make sense for them to have, like, the gate there. 
I don't know. Maybe we could just get rid of the fence altogether. I mean, we don't have little kids anymore. And I feel like that was part of it was to contain the children. We have like one child now, you know. Maybe I could just get rid of the whole thing. <laughs> pee pee paw paw. Wait. Big brain. That was a big brain move. Oh, wait. Pee pee paw. Okay. Pee 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 paw paw. <laughs> Anybody who doesn't know what the hell that even is, is about is just like, sorry? <laughs> Sorry. I'm just gonna do this and then uh, I gotta buy the car. I get so distracted with the placement that I don't have- I feel like we need a big van. What if um- oh my gosh I'm trying to zoom in my stupid mouse. I need to buy a new mouse. Oh whoops I also didn't uh, bring it out here. There we go. How about uh- <laughs> now hear me out. <laughs> hear me out. <laughs> Uh, where do you get the most of your CC furniture and stuff? Do you have a favorite furniture creator? Ooh, that's a hard... That's hard. I don't know if... I ha I really don't have one. You know, the, the one that does come to mind for me is... There's a creator called Pineapple Forest. I love a lot of their CC. Not necessarily just furniture, but they do a lot of really great, like, Maxis match stuff. Like, really true Maxis stuff. And a lot of, like default replacements for objects that like freshen things up but they're still maxes they're really good i like a lot of their stuff they also have some really good like create a sim stuff but other than that i don't know if i have like a particular favorite because i do try to be kind of light with the custom content um when it comes to like the, the furniture and everything although i still have i still have quite a lot Yeah. Hi there, Soji. Are you going to be able to upload your past streams of Calicundia to YouTube? Yes. So I do have, um, I do have a, I don't know, can I add? Does that work? I don't know if that works. I do have a, a, a channel where I upload them. So I have been. Let me see if I can do. Um, let's see. Oh wait, I think it's not Sundog stream, it's Sammy... Here it is. So, there we go, I got it. There we go. <laughs> Sorry, I think that was the wrong at. Yeah. Oh, I guess it is Sundog's at Sundog streams, okay. But yeah, I've been uploading them on there. It's been working out pretty well. So... Yeah. Um, yeah. <laughs> I, I, I'm gonna try and upload this one too. I don't know what way I'm gonna do it since I'm doing like the YouTube one and the Twitch one, but yeah, we'll see how it works. There we go. I just got him a little mini van for now. There we go. We got a proper vehicle. I, I think it does need to be Scoot's though. Scoot needs to own the vehicle. What if, should the, some of the teens get like teen jobs? I don't know. Oh, they want to, oh, he wants to get into private school. We got to do that. We got a call. Let's call. Um, how do we do that? Oh, invite headmaster. We definitely got to do that. Uh, the local private school headmaster is interested in coming over for dinner. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Boop Scoot and Boogie country song. That's true. I, I feel like Scoot would enjoy that song. I think she's I think Scoot probably had a uh, was a really good line dancer back in the day or square dancer or whatever. Whatever it is. OK, be over for dinner at 5 p.m. Oh, like today, 5 p.m. Also, looks like our dude's got a patch. Uh oh, we object is almost out of food. OK. I don't understand why I keep saying that, because it's it's only ever, like, a $6 food bill. I don't know. All right, I'm going to have him. He's fine right now. Can you change into your clothing? Like, why are you walking around in your, pee, in your like, undies? Change into every day. Um, let's call Sim. We're having him invite his girlfriend over. Okay, Bluefooted and uh, Nacho are not quite getting along. 
Okay, we're gonna call Electra over. Right over. Uh, have you heard of that decade chat? I think I have heard of it a little bit. Yeah, that you work your way... I don't know, is it like each generation is a different decade? I think that could be interesting. I'd love to have some kind of little short challenge that I could do in The Sims for like YouTube videos, but I can't figure out exactly what I would want to do. I'm not really sure. Okay, sir? He's just playing with the fridge? You're gonna break the fridge, dude. Also, you could change into your everyday. That would be nice. Actually, I'll just have you change. I was gonna have her take a shower, but... Be tormented. No. Asylum challenge? That's interesting. Also, I saw Pesco wanted his daughter to go to private school, but they're living in a trashy hotel room. Oh, my. <laughs> yeah, I do love the little... The little funny... Little funny dance here. Why are we having a stare-off? Blue-footed booby! It's it's Dreamer calling for Little Bustard. It's Little Bustard's dream to be friends with Dreamer. Okay, thank you for hanging out, Toby. I appreciate your help. Have a good night. Have a good rest of your night. What time are we even on? Okay, we're at three 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 hours. Um. Yeah, let's save. Why not? Of course, usually on, so usually on Twitch, we do our little, um, we do our little, uh, like, machinima break, where we watch machinima. But I'm a little worried, I don't know exactly how that will go over on the YouTube, because I think that YouTube picks up on the, the sound of, that, like, the, might pick up on, like, the copyrighted music, more in a more strict way than Twitch does. But I'm also wondering if the way that I have my audio split, if, oh, she's here. If YouTube won't hear the music the same way. I'm not really sure. I'm a little bit, but I don't want to get in trouble on the YouTubies. <laughs> so I have to wait for her to, do I have to greet her? Okay, wait, she wants to, to kiss her. Or not. I guess we're not. Here, we'll give her a kiss. Machinima. Yeah, I know. I'd like to watch do a little machinima break, but I don't know how it will work. Unless I watched one that definitely didn't have copyrighted music in it. That'd be the thing. Oh, we're a inside joke. She might not like a dirty joke. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. We can kiss her. One's creativity level. I don't know, they could like hang out. What a busy household, man. This crew is is just a lot there's a lot going on here. <laughs> a very active family. Does she have any interest? Not her only chemistry relationships being the twins. <laughs> this is broken. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Machinima, please, master. Yeah. <clears throat> I guess the test of it would be if... Here, I'm gonna play... Let's try something. We'll have to do a little test. Um, If I play... If I pull something up and play it on on YouTube, uh, I'm gonna pull up. So so the way that it works is I have a audio splitter that works for um that works for Twitch. So that like while we're while we're streaming, you can hear it. But when it's saved, it only saves the first track and not the second track. I don't know how best to explain that so that you don't actually hear the music when Twitch saves it. I don't know how that works on the YouTube. Um, if I were to... Let's see. 
Here, we're going to play us. Let's try playing like a Sims 2 pop music. I'm going to play a dumb ad. And then I'll have to see if the YouTube folks can hear it. That'll be the test. Is if the YouTube folks can hear. I'm turning up. I have music playing right now. And if they can't hear it, that means YouTube's not picking up on my second track. I'll let it play for a sec. <laughs> it's very loud. <laughs> Love to see. You can hear it? Okay. Thank you. <laughs> so it is picking up on the second track. Okay. That's good to know. That it is actually... It is picking up on it. So that means that... Yeah, you can hear it on the YouTube. So that means that, uh... If... <laughs> Gogo is in Simlish. Yeah, so that means that, like... There's a good chance that YouTube will... Because YouTube is a lot more strict with copyright. If you're playing copyright music on their stream, they can, like, shut down your stream. So that's why I wouldn't... I mean, we could watch a machinima if it was maybe, like, one that I knew didn't have copyright music. That's the thing. So I don't know. That's that's where I'm not sure. Okay, these two are chilling. They're talking through the table. <laughs> Interestingly. Okay, these two... Does she want to learn cus couples counseling? <laughs> and YouTube to give us machinima. I don't think the YouTube folks would appreciate it. Maybe at the end. Maybe maybe that'll be... Maybe Machinima is now something we do at the end. And I'll say, okay, bye, YouTube. We're done playing, which is not what we're doing right now. I'm not done. Don't be confused. I'm not done playing right now. But at the end, if I were to be like, okay, bye, YouTube, and I end the YouTube's live, if you want to watch Machinima, you got to come over here to Twitch, and then we watch it on Twitch. <laughs> maybe that's the move. <laughs> maybe that's what we'd have to do. For the for our, our ending, so Machinima's always at the end. That could be that could be a way to get around it. <laughs> you were the unwanted step kids, yes. <laughs> exactly. Okay, I'm gonna have her study. She wants to study couples counseling, which is interesting. I don't think couples counseling is gonna bring your dead husband back. Well we can try we can wish. We can always wish. You are hungry. You gotta go to the bathroom. I don't know. I'm I'm like, oh boy. Okay, I'm gonna have him just order groceries. I don't feel like having to go somewhere. What are you doing? This girl is running everywhere. I know the squawking in this house is a lot. You're hungry too. I guess everybody's. We gotta wait for food. Here, why don't you order delivery? Since you're just standing here, instead of your sister who's... or your stepsister. Um, let's do groceries. Bum, bum, bum. Uh, actually, we got money to go all the way. Okie dokie. Oh, we got, a, we got a Bubba walking by. Bubba Bong. This bird's like obsessed. She's like so hungry and just like did she just did she just run in there and flush the toilet and run out? She's got like the running bug, I think. <laughs> she just she's going nuts. She's going kooky crazy. I feel like these two could go for like a little good thing I didn't uh a good thing I realized that we we're out of groceries before the goddamn headmaster shows up, which is gonna be soon because it said 5 p.m. So he's, like, about to show up right as we're getting our groceries. Oh boy. Scoot, you're gonna have to get yourself together. Get dressed. And have you get up real quick. I assume, unless it's, like, the next day at 5 p.m. Okay, somebody's gonna answer. Accept delivery. Oh, are you- Oh, little Buster is accepting delivery, apparently. Oh, everybody's like, groceries! We're starving. Let her in, man. Uh-oh, he's here. You guys, let her in the house. Please. Please, have mercy. Let her in the house so she, we can all make food. Oh, no. 
And so, could one of the kids serve dinner? Well, let's have somebody else serve dinner. <laughs> they are a flock of birds, literally. Okay. Because we're going to need... So can The adult has to, like, give the tour, right? Or can, can the kid... One of the kids give a tour? Oh. Wait, somebody's got to put these, put these away. I guess I won't have her do this. Let's... Oh my gosh. I don't know what's going on. Okay, can we stop? Can we... Oh my goodness. This household. Oh, she's filthy. I'm going to cheat her in her... No, you know what? I'm not going to cheat her energy. This... Oh boy. Okay, everybody... <laughs> <laughs> everybody I'm gonna I'm gonna strangle everybody in this household go here <laughs> the Zycax stress <laughs> the stress of the Zycax please where is he is he here oh he's out here let's greet yeah somebody distract him with a tour I guess I don't know can one of these kids Who's the one? He wants to get into to school, so let's have him. Schmooze about school? Or can only an adult give him a tour? I forget. I forgot the but yeah, wasn't there- there was something- somebody told me, um, a quick way to do- to... Was it... I think it's- yeah, they- I, oh, I'm trying to remember. Wasn't it like- he he likes he likes um is it like he likes espresso or something or a salad or turkey that's a good point okay blue footed booby is in the fridge i'm gonna make her a little less hungry maybe i can get her to serve i mean we only have mac and cheese i guess we'll make i guess so i don't know if we're gonna make it i don't know if we're gonna get in he doesn't like salad, okay. Uh -huh, uh -huh. I have to... Wait, so if I have you click entertain... Oh, he can give the tour. Okay, sorry. I keep jumping back and forth between who's making us dinner because I don't... I thought that she had to give the tour. Let's make at least spaghetti. He likes pork chops. She doesn't have... Wait. Make a group meal. Yeah, she doesn't have the ability to make those. See, if Levi was still alive, we could have done this because Levi had maxed cooking. We could have made it happen. But Levi is dead. Okay, he's going to give the tour. Not the TV being broken. I think that's going to give us bad points. He likes coffee. Also, hi, Morky. Sorry. <laughs> we, we've got some str we got the stress going on. <laughs> we've got Zycac stress. He likes coffee, drink hot tub. But it bugs sometimes. Okay. So should I get a coffee machine? Maybe I like a fancy one? I like this one. This one can be yellow, I think. Yeah, coffee's at least an easy one to do. <laughs> Bar <to> drinks? <laughs> Bard drinks? Okay, you need to stop this. Go here, and then do I show room? Uh oh, he's shaking his head. The children are starving. The TV is broken. There's a, there's a parrot screaming in the background. <laughs> this isn't good so far. Let's take him here. Let's show him our, our, our little school room. This is where we do our homework. I forgot to actually have them all assigned. No. <laughs> He's not impressed. <laughs> go to your room. Go to the room your sim has high environment. Can even be a bathroom. Okay. Okay, what about go here? That's not good. How about in this room? This is where we do the art. This is where we are culturally, uh, you know, taught children. We, we do... He's just, you know, he has an eye patch. I don't know why all my NPCs, like, have an eye patches. Do y'all think it would be dangerous if I killed a bunch of NPCs? Would the game just regenerate them? Like, it depends on how safe they are, obviously. Like, if they're the safe ones or not. But, like, like, random, like, the, the people that deliver the mail and, like, 
our delivery people. You like this room? Eh. Okay, that one was middle middle of the road. You quickly buy expensive art, our environment gets higher and gets super happy. Oh, what should I? Where should I put expensive art? And then we can sell it afterwards. Eight grand, five grand for this. We could buy like a couple of these and just stick them in in here. I gotta unlock this door though for them to go in here. We just have this random painting everywhere. There we go. This is our painting of the queen. The children pray to it every night. <laughs> they they're really big about on the queen. Okay, what is this? This one's. Wow, this one's only environment one, but it's eight grand. Okay, I'm not buying that one. There we go. I'm just gonna put more stuff out here. I'm gonna sell this for now. Because it's just broken. Oh, I can't. Why can't I sell it? Oh, there we go. We'll buy a different TV. <laughs> okay, put art in a room you haven't shown off yet. Okay. Well, let me do... So we've done those two. What about even just like here? That'd be good. Um, and just like in here, maybe. Okay, let me unlock this door. He wasn't crazy about this room. Move out of the way, Nacho. Nacho wants to sabotage this. Don't look at me. Okay, look, he loves the bedroom. He's like, maybe, maybe, uh, maybe this is the next father. Maybe this is, his name's Jagger. Or Jaeger? Jagger? Look at this guy. We, we didn't really take a moment to look at him. <laughs> He's pretty cool. I, I just imagine this him scurrying from room to room to move the art and the headmaster is just having no clue. Yeah, they're climbing through the windows. The children are like hauling things up through the windows. Okay, he likes that. Okay, we got 18 points. I don't think we're gonna make this happen, I'm gonna be honest. I know, another eye patch NPC. He likes the queen, he's a fan of the queen. We could schmooze him some more, though. Oh, I gotta show him this room out here. Okay. Or did I show him everywhere? No, I can show him this. <laughs> oh, oh, he already saw. Oh, he didn't see. Oh, well, I got to get him to go in the bathroom. I thought he he saw this room, but tech I thought he was technically seeing the bathroom because I was in there. OK, I got to wait for him to get in the room. OK, there we go. OK, check if your sim has high environment. He's going to like it, too. OK. Okay, don't scream at him. It was great to see the house. Okay, so then I can invite. Uh oh, where's the food? Where's all the Where's all the spaghetti, Scoot? Oh no, everybody's eating the spaghettiatas. How do I invite? Oh god, <laughs> how do I invite him to eat? Don't I ha do I have to click on him? Do I have to click on his? I mean, do I have to? What do I do? Call for dinner. There we go. Okay. He's going. He's going. Click on him. Yeah. I thought I had to click on... I had, I thought I had to click on, like, the, the big plate. <laughs> yeah. That's... Okay. I don't know if we're gonna... I don't know if we're gonna make it or not. We might. He's, he's devouring that sketty. He's devouring that sketty. Can we have her make coffee? No, Scoot, you can't go to sleep. This is your children's future. This is your children's future. Scoot, get out of bed. <laughs> Scoot doesn't care. Scoot. Scoot's depressed after Levi's death. I have Nacho and Chu to go schmooze him about their dead parent. That's true. You know, we're orphans, technically. Oh, what is she doing? Oh my god, Cheeto. Cheeto. 
<laughs> I got my sims to private school even though they lived in an obscure, way too small house. My sim gave quick dinner. Interesting. Oh! oh wait, no, wait, hold on. There's, there's some, there's some, <laughs> there's some, okay, wait. So, the headmaster is impressed with your family. Little Bustard, Nacho, Tufted Titmouse, and Blue-Footed Booby all got into private school, but not Cheeto. Cheeto did not get to go. Cheeto is not on that list. I think the game doesn't see Cheeto as our kid. I thought it wasn't Nacho or Cheeto, but Ch Nacho's on there. <laughs> Nacho does not get to go to private school. This is, is this the, remember we used to say that Cheeto was going to be the one that runs away. Maybe that's, maybe this is it. This is when she runs away. She starts hating everybody in the household. Maybe she's running around because she's like on drugs or something. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. Oh, do their, yeah, their grades have to be at a minimum. She's a D. A, A plus, D, A, C plus, A plus, yeah. She got a D. Yeah. <laughs> okay, apparently Stellano and Cheeto are no longer friends, little cow baby. Okay, maybe she'll, what, what are we gonna do? What's her rebel moment? Is she gonna start arguing with Scoot? She's gonna shove Scoot. What are you trying to do? She's trying to- I think she's trying to bathe herself in the sink out here. There we go, this is her- she's- she's having a rebel- rebel moment. Poor Cheeto. Cheddo's- uh, Cheddo? I just called her Cheddo. <laughs> Cheddar's- <laughs> Cheddar Zykak? She's like, my name's not Cheeto anymore, you guys, it's Cheddar. Because I've decided it's more avant-garde to be called Cheddar. Uh oh, they're fighting. <laughs> not, not like I told them to fight or anything, you know. Yeah, she's a rebellious teenage aggression. Uh oh, the kids are. Who just ran out of the room? Did he's? Oh, he's mortified. See, he's thinking about her. He ran out of the room. He's like, oh my god, how could my twin sister do this to to Scoot, who's given us everything? We'd be we'd be dead out in the desert without Scoot, and my sister's attacking her. <laughs> How could she? <laughs> Not gonna lie, I would also hate my household if my stepsister wanted to get with me, I know. She's like, her step stepsister's, like, giving her weird vibes, and then they don't let her into the damn private school with everybody else. <laughs> She's going through it. I guess technically if we had Cheeto run away, I could pay attention to what day it is that she runs away, and then we could just play her for a short time for like the rem oops, I didn't mean to hit that button. For like the remainder of our kind of like round, we go play her separately at some point after we finished playing this household. Ooh, Scoot won that. What if Scoot kicks her out? I'll I will save the game. Thank you for the save game, Redemption. Yeah, I was thinking like she could go live at the bus, and that's where she finds her mother's grave. Cause I'm I'm pretty sure I didn't delete the bus. I'm pretty sure. But can kids can a teenager actually Can a teenager actually who's this? Oh, this is blue footed boobies homework. Yeah, I gotta sort out the homework situation. Can I delete homework? No. <laughs> um I'm gonna do- I'm gonna assign their desks before I forget. Maybe claim desk. Oh wait. I'll have her claim this one. Her homework's on this one. I mean, it's silly to make her claim the desk in the middle of the drama, but you know. You yeah. know. Like... Oh, she she resurrects Rito and Rito and Scoop become enemies because Rito's like, you couldn't get my kid into private school? Exactly. And then she does start dating Blue. Yeah, because they're they're separate now. <laughs> and then Nacho has to pick a side. Ooh. Interesting. Okay, everybody, pretty much everybody. 
claim desk, please? And then, should I make it to where, like, she just starts disliking? Am I- is that just- oh, family only. Interesting. She sees Scoot as family, though, which is interesting. And she also sees her actual dad as family. Yeah. Um, now who was supposed to be down here? Oh, you. Have you claimed desk? Also, it's late, so let's have... Well, you're hungry. Here, just get some cereal. Okay, so how do we get her to leave? Am I allowed? I don't think I'm allowed to have her mo actually move out. Wait, it says find own place. Is it gonna let me do that? No, the drama. We got some drama festering. Girls, they're having a standoff. Okay. Or, or, okay. I need you to. I'm gonna bump your needs just so you'll do what I tell you to do. Okay, teens can live on their own. I think teens can live independently. That's fun. That's fun. You're gonna be a runaway. Oh, we just her. runaways. Then I'll run up at you. Okay. We gotta. She's running away Car very carefully, <laughs> signing <laughs> the paperwork to run away. <laughs> Carefully going on a Google search for available properties. Oh, I gotta sell back our, our stupid art. Forget about our dumb art. There we go. Oh. Y'all lied. <laughs> Y'all lied to me. Maybe she can't move out on her own. Nut Nut takes a picture of Queen with her. <laughs> Chido takes a picture of the Queen with her. She could. Yeah, so they can they can be on their own, but maybe it won't let them move out. Uh-oh, I've had two children abandoned because story progression moved their single parent out into their new boo's home. Oh no. I think I've had that happen before with story progression hoods where I've let it gone wild. Um, Only adults and elders can move out, so how... Would I do that? Would I have to? It's like I'd have to like pick a townie. Yeah, it's like I would have to pick a townie to move in there and then like have them like take her in and then get the townie to leave and then she'd be there. But you could leave her if everyone else moved out or use a townie to move in then move out with her. Yeah. I could, I could do that. Yeah. Oh, that's true. Yeah, because I could, if I teleport a townie here, and then have them join in. I have one of these. Um, let's see. Spawn sim menu. Spawn sim, uh, townies. Who's an adult? Aubrey's an adult. Aubrey needs a makeover too. Her her custom outfit got got taken away. <laughs> she's she's got quite a look right now. Or I, and I really like Aubrey, so I, I don't want her to have an ugly look, but we'll worry about that another time. Family, add Sim to family, Aubrey. And now Aubrey can leave. If I use, even I can just have her use this and take, she could take Cheeto. Well, she's, because um, she will be in the bin. Um, she'll be, the townie can, because the townie's going to move into the bin through this route. Um, drop her relationship with him in the house and have let her do it. That's true. I could have. Oh my, Electra just. Okay, Electra's going through something. That's true. If you wanted me to do it autonomously, yeah, then she'll just be gone. But. Yeah, that's an unfortunate part. Oof, I gotta take off my headphones. They're annoying me. Yeah, she's she's being uh, a goofy goober. Um, okay. We're moving Cheeto out. Do that. Yeah, she just... I don't know why she had to kick the... I guess her aspiration's low. I think that's why she kicked the garbage. We're just, like, chilling here without hearing the Sims. <laughs> I'm just like, okay. He's here. He's here. I kind of want to get... I love these headphones. But I kind of want to get, like, a... 
Um, I can use the like just the earbud ones that can actually plug into my microphone. That's kind of nice. Oh my gosh, this girlie's having a tantrum. He's just, oh my god. What can I do for you? Get a kitten. Oh god, she wants a puppy or a kitten. Are we gonna go adopt? What if we go adopt one of Nanette's, one of Nanette's pets? Little bees have a bad time. <laughs> Not the goofy goober song stuck in my head. <laughs> she never recovered after the photo booth incident. <laughs> Every time she has to look at this photo. Actually, I can pull this down. I think I bumped it like up a little bit because of... There we go. Because of that stupid TV situation. <laughs> I love that we I love that we got some last minute pictures of Levi though. Maybe we need to try and make it a thing where if we know a sim is going to die of old age, they have to go and have some photos taken like at the photo booth. I think that's great or have a portrait painted or something. Okay. We got to we're going to have to um we're going to have to maybe adopt. Unfortunately, I lost the want about Dreamer, but that's okay. We can still have her pursue Dreamer. I'm 90% Olive Garden pasta and cheesecake and 10% water. Intr I don't know if I'd ever think of getting cheesecake at- Did you get the cheesecake at Olive Garden? Or somewhere else? Because I don't know that I necessarily would think of Olive Garden cheesecake. I, I have never really- I haven't been to an Olive Garden in a really long time. Okay. Um. What are we doing? So we've got her moved out. After we're done with this household, we can go place her. Or at the end of when, whenever we're kind of done playing this household for the day, if we don't finish their round today, which we might not. Um. We might though. If we finish them, either way, we'll we'll make sure at the end to move in Cheeto to her her proper place. Uh, I got a free slice of cheesecake at Olive Garden for my birthday. Oh, okay. Yeah, I never would have thought getting cheesecake at the Olive Garden. I guess it, I mean, they sell like desserts and stuff anyway. Okay. Um, you know what I can do, which is kind of fun? I have a custom, I have an object. I think it's this one. It's like a memory generator thing, or I also have a different one. I think I have a couple. But I thought one of them have a memory of a sim running away. Hmm. Or left the family. We have a left the family. Um. I could have her have the memory of Cheeto leaving the family. Uh, let me see what my other one. I think I have one, this one, that looks like... This is the memory manipulator. Add bad memory. Okay, I don't know if... These are all, like, default memories. I don't know if any of these... Name of Sim. Got a D. Name of Sim. Broke up. Lost a fight. Oh, right there. Name of Sim ran away. Because it doesn't really identify it. We, 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 we did win a fight with her. But I could do that. Where are you? Okay. And then we can go find Cheeto. That way she'll just, like, have a memory of it. So it should... There we go. So Cheeto ran away. There we go. We have an official... An official memory. I don't know if the other kids... Should I give it to the other kids? I feel like Scoot's the one that really remembers it. Maybe, maybe even the twin brother? I guess I could give it to like all of them. Oh, there was a sim name got rejected from private school. Oh, okay. Maybe I could give that to her. Oh, I got regular cheesecake with strawberry topping. Ooh, that's cool. Oh, on, they wrote it on the plate. That's fun. Yeah, why don't I give everybody that memory, just because. Uh, 
love Cheeto. I'm gonna accidentally click a random button. We actually add Charlie Rose. <laughs> actually give it to Charlie. Move it up and do that. Okay, I guess I'll I'll go back to hearing the sounds here. You're still full. I don't love the feeling of being like super full. It makes me feel kind of gross. I don't want to put one ear. There we go. Oh my god, she's having a tantrum. She says, I want a puppy, I want a kitten. <laughs> I want it now. <laughs> you little spoiled brat, you just got into private school. What, what more do you want? There we go. Everybody's got a memory. Everybody's got a memory. Oop. Can I zoom out, please? Thank you. Please and thank you. She wants to buy a ballet bar. We could do that. Yeah, she can. She wants a little ballet bar. I also could probably fix this. It was nice and fancy. I guess I'll leave it. That's fine. We could put a ballet bar right here. Um, what is it? Isn't it over here? Hello? Is there a? I think there's something here. There's a plant. I wouldn't let me put it on the wall there. Look at it, it's like... It doesn't want me to. <laughs> Why can't I do it? What if I... Put, put Will Wright here? Why is it? It's like it's acting like there's something here. Is there an issue? <laughs> Thanks, Sims 2. You're gonna buy me a birthday present at the mall. Nice. What kind of... Do you know what you're gonna, like, get? Why? Why is it, like, not... Is there, like... Because I have that thing... Stuck object. Ooh, look at that. Oop. It's like there's an OMSP here that I can't seem to grab. I don't know. Oh, you spotted a Legend of Zelda shirt. That sounds cool. Oh my god. Okay. Well, that's annoying. We'll find somewhere else to put it. I don't know where else. Maybe I can get the... Um... What did Buttspot do? <laughs> okay, gotta go to my main bitch hot topic first, though. Okay. Gotta go to my main nut. Hot nut pick. <laughs> <laughs> Not the hot nut pick. <laughs> okay. It could be catching on the slot on the other side of the wall, maybe. Oops. Yeah, something. Got this. We got this, which we don't need anymore. What if, um, I was thinking also that I have this one. It's just like, it doesn't, it's like it doesn't want... I wondered if it's a problem with the foundation, too. What if I did like that and then like... Reset it or something? No, it won't shift click. That's weird. Okay. Well, where else is it gonna go in this house? Out here? Is that... I guess I could put it out in the yard, too. Yeah. <laughs> it just could be out here in the yard. Does that not count? This is the... This is the reward object one, so maybe it doesn't... That one doesn't count. That's annoying. Maybe in here? I guess on this side? Whatever. 
Yeah, it's sending this object over here. I don't understand. There we go. For some, we got a random ballet bar in the damn living room. Okay, you want to go play? She really wants a puppy and a kitten. I think they should adopt Weasel. Should they adopt a dog and a cat from Nanette tomorrow? Maybe that's what they'll do is go pick out a pet. That could be fun. I'll have to... I don't know. I don't know why it does that, but that's all right. I might move them into a different house, too. I'm not sure. Possible. I'm going to go eat. Gonna eat. Yeah, right. We got empty family slots. We got to fill them full of monsters. What are you... What are you... Maybe they could adopt Bread and Weasel. That would help clear out Nanette's crew. Here, you wanna, you wanna clean up some things? I like how he's like, hmm, I can't eat this. Guess I'll go see what the bird has to offer. <laughs> I guess I'll go eat Will Wright. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Doing ballet to forget the trauma of the photo booth. <laughs> yes. Oh my, little bustard. Little bustard. There's also a mess out here. These Sims are, are not doing great. Let's have some breakfast. No, you were not bathing your... What? I don't understand. <laughs> don't eat Will. We need him. We need him. Okay, girly. Oh, she got shoe. She's actually super tired. We're gonna have to go to school in a couple hours, but I guess. I guess you can sleep a little. You're sleeping out here for some reason. You're doing that. You are gonna have to go to the bathroom soon. I gotta use my shortcuts. I keep forgetting about my shortcuts. Also, I can delete this now that Cheetah was gone. We're down one head. Our The flock is, is thinning out. The fox has what is the <laughs> the fox has has entered the coop. The th the flock is fin thinning. Okay, she's finally sleeping. <laughs> Cheeto flew south for the winter. <laughs> Not this. What if I did? They did get a new house, and we did get them like a bunch of birds. <laughs> <laughs> they just had like a room of birds. The flock is molting. <laughs> that means they're all <laughs> molting means they're dropping their feathers. <laughs> is everybody going bald in this household? <laughs> what if wait, so like with chickens in real life, chickens generally molt in like autumn time, like fall time. So like <laughs> what if every fall, which it is right now, <laughs> we make all the Zycax go bald. They just wear they're just bald. <laughs> And then, and then, as soon as the next season starts, they get their hair back because <laughs> they're molting for for autumn. <laughs> It'd be so stupid. It starts with Nacho. Oh, thank you for the hydrate. I shall I'll complete that. There we go. <laughs> That'd be funny. Chickens, yes. The chickens molt. Although, actually, it's every other year that chickens molt, generally. Every second year or whatever. And it's kind of cruel because Mother Nature is cruel to them because they molt. They make them drop their feathers right as it starts to get cold. They end up little shivering messes. <laughs> yeah, they every other year they drop all their feathers and grow fresh ones. So. They look pretty scraggly and pitiful for a while, and then they get all their fresh new feathers back. <laughs> uh, warm up. Some people, uh, some people will put, as far as like keeping them warm, some people do put, uh, like, <laughs> like sweaters on them. It's kind of goofy. They, they kind of just make it work. Especially if you have a flock of different aged birds where they're not all the same group where some have feathers and some don't, they kind of 
when they when they roost at night, they all just kind of group together and, and do share body warmth and stuff. So it's fine. There are people out there that also will use. Um, they left that detail out of Chicken Run. Yeah, <laughs> the the, the well-known <laughs> chicken uh, chicken informational documentary called Chicken the the Chicken Run. But yeah, they uh, what was I gonna say? Oh, also sometimes people use heat lamps. I don't like using heat lamps because they get uh they get like they end up um what do I want to say like dependent on the heat lamp a little bit. But I mean it's not a huge deal. But people do use the heat lamp sometimes. I mean you have to use them when they're babies, but when they're grown, you don't really. Anyway, Mr. Nacho is enjoying this. He's an enjoyer of this. Okay, can you, like, go to the bathroom instead of talking to Mr. Will Wright? Before you have to go to school? Okay, I think you can get up for now. These Sims needs are struggling a little bit. Struggling a little bit. Miss Scoot, on the other hand, is doing fine. How come ever since Levi kicked the bucket, Scoot's been doing good? What's that about? Mr. Nutbird. <laughs> BRB got a Google chickens and sweaters. <laughs> yeah, they make some funny ones for them. But that's for people who like really spoil their chickens, which some people do. Everybody's got to go to. Oh, everybody's got their fancy outfits on. What did you? What are you? You have your. Oh, you have your hat on. He looks pretty cool with his hat and his, his little fancy outfits. At you. Let's see everybody in their fancy. Look at your uniform. You got a fancy school uniform. The, the Zycat kids are, are going places in the world. You? You gotta stop drink. Where are you? Oh, you're here. You gotta you gotta get up, kid. You gotta get up. Oh no, she got no legs. She ain't got no legs. She got invisible boots. <laughs> she got them in new invisible boots. I don't know. Do they sell those at the Hot Topic? <laughs> can you get those at the Hot Topic? In Simsor Cottage Living, you can put clothes on your chickens. Ah. Oh. Okay, you gotta go to school too, buddy. Stop playing your video games. I squealed when I saw chickens in sweaters. <laughs> yeah, they, they could be pretty cute. I just imagine them covered in poop, though, after them being wearing them for an hour. <gasps> Did you miss your your bus? Dude. I gotta have you go to school. Where's the go to school button? Walk to school. There we go. I'm probably gonna have Scoot get up. I'm gonna actually have her macro clean. I'll just have her go nuts cleaning up the house. Let's just do that. Why is life so rough for Lil B? <laughs> Lil B is the youngest child. You'd think she'd be the little little spoiled brat. Hi, Joanne. How are you? Welcome in. Our our chaotic little uh, Zycac household is actually starting to calm down a little bit. It is. It is. We got a picture. Of, we got a. We got one last picture of our Cheeto. Also, this needs to not be here. And this needs to not be here. Everybody's got to do their homework. We have not been doing homework. <laughs> We're kind of behind on the homework front. Are you... what? Does she hate cleaning? Is she... oh, she's sloppy. Interesting. Interesting. I've been meaning to watch this series as a BACC. It, so it started out as a Build-A-City challenge, but it has since developed differently a little bit. I've kind of moved away from like a strict build a city challenge. It's just kind of a a custom hood. I for a while here I was kind of building it up to be a little bit more of like an integrated hood, but I'm now not so hardcore on that because I haven't been really enjoying that as much. <laughs> uh so it's kind of just a custom hood 
with the focus really being on the genetics of our characters and their their very bizarre genetics specifically. But yeah, it did start as a build a city challenge where we followed like some specific rules about like how many sims to to start with and and all of that and all and, and yeah, and it worked out pretty well. But uh, I decided I wanted a little bit more freedom to enjoy my sims. So yeah, I moved into just more of a whatever we feel like custom hood. <laughs> That's kind of where we're at. Even though I, I do still, I think the the playlist might still call it a build a city challenge. I don't remember if I changed it or not. Yes, we have a lot of occult sims, lots of occult sims in this hood. Um, yeah, we have we have vampires, we have werewolves. We have a really fun family of werewolves. Then we have yeah, well, actually we have multiple werewolf families now. It's they're kind of the werewolves are kind of becoming a problem. They're kind of spreading. We have a lot of plant sims. Um. Yeah, like I said, we have the we have the vampires. Um, who else? What do we? What else do we have? What other cults am I missing? Oh, we have do we have a witch. I don't know if we have an active witch. We have a a townie that's a witch, but I don't think we have an active witch yet. We need an active witch that we actually play. Yeah, no witches. It's just the one that one townie girly who wears the blue and black dress. Um, I actually just downloaded a default that is the same hair that she used to have with my custom hairs. I gotta give it back to her. Um, yeah, I, I we, need, we don't have any zombies yet. That'd be fun. I also have the playable... Oh, we do have some fairies, but they're also not playable. And then we also have... Yeah, I want to do the playable ghosts as well, because I have that. The grave is Mr. Levi, also known as Peepaw. <laughs> this is Levi Zykak. It was... The townie that Scoot married. Scoot was one of our original founders when it was still a build a city challenge thing. Um, yeah, why don't we save? Um, oh, we got some kind of pop up. Nacho got a body skill point. Okay. Anyway, yeah. Lev uh, Levi was Scoot's husband, but he was an elder when she married him. So he died of old age. He actually got the whole. Proper uh, hula zombie send off, which was nice at the beginning of stream. Actually, is when he died. So R.I.P. to to Mr. Mr. Levi, Mr. Peepa, Grandpa Dad. <laughs> yeah, we have Nacho. This is Mr. Nacho here. He's kind of a cool guy. Oh, he's excited. All the kids just barely got into um, private school. Mr. Nacho. And so, oh, who's stealing our paper? Who's this? Oh, Silver Schnoz is stealing our newspaper. Why does she have this hair? This is not her hair. I mean, I know why she has it, because I changed my hairs. Okay, thanks, thanks, Schnoz. Lots of aliens, that's true. We also have lots of aliens in town. Um, but yeah, we have Mr. Nacho. No, Nacho's actually a twin. Oh, and did he get, what was that? Oh, just A-plus report card? Interesting. Can I have you just do your homework? Is that possible? Oh, you're really tired. Never mind. Um, but so, che Nacho actually has a sister named Cheeto. <laughs> so it's Nacho and Cheeto. They're twins. Their mother was this, like, rock and roll vampire who died of overexposure to the elements. Um, I need you to get up because you're gonna block the stairs. And they ended up getting taken in by this household, by Scoot who's the mother of the household here. They adopted her. But recently, Cheeto actually got very angry and ran away. So she's living somewhere else. Is going to be living somewhere else. I like how everybody's using the, using the ballet bar, except little Miss Buster, little, little B. Little B uh, does not even get to use her own ballet bar. Okay. You, how about you serve some food here? Can we... Clean that up. Serve lunch. Let's make, I guess, grilled cheese? That'd work. <laughs> yeah, we, this whole house, this whole hood is full of goofy names. <laughs> We've been having fun with the names a lot. Uh, <laughs> yeah, we have, um, all of, so Zy Scoot here, we kind of decided she's like, because she's, the way that she ended up looking where she has this like nose and this, this lip situation, she kind of gives like a little bit of like a bird. And um, her original hair that she had was a little bit more bird-like, too. 
And so we decided, since she's a family sim, she's, like, obsessed with, like, birds and having, like, a flock of children. And so all of her kids have been named after random types of, like, real-world birds. So she has two twins named Blue-Footed Booby and Tufted Titmouse. And then her, her youngest right now is Little Bustard. <laughs> Those are all names of actual birds. <laughs> of course, we call them little nicknames, like Little Bee and Tuffy and Boo. So yeah, it's been fun. Which I feel like in the future it's possible that like the some of the kids could like change their name to like a shortened version, like their official documents, because they get embarrassed about being named Tufted Titmouse, and they just they, he just n changes his name to Tuffy. But like we know, <laughs> we know, you know, I think that could be interesting. Okay, you're coming home. With your broken little outfit here. I'll have to look into this. I got so I got a list of things to fix. I'm gonna have you change into your everyday. Oh, hello. This is Bing Bong. Speaking of names. <laughs> Speaking of names, this is our friendly neighborhood neighbor. His name is Bing Bong. <laughs> His name is Bing Bong. He's a nice little character. Reminds me of the time my mom called me Booby. <laughs> I still find it weird. Oh. Okay, we got some food. We got. Oh my god, look at our piles of homework. We still. We gotta go. Um, we'll have you eat. Call the meal household. Let's get everybody to eat. We'll have a proper meal. Oops, I meant to have you. There we go. Everybody come eat. Everybody come eat. <laughs> oh, Bingo Bongo. <laughs> that would have been a good way to name him, too. Are you coming down, sir? Oh, you're, like, double sleeping. Here, come eat. Oh, he, he reminded you of Nervous Subject. Okay. Bongo Bongo. <laughs> Bongo Bongo from Zelda Ocarina of Time. Okay. I haven't... I'm not a... I'm not a huge... Zelda player. I've watched people play Breath of the Wild a lot. I have watched that. But I haven't I haven't uh, actually played it much myself. I like I like Nacho's little uh outfit here. His little sleepwear is like this very luxurious robe. I feel like it plays into that his like vampire fantasy a little bit. Yeah, I I've, I've heard it's very good. And then, of course, there was the new Tears of the Kingdom, or what it is that what it, the new one? The second, like, kind of like the most recent one, I guess. Um, have you ever played Stardew Valley? I haven't. No, that was that was okay. Why did I just <laughs> I have? I meant to say I have, <laughs> not that I haven't. I literally have. <laughs> My brain's broken right now. We're going on over four hours of streaming, stramming. Yeah, I, did, I have played Stardew Valley quite a lot. I, I go through phases. Stardew is one of those ones where I, uh, like, play it obsessively, and then I drop it and don't touch it, and I pick it up again, and I drop it. So, I haven't for a while, but I have in the past quite a lot. I've definitely gotten into it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna eat my snack. I'm getting hungry. My brain's broken. And how many families in this town? That's a good question. Let me bring up my little tracker sheet. I can, um... Let me see. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Alicondia Tracker. There we go. I can I can share it here. This is our little our little tracker. I guess nine total. And yeah, I guess I gotta add. I got my little deceased section. Oops, I, got, I haven't updated this with round four yet. 
Now let's make round four more colorful. Um, and we played, who did we play after? We played Lemon Bottoms. And now we're on Zycax right now. And then <laughs> I gotta move Mr. Levi. We gotta move Mr. Le whoop. We gotta move Levi into the into the deceased section. <laughs> the dead. He is the dead. So anyway, that's that's our our crew. Not a huge crew, but they're pretty cool. Yes, round four. It's it's gone by really fast though. Because we have such small households and we play for, you know, at least three or four hours at a time. Sometimes up to five or six. Um, yeah. I used to have a huge Undertale phase. I've heard a lot of people really like the Undertale. I've never, I've never gotten into the Undertale either. Yeah, we're gonna have to, eventually I want to make, uh, a, uh, nice college hood for this this household we need to i need to look into that but i'm not sure how to approach it yet okay what are we you guys are sleeping oh that's right we were gonna go pet shopping we gotta do that at some point also thank you for the lurk bex i have a very big undertale and delta rune brain rot <laughs> highly recommend very nice I don't know. I'm not as familiar with Delta Rune. I don't really know a lot about that one. And the other, I mean, I'm not really familiar with Undertale either, but I have seen like bits and pieces. You're just loving this. I think you need to actually uh, go to sleep. I think that's going to be better for you. Oh, it's another game by the same creator. Okay. Is it kind of a Stardew Valley situation where it's like one person making it, or it's just like an indie, or like one office, whatever I say, like one group or something? Oh, you never got into Deltarune, yeah. I think, I, I guess The Sims 2 would be considered my favorite game. It's my most long-running game that I've played the most <laughs> consistently throughout my life. I, I started playing it back when it very first came out. And I have consistently played it throughout the years. I mean, I've had little breaks. But I guess so. I mean, I have other games that I enjoy as well. But it's my definitely my most consistent game, I would say. Okay, so I guess... I didn't know the bird helps gain its nature enthusiasm. You need to just go to sleep. Child. You're sleeping. You're sleeping. Okay, Ms. Ma'am, what did you want to do? She still wants couples counseling. I'm going to have her study that. I think that'll work. You must be older than I think you are. I've got, I have people say that a lot. I'm, I'm, I'm dangerously close to 30. <laughs> I'll say that much. I believe I was exactly 10 when The Sims 2 came out. It would have been. Um, and you've also played it since it came out, yeah? <laughs> it's like, oh boy. It gets older and older. You are reading. I guess I'll just... You know what's funny? I, f I think I find that when I play on stream, I don't fast forward as much. I don't fast forward quite as much. But we're going to do it right now. I feel like I'm so busy with the Sims and, and chatting and stuff. Oh, we got a broken, um... I think we've got a, we got a broken one of these. Oh, ma'am? Okay. So here's the thing. You have your own gigantic bed. I need you to get up and take a sh... Oh, we gotta repair that. Is is this one... What are you doing awake? Tuff, Tuffy is out up here, like... Just, like, showing off his muscles to himself in the mirror. Sir? What do you want? He wants body level. I guess I can let you go do this. Dude. <laughs> ah, I see. <laughs> Wait, so 10 plus 90. There you go. <laughs> who's the kid's dad? So, the kid's dad is Levi, who's dead. 
Levi, this guy out here, <laughs> this is their father. It's Pappy. Yeah, he was, like I said, they, when, when Scoot married him, he was already an elder, but he had a bunch of kids with them. Except for uh, Nacho. Nacho is adopted, so he has different parents. Oops, trying to zoom out. Why are you awake? <laughs> What's going on? Why you gotta... Everybody's trying to sleep and you're jumping. You're filthy and jumping on the... Okay. Can I, can I ask you to maybe just come in here and, like, play a video game? And then you can take a shower when your mother's done? There we go. Oh, it's uh by one indie creator, not a group. Oh, okay. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. There we go. We're we're finally her funds going up. I feel like this household. I'm having a hard time juggling their needs a little bit. They're not bad, but it's a little rough. And you are tired. I'm gonna have you just go to sleep, even though it's it's already well, it's only 1 a.m. So it's like it's morning, but not really. You could eat and have a fun. Needs to take a shower, but I'll let her play. Oh, she looks embarrassed. Can you just take a shower? We can get him to leave. There you go. And then you need fun. You do that. You need to go to the bathroom. I'm getting used to these shortcuts. I'm getting used to this shortcut mod. <laughs> Why did the vamp name the kids food names? Is it because they missed them? Or, um... With them <laughs> being vampires? That's a good point. The, uh... <laughs> named them after pregnancy cravings. They, um... So the, their mother, let me see, I can look at our little family tree here. So their mother is named, she's dead up here. Her name is Rito Snapper, which I think, I don't know, we were just spitballing random names. She was one of the founders. So she ended up with the last name Snapper. So we named her Rito after like Dorito. So like Dorito Snapper, <laughs> like snapping a Dorito in half, I guess. And so then we decided to have the kids have like chip themed names. So that's where Cheeto and Nacho came from. <laughs> so Cheeto Snapper and Nacho Snapper are their names. <laughs> I don't really, it just kind of happened <laughs> in our, in our uh, delirious chaos while making Sims. Oh, that's, yes, you're right, Robin. Dorito due to her pointy face. That's, that must have been what it was. It feels like so long ago that we made them that I don't remember some of that. Oh, it makes you think of the Rito tribe from Zelda. I wonder if Zelda fans caught that. That's interesting. I'm sure there's somebody along the, t the way that's mentioned it. That's funny. Yes, we've had a lot of twins. I had an issue where my game was constantly having twins. Although I think also... I think Scoot might... No, she doesn't have her family. Should I give her... Should Scoot have a secondary aspiration? Like, what would that be? Or maybe I could just give her something else. I don't know, here. I mean, these are useless for her. Honestly, the, I don't even need to give her these. I mean, super fertility, maybe. I don't know. Yeah, I ended up, I ended up moving, I ended up adding, um, the, uh, triplets and quads mod in to the game. Um, so that I can adjust the percentages of twins, triplets, and quadruplets, which I don't care that much about triplets and quads. I made them really rare, but it allowed me to make twins a little more rare than they were at seeming to be. So that was helpful. There we go. Popularity. That could, I think that of all of the ones, because I don't think she's super pleasure or fortune or knowledge. She's not romance. I think probably popularity again. I never use super fertility because it scares me. I get that. <laughs> I get that. Alright, there you go. So anyway, we got that for her. 
I need to do that for more of my Calicundia Sims. I don't have a lot of secondary aspirations. I just have to try to remember. Where are you trying to do? Where are you sitting here? Did you do your homework? Yeah, you did all your homework. She's talking with the bird, but she needs to do more homework. Who's this? You? You need to do homework. And that's, uh, where are you? You can stop doing homework. Whose is this? Oh, that's blue-footed boobies homework. Oh, I guess she'll do that too. There we go. Our little homework station is in action. Our little homeschooling station. Not actually homeschooling. That'd be fun. I, I didn't, I think somebody told me once there was a homeschooling mod out there. I think, I think. Okay, private school, private school. So we got an A plus, we got a B, A plus, and a C. You're, this one's struggling. Maybe she has to get an A plus before they buy her a, a pet. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know about that. You do this? No, that's not yours. That wasn't yours, I forgot. What do you want? You want cereal? What are you doing to your brother? Ask? I don't think we need to bother your brother for anything. I think what we need to do... To have your brother stop playing on your ballet bar and have him do his homework and then you can go do your ballet you're he you wants to buy a cell phone i don't remember if there's a place to buy a cell phone in town there might be he wants to dance with someone what's he doing no we're not Ugh. how about you just spray them please don't 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 squash them don't squash them. Be whiz. Dance with someone. Oh, we already, already read that. He wants to go to college. Talk about hobby. I might be able to have him do that. What is his, like, one true hobby? Sports. Interesting. His one true hobby is sports. You'd think it might be, like, music or something. We can talk about... Oh, he can only... Oh, let's talk about that. Uh, have you any ideas what, uh, secondary aspirations you would give to your other sims? Personally, knowledge for Aurora. With the whole witch thing, that's true. And poss- yeah, that could be- that could be cool. I don't really know. I'd have to be- I- sometimes I have to be there, like, actually playing the sim to remember anything about them. <laughs> I have to, like, be in front- they have to be in front of me. But, yeah, I don't- I know that- I know that Bing Bong already has the, um... What are we doing? Be admired? She's admiring him. Why is she admiring him? Okay. Um, I, we need to talk about hobby. There we go. I don't know. I'm trying to think who else would be good for what. That's true. Highly creative sports. Pro wrestling, aesthetic, <laughs> rhythmic gymnastics. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe wrestling. I could see him being into wrestling, that's true. Oh no, he's crying about the cockroaches. Okay. The way Sims are so obsessed with cockroaches in this game is interesting. Like, so affected by them. She needs to do more arts and crafts. Oh, that's right. She wants to do- she hasn't used her flower arranging at all. Yeah, that's true. A secondary fortune. Um... Yes, I, I do like The Sims 1 a lot, too. Yeah, I have a mod in this game that gives you this The Sims 1 prank calls in in The Sims 2. Uh, I think it's by Lazy Duchess. It's really fun. It just They just come up as a pop-up in the corner, and they're just like all the random messages. So it's kind of fun. Okay, I want you to get up. And serve pancakes. Oh, you have a mod for it. I think I've seen a mod floating around. Maybe I need to get one. Add it to the pile of all my other mods. <laughs> Let's see, warm up. Did you not get cereal? I guess I didn't tell you, did I? I think I was thinking about it and then I didn't. Everything, everything seems quite calm this morning. <laughs> it was quite calm. Maybe an obvious 
answer, but what Sims game would you say is your favorite? That's hard. I mean, I know I was just talking about how The Sims 2 is, like, probably technically my favorite. I guess, because I've played it so much. But I also, now that I'm thinking about it, I also play The Sims 3 a lot. I do enjoy The Sims 3 quite a lot. But I guess it would have to be The Sims 2 just for how much I, I play it, I think. Oh, you've never actually seen a cockroach? I think I have. I think I have? <laughs> now I'm questioning. Have I ever seen? I'm pretty sure I have. Pretty sure. Oh, he doesn't believe you're alive. Hello, Danny. <laughs> Please say hi to Danny. <laughs> hi, Danny. <laughs> yeah, I like The Sims 3 a lot. <laughs> It's, it can be hard to, it can be hard to, uh, like, um, what do I want to say? The Sims 3 can be hard to get running well, but when you do, it's really nice. But, of course, I do lots of, like, defaults to make the Sims look better and all of that stuff. So. Yeah. Oh, I never knew much about Sims 3 until I watched Pleasant View take them to different worlds and solve puzzles and whatnot. Oh, yes. Yeah, I like the, um, I like the adventures pack where you get to go to, like, the, the tombs and stuff. Oh, I guess it's school time. Go, go to school. Don't miss school, everyone. I'm probably getting on the bus. You're going. You're going. There you go. <laughs> With your little no feats self. Your little broken feet. <laughs> I miss Kanatso. Yeah, we'll have to visit Kanatso sometime soon. I do like Sims 2 genetics a lot. That's true. They're they're fun. Especially this hood. That's kind of a big part of this hood, is the genetics. Everybody mixing and matching. Um, but yes, they're very good. Did everybody I think everybody got most of their homework except for little Boo didn't get this one, but that's okay. I'm gonna have her put some leftovers away here. I'm gonna bump her hunger because she did eat. She's got low social. Maybe we should take her to a walk to a community lot and she can try and find a new somebody. A new special somebody. <laughs> Could not so, yeah. <laughs> we decided to, because in The Sims 3 we have our little legacy going and it, the, the founder of the legacy is Kanut Futa. And so we made all the kids have the KN or like something like that. So. And we named him after Not So Curious, so we've got him Kanatso. <laughs> I can't wait to see you play two upcoming Sims. All yes, I want to try him out. The the Paralives and then the Life by You. I definitely want to give him a go. I really do. I think that would be that would be fun. Did you not knew? Oh, is our our oh clean up spoiled leftovers. Our leftovers are full. I think we can put the rest away now. Okay, I'm gonna have her just uh, change into her every day, and then we're gonna go for a ride. We got our we got our van. Oh, we also gotta pay our bills. Oh, really? Yeah. You, so you think the life by you or life by me or whatever it's called is is gonna be a really good one? I'm interesting. Yeah, that's okay. I understood what you meant as <laughs> Pleasant Sims, yeah. <clears throat> I love how bright and colorful this house is. Yes, I do love the colors. We did we did blue like the sky and yellow and white like eggs <laughs> because she's she's bird themed. So that was our bird themed colors. Uh I'm gonna take her, I guess, to the just the regular little park lot and just see who shows up. We gotta see what characters spawn in that she might be able to to uh play with play with that's not fall in love with <laughs> i was i was once in an infested apartment as a kid that was super scary there are also cockroaches that are smaller and live in the wild not in people's houses even those scare me yeah i've i've never really been in a cockroach cockroach infested area but i have i know it's bad it, it can get really bad I'm interested in Life by You gameplay. Seems to be 100% storytelling focused. Yeah, I definitely want to give it a good deep dive. I was also watching a review of 
the second the city skylines too. I don't know if any of y'all are into the city skyline stuff or the you know the building simulator. Um, and yeah, it, I was watching the kind of review of it, and it's interesting. It seems like it has some some issues, but I'm intrigued by it. I'm very intrigued. Did you build all the buildings in the set? Yes, mostly. There's a couple of houses I downloaded, but like their lot, the house that we were just at, I did, we did build that one. I built this one, um, but there is a couple houses I ended up downloading and then just like gutting and redecorating. Um, yeah. Oh, welcome back, Dreamy. Okay, I'm back from the mall. I got a super cute dress at Hot Topic and a $5 off my reward <laughs> fart. <laughs> You got you got your reward fart. No, your reward card. Interesting. Interesting. That's cool. Fart. <laughs> Pleasant Sims got me into downloading mods a couple of years ago. Played it totally. Yeah, I also used to play it very vanilla. But yeah, I think I I did custom content before I ever watched Pleasant Sims stuff. But then I think she definitely got me more into like having organized download folders and stuff, I guess, or like defaults and everything. Okay, we made friends with Fruity Bars. Hello, Fruity. Look at this little guy. Look at little Fruity smiling. Fruity's little smile. Okay, what if I have her scope the room? She's, she's into the menses. We gotta find her a man's. What if Bigfoot is her man? What if it's Bigfoot? Let's greet Bigfoot. What if her next husband is Bigfoot? <laughs> also, yes, the cow. The cow is, yeah, the cow is just a statue. This cow's, cow's just a statue. Oh, wait, pet? I didn't know I could pet it. I thought it... Okay, we'll have to click on that in a sec after she meets Bigfoot. Um, But yeah, it's just a mod. It's converted from The Sims 4. Um, Thank you, Comey. You gotta go. Uh, hope you enjoy all the rest. Yes, thank you very much for hanging out. Yeah, I think we'll be we'll be wrapping up soon because we're getting close to five hours, and I'm I'm getting hungry and tired, and my throat is sore. <laughs> um, my opinion: one and three are fine without mods. Sims Four is the one that needs. That's true. I can see that. I definitely would agree. Uh oh, I don't think we're gonna be friends with Biggiefoot. Biggiefoot doesn't like us. Let's go pet a cow. I'm gonna pet a cow. Look at that. I didn't know that, that there was an interaction with this this object. <laughs> the cow is just a statue. They try to they say to try to stop us from petting the cow. She's kissing the cow. Okay. Oh, well, that was a fun little Butt spot. <laughs> That's funny. I like that. I just love that. Mr. Foot, Mr. Nut. We're gonna save that one. <laughs> uh oh, I'm hungry too. I didn't. Yeah, back with the clay hairs. I love my clay hairs. I do, I do. Yeah, that was a really cute little interaction. I don't know if... Do we have anybody here with chemistry? I think I'm going to have her scope the room. Let me just have her scope and see if she sees anybody. I don't think... Nobody? No. Okay. Nobody here that she's like crazy into or anything. We could always travel to other lots. Um, I don't see anybody hanging out out here. Is she gonna... Oh, she's gonna join them on the bingo? Let's play a bingo! Are we not gonna play a bingo? Oh, there we go. Miss Silver, who just stole our newspaper. Oh, it's probably taking the animation from the highly electric... Oh, I didn't know that you could pet the electric deer animation. Uh, I mean, the decoration. That's cool. Okay, so that's probably from that. <laughs> Please don't bitch work me guys, but I mix CC styles for hair. Like I use pop, but I think I use clay. I've seen some people that do that. I think that's fine. I think you can play however you want to. I'm just fussy about it all matching and being like coherent. 
That's the one thing that I have a hard time with that I've been learning to accept is this clay hairs don't really have a consistent color system like others do. So the clay hairs can be a little bit all over the place in color, but I like to at least have the same like clay style. But I think it's fine to have a mixture. Oh, that's how you make it seem electrocuted. What a shame cow don't- yeah, I know. Maybe the cow would bite or something. Oh, people really hate you for that. That's interesting. I mean, I could see that- I don't know. I- yeah, I'm just not- I'm very fussy about it. Oh, you don't use any outfit or hair, CC. It mostly like um, gameplay mods. I think that's valid, too. I, I do sometimes. I've gone back to, like, true Maxis before, where I just try and use as limited- CC and stuff as possible. I've just gotten so like into the clay hairs and there's times where I just like get rid of them and like take a break from them. But then, um, but then I like going back to it. Some creators recolor clay hairs so you can have, that's true. Yeah, I have seen, I know there's, there's one that does them in the NHS colors and stuff. But when it comes to like the defaults, they're so hard to find anyway that it's hard. You end up having to mix and match all the difference. Is she playing? Wait, she's playing with herself. She just ran it. She's... Oh, poor Scoot is trying so hard. She's playing her bingo by herself. Okay, girly. <laughs> the cow is saying, don't touch me. Oh, she play, we're playing bingo with Bigfoot. Okay. I think we might go home. We did. This was kind of a flop. Maybe we should... What if we ask the matchmaker for a date? Oh wait, I gotta- she's not gonna walk home, she's gonna drive home, because the kids are about- gonna be already home from school by the time she gets home, so... She needs to get back. I could have the matchmaker show up. That could be fun. I'm sure if you can electrify his gnomes, why not a cow? That's true. That's true. It's hard to believe there's mods for Sims 1. Sims 1 could have been the game that needs mods before. That's true, the Sims 1- I- Nowadays when I play the Sims 1, I use a lot of the hacks. In the Sims 1 world, they tend to call them hacks instead of mods. Why do I have- why is there- wait, can we talk about- Why is there a random fish sign in the road? And this, I must have accidentally, like, left these <laughs> when I was making things over? Okay. That's true, she has a, more than enough money for a matchmaker. Oh god, her spending her husband's, like, <laughs> Her husband's insurance, life insurance money on a matchmaker for a new husband. <laughs> That's kind of funny. <laughs> That's a hazard. I'd say so. <laughs> I'd say so. Oh my. All right. Yeah, that's the main, the main mod that I use is that the needs cheating mod. Um, but yeah, I guess it, it, when it comes to the gameplay, The Sims 1 is very rich in character and gameplay that I guess gameplay mods you don't need so much. It's like helping make the game a little more- oh my gosh, I can't zoom out. <laughs> a little more bearable or something. Yeah, not many creators do clay hairs, including me. I like clay hairs when I see them in other people's games, but when I put them on my Sims, I'm like, ew, only kinky clay hairstyles are makes- yeah. I get that, because they can have a weird look, but there's just something about them I really enjoy. I just like the... It's just, I feel like they, they work really well with The Sims 2 style, because I enjoy still having that really true Maxis style with like the clothing and the decor and everything. So I feel like they somehow they work in a weird way. At least I think so. Brandy, Brandy spent Skip's life insurance policy on a pinball machine. Is that any different? Wait, is the is the pinball machine is the pinball machine marrying Brandy? I guess that's where we're gonna draw the line here. <laughs> you know what I think we should do? Let's have you change out of this ridiculous little outfit. Should we actually? I know we just came back from an adventure, but should we take little Bustard to go pick out an animal? She really wants a puppy or a kitten. I think we need to drive her. We're gonna do. Walk to law. I, I don't know if I can visit a sim with my car. I think I have to walk to go visit a sim. Let's go visit. We're gonna go find... We're gonna go visit you. 
And we're gonna take Lil Buster with us. We're gonna go pick out a kitty and a doggy. That's some Black Widow stuff right there. <laughs> the no fish sign implies that there are fish walking in the world. Darwin from Gumball isn't pleased. <laughs> it's true. It's a shame Sims 4 looks pretty, colorful, and fun at first glance until he... We heard more about its complexity, yeah. I, l I really like some of the concepts of The Sims 4. Like, I like the, like, regional open world. I wish they had gone all in with, like, the open world, like, all of the lots and everything being almost Sims 3-style open world, but, like, in those regions so that it was, like, a little more lightweight open world. I liked that concept, but they didn't go all the way with it because all the lots are just closed off from you and stuff. I think that could have been a really cool way to do things. <laughs> Walking fish are the stuff of nightmares. <laughs> oh, Scoot's got a baggie. Wait, did Scoot not pay for something? Scoot? Who's got a baggie? I don't think we'll save right now. Oh, we, we just got a mystery call. We got a call from a mystery person on this lot. Okay, we're here to purchase a dog or a cat. Oh, not the matchmaker leaving a... The match... What is the match... The matchmaker's just randomly leaving a... A thing? Okay. Okay. We're just here to buy. Uh, it looks like they're closed. <laughs> There's rotten pork chips on pork chips, pork chops on the counter. Anyway, where are the doggies? Am I going to have to? Oh, they're all upstairs. Am I going to have to like see these doors are locked? I guess we can ring doorbell. We got to visit the doggies. I don't know if I can actually I got to. This is kind of goofy. We got to teleport. Okay, go, go up here. Can you go here, please? Why do you have a bag in your hand? This is goofy. Oh, you like the Dreamy, you like the, the Sims 4 Suedo open world. Interesting. Okay, we're gonna agree. I saw a lot of Simmers use Max's hairstyle in um, Sims 2 on Tumblr. It makes me want to go true Max's, but I'd probably spend more time downloading CC and doing all my Sims makeovers than playing it, so I try best not to Give into that temptation, yeah. Whenever I see that, like the true Max's hairs, I'm like, oh man, I kind of want to go back. But then I open up my game and I see like the clay detail and stuff, and I'm like, man, never mind. Yeah, style. I figured that's yeah. Meth nut and rotten pork chops, the holy trinity. <laughs> that's funny. <laughs> um, yeah. What would those ladies wish for? Is the lamp cell? That's true. I feel like. I don't know. We'll have to see when we get back to playing them. Hopefully it's still there. I heard it was going to be an online Sims game, but I guess they had second thought after Sims City and removed the aspect. Yeah, I've heard that, that they got scared away from it a little bit. Yeah. Oh, I'm literally going to watch this stream and then <laughs> start this street series from the beginning. I highly recommend the beginning. The first us making these Sims at the beginning was is a really fun watch. <laughs> it's a really good one. And we've had lots of very interesting chaos throughout this whole hood. Okay, we've got to try and talk to some of these dogs. This is bread. Are you playing with... What are you doing? Come here. I'm gonna... Where is Weasel? There's a cat on this lot named Weasel, and I don't see him anywhere. Oh, he's over here. I'm gonna have her... I'm literally... I'm gonna be a cheater and teleport her up here. Because I don't feel like waiting for her. Oh, look at that, the way Weasel looked at her. See who, who she likes more. We gotta adopt one of these pets. Well, the only two that are up for adoption are Weasel and Bread. The way she's walking around with the bag. I guess we just gotta get this girly to meet some of them. You seem to get along okay with them. That's Brian. Brian and Bread look the same. To feed a treat to them. I don't know how to decide who they should adopt. Yeah, it's true. The Suedo Open World doesn't lag it, which is nice. No, Sims 5 is gonna be online. Yeah. I don't know. I'll be interested to see how that goes. Um, yeah, I'm, a f I'm not sure how The Sims 5 is going to go. I kind of hope somebody comes in and... Can you not do this? Can you not do that? 
I don't need you to be- you're using Crystal Beth's oven, man. Are we playing with the dog? Oh, we got an autonomous interaction with Bread. She wants both a puppy and a kitten. So should they- <laughs> The most beautiful creation has been redeemed. I vote for Weasel. Do a poll! I could! I wish the- I wish- I don't think I can do a poll on the YouTubies. That's the hard part. What if I did a poll on both of them? <laughs> I don't think I can do a YouTube poll. You can on YouTube? Oh. How do I do- I mean, I know I can do it on my community tab, but like, in stream? Sorry, yes, that's a- that's a spooky little redemption from our Twitch side of things. <laughs> A YouTuber did it in a stream I was watching. Oh, okay. I don't know. Let me see something real quick. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know exactly how to uh how to do that. Hmm. Maybe I don't have it available or something. Um, but w w how about we- we'll just see, like, who she interacts with most. I mean, she's autonomously interacting with bread right now. Oh, I literally said to him, you could do a poll. Yeah, that's interesting. I wondered if it was, like... Oh, wait, engage? Oh, wait, start a poll! I literally just found it! Okay, here, let's do a poll for both sides. We're gonna do a, a stream, a YouTube poll, and a Twitch poll. This is gonna be goofy. New poll, okay. Which, we're gonna figure out who to adopt. We're gonna do Weasel, who's the kitty cat. Here, we'll, I'll show Weasel. Where did Weasel go? I don't know where Weasel went. Oh, Weasel's down here. Let me, let's zoom in, this is little Weasel. This is a kitty cat named Weasel. He's pretty cute. He or she. That's Lil Weasel. And then we got Bread, which is a doggy upstairs here. He's this brown dog. He's kind of cursed looking. His name's Bread. That's Mr. Bread. All right, I'm going to try and do a poll and see if I can get him to work. <laughs> I don't know how we're going to decide between the two, but we're going to... We got Weasel. We'll see what, what we get. <laughs> yeah, the cat's pretty cute. I mean, he's perfect looking. Okay, let's see. We'll just do a one minute poll. I don't know how long the poll on YouTube lasts, but there should now be a poll showing on top of the YouTubes <laughs> that you can vote. And there should also be one on the Twitch. <laughs> this is chaos. <laughs> We'll see how how it works. Who we who we adopting? Who we doing? Not the not the tie on Twitch is on a tie. What happens if? Yeah, I figured out how to do it on the YouTube's. I got it on YouTube. See, the problem is right now Weasel's winning on YouTube. <laughs> Bread's winning on Twitch. <laughs> How do I... how do we... uh oh, oh we got a tie on Weasel and Bread. I don't know how to... <laughs> I don't know how to uh, decide between the two. That's the problem. Okay, so Bread won on Twitch. Twitch is over. Um, I don't know how long... I guess I can end the poll now. It's a minute. <laughs> so, and Weasel won on YouTube. By 55%. I think we should just adopt them both. <laughs> Maybe we should just get them both. I guess. Right, it's just in a state of permagression. I think we're just gonna have to adopt them both. <laughs> we got a double, we got a double, uh, <laughs> vote. I guess you're buying both. Yeah, I guess so. I guess so. Okay. I don't know how the best, I guess we'll have them go home. And then... Um, just like spawn them there, and then we can send Nanette the money. I think that's gonna be our best bet. 
He's trying to pay for her stuff. Okay, I, I, I'm being a cheater and teleporting him around because I don't feel like dealing with the routing on this lot right now. There we go. Okay, we're walking home. She's walking away with her bag. I don't know why she's carrying a bag around. I don't know why. <laughs> Red's teeth remind me of a Mako shark. I can see the shark comparison a little bit. Um, oh, curved wall is a great concept we didn't know we wanted until we realized we don't know how to use it. <laughs> That's funny. I don't think I will invest in anything after The Sims 4, just like I don't invest in anything after Gen 4 when it comes to Pokemon. Interesting. I, I, I'm I, just, I'm excited for having somebody else similar. Well, like I mentioned City Skylines earlier, like City Skylines came in and just blew Sim City out of the water. Like, I'm excited for somebody to do that with The Sims. I really need that. I think we need that. Uh oh, it won't let you redeem olive oil. Maybe you did it. Maybe you did it too much or something. Wait, can I do it? I'll redeem it in your honor. I've redeemed it in your honor. There we go. <laughs> we have an olive oil on screen. <laughs> Very good. There we go. Oh my gosh, I have so many t windows open. I know. I mean, SimCity's still good. I'm sure it's still good. I haven't played it in a very, 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 very long time. And I was never super duper into it. But. Okay, so we have returned it home. Oh my god. Everybody's. Little, the teenagers. The way the teenagers all just flocked to the phone when it rang. <laughs> that was funny. Yeah. <laughs> that was <Yeah>. funny. <laughs> wrong. <laughs> and it just was a wrong number. Sorry. <laughs> okay, Leah, let's, let's save the video game. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that was a picture of my baby olive oil. Baby. The baby. Okay, we're gonna spawn the... Let's... Uh, spawn Sim. Brandstone. We got Weasel. Oops. Spawn Sim, Brandstone, and Bread. And then... Family. Add to family. Weasel. Family, add to family, bread. And then I'm going to have her go up here and use this computer, which has the banking on it. Um, bank online, and then transmit money to household funds. I'm going to have her pay. Um, what should she pay for the, the two pets? I feel like it should be a reasonable amount. It should be like a thousand or two grand or something. I know we're still a ways away uh, because it's an indie game, but I'm excited for Paralyze. Yeah, I'm, I'm intrigued by it. I'm, not, I'm one of those that doesn't love the art style of it, but maybe it'll grow on me, you know? Maybe, maybe. <laughs> She's Olive's a good girl. She's a very good little baby. I think 2K probably would make sense. Yes, and we'll, uh, we'll do the, the matchmaker, too. We'll definitely do that. I'm debating whether I should just go ahead and play us through our Wednesday. I think I might. We're going overtime a little bit. Usually my maximum is five hours. We just hit that five hour mark. But I think I'll I'll go ahead and we'll, we're just because it's just one more day after today. Because to Tuesday is seven. Today is Tuesday, seven p.m. And then Wednesday is the last day that we're playing on this round. I just hope people realize that Paralives is can't give them everything they want. People's wish list for the Sims games is yeah. And it's not a, you know, it's an indie play game, you know, it, it might give you a lot of what you want, but, um, what is, <laughs> I'm just, I've just noticed something that I don't remember. Transmit money to Abe Piddledorf's household funds, the mayor's man cunt. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> the mayor's man cunt. <laughs> I'm, I'm guessing that's the name of their lot. <laughs> apparently that's what i named a lot because that used to be sunny's house like the mayor's house as <laughs> i called it the mayor's man cunt <laughs> interesting okay i don't remember that i have no recollection of that anyway let's find us a brand stone there's nanette okay we gave two grand to nanette we're gonna blow through our inheritance very quickly <laughs> okay all right and then we can call a matchmaker. All right, anything else I can do with you folks? 
What do you want? Cooking level? Body skill? Let's give- let's let you do cooking. Sure, why not? Probably should do some- well, see, when my sims come home while, like, you're off the lot, and then, like, you come back and the story- the, um, story progression, uh, time sync sets them up to be there, it doesn't have them bring home their homework. They kind of get out free on their homework, I notice. And then you, what do you want? Cleaning level? Yes, let's call you. Sure, the kids are learning stuff. What do you want? You want to buy stuff. Uh-oh, this dog. Oh, we gotta buy pet stuff, too. I'm gonna have to... Do we not? Do I not? Like... Wait, why can't I... Why... Uh, is it, like, not identifying the pets as ours? It doesn't let me scold him. The dog was literally eating their homework. <laughs> Mansion? Mankind. <laughs> it's kind of a monkey paw situation. An indie game can give us what we want, but the game will be cheap. Yeah. Or you have to wait a while. <laughs> I really love cats, but I'm for dogs a lot. Do you, do you prefer dogs or cats? I'm a dog person, but I'm okay with cats. I'm fine with the cats. Oh, wait, this is Forrest calling to talk to Nacho. That's Forrest's dad. I mean, Nacho's dad. Interesting. Let's greet Harmonia. The matchmaker. Yeah, I'm a dog person more than a cat person. But I do like... Cats are okay. Cats can be cool. Okay, so now we gotta pay... Oh. Speaking of speaking of dog person, olive oil has just entered the room. Olive oil is now here in the room with us. <laughs> Ask for blind date. Oof, she's a little tired. I am gonna bump her energy just for the sake of this little adventure we're going on here. Um, she wants mail. Should we just? I think we should just pay all in. I think we gotta go all in. I'm afraid- what I'm afraid of right now is that it's gonna give us like a duplicate NPC like I was talking about earlier a little bit. So... We'll see. Hopefully it doesn't. I might be able to handle it if they do though. Okay. Are you talking on the phone? No, you're supposed to- your father's trying to call you. We need to stop that. There we go. Is he there? There we go. Look, he's caught. I'm gonna have to leave. <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna have to leave now. Sorry. <laughs> it gave her tickles. The matchmaker gave her tickles Honkerson. The local clown thief. Using her dead husband's insurance money to buy a blind date. And you got Clown Man. You got Mr. Clown. Mr. Tickles Honkerson, the Clown Man. <laughs> he just walks on in. <laughs> okay. Hi, Tickles. Oh, not you. Let's chat with Tickles, I guess. Here, I can do a macro... Oh, no. Oh, my. Oh, my. Tickles is... Tickles just changed out of his- his clothing. Okay. Tickles, we're on a date right now, buddy. Did you know that? We're on a date right now? Tell a joke to Tickles. <laughs> Tickles Hawkerson. Okay, changed back. I need it. what I need is- you know, well, technically, I was gonna say, I need like a- the clown hair with the hat off, so like when he's in other outfits, he can still have his clown hair. But I think it's just the base game, like, afro recolored. So like, you could do that pretty easily. You could like make your own recolor of the, the base game afro. And then that could just be his like, casual hair. I kind of like that. I bet that's out there somewhere. <laughs> yeah, if the matchmaker says he's good, I guess we can try? A clown for a stepdad. <laughs> You know. This is quite a, quite a time here. Uh-oh, is he not getting along with us? 
What? I don't know what her actual chemistry turn-ons are. She likes fitness and glasses. And we got a clown, man. They're not getting along. He wants to talk. Are we chatting? Oh my gosh, she told him a bad joke and lost aspiration. Oh my god, she's almost in aspiration failure because of tickles. Oh my god. Uh-oh. Oh crap! El oh my gosh, LL Flamingo, I, sh I should be running ads. Thank you for the resub, I appreciate it. I, sh I completely- I see that's the issue, I've been like, not seeing it. I'm gonna have to roll ads really quick, I'm sorry for the Twitch folks. The YouTube folks won't- I don't know what's going on with that on the YouTube side, but... Sorry about that, we are gonna roll a quick ad. We're just gonna be fighting with tickles behind the scenes here. <laughs> Um, how'd you get the letters next to the deeds bar? So there's a mod by Lazy Duchess, which I can type that name out. They have a a mod that what it is is this functionality, which is these are shortcuts. So like if I hit H, it pops up here eat. So it's like a shortcut auto thing. Yeah, I think the ads do yeah, you're right. The ads right on I'll have to look into the the YouTube ad thing and figure out what's going on with that. Um, but, uh, yeah, so the needs, so it's, it's like little shortcuts, and what it is is that actually was a functionality in the Sims Life stories in any of the stories games, so it just, like, converts it from the stories games into the, the re regular game. But, yeah, it works pretty well. I just barely installed it, actually, and it's been kind of nice. Okay, they're getting along a little bit. Have them at least be friends. It's like she doesn't have chemistry with him, though. I think the matchmaker gypped us. I think she screwed us over. <laughs> oh, they're not getting along. I guess they're not meant to be. I'm so sad. Not. Not. The product of their love might be a toucan. Oh, no. <laughs> Glasses are cool. I used to wear them. I, I also sometimes wear glasses. All the time. Hi, puppy dog. What are you doing? Hello. The littlest puppy. I know, I'm almost done. Almost gonna be done soon. Playing a video game. Yeah, I like the mod a lot. Okay, they're getting along. Also, the cat's ruining something, and I haven't bought any pet stuff. I gotta buy pet stuff. That's what we'll do right now while the ads are finishing up. We'll just buy some pet things. Um, I guess just, like, some of these. This bowl matches the aesthetic of, of her house so well. Oh, look, it's this, like, one spot right here. Like, there's something wrong with this. I don't know where to put... The bowls. Maybe here? <laughs> oh, do you see Olive's tail? <laughs> do you see the little Olive tail? I guess we'll just put a couple here. Yeah, she's being... I don't know. She's asking me, like, why are you... What are you doing? Why aren't you paying attention to me? That's what she's kind of concerned about right now. Um, I don't know where to fit anything in this house. I guess this. Alright, puppy, you gotta lay down. Good girl, go lay down. <laughs> Thank you for the olive oil. Did it actually work? Did the olive oil work? We're having issues with it. Um, what else do we want to put down? We need, like, I think we'll do a dog house, because I don't know that we have room for a whole dog bed inside. I'll just do like this yellow one. I guess I'll use another Chewy out here. Then maybe I can fit a cat bed in here, up here somewhere. <laughs> I started Pupper's tail and now I'm obsessed with her. I can't help it. <laughs> a cat is, uh, in a house of birds. That's true. A cat in a, a house with all the birds is not a good idea. <laughs> 
uh, my sims have never had a bird. Do the cats... I think they can go after them? I forget. Yeah, I, I'll have to look. I'll have to look. I don't think either of them are finicky, but I might be wrong. I'll have to look and I'll double check that. I almost forgot about that. Oh, we need like one of these guys. In somewhere here. I don't really have a room. I usually put it in a bathroom. Maybe we'll just put it out here. For now. And then... I could get one of these fancy cat beds. That's a conversion from... Um... The Sims 1. Or it's like, inspired by The Sims 1. Maybe. I guess I can fit, like... Can I fit one of the double? I can't really. I think we'll just leave... Maybe I'll put one of these in here. I think that'll be good. We'll have plenty of pet stuff around. Um, let's see. Are they finicky? Ooh, yes, this one is. This one's not. Okay, so one of them is. Good call, Bex. <laughs> one of them is. What's the expensive bowl? I guess it's this one. Here, what if we put it, like, upstairs separately? Like, it's a little fancy bowl for the kitty cat only. There we go. Can somebody tell the cat to stop it? Oh, there we go. I can scold now. There we go. <laughs> you like olive oil for a name, yes. I don't know really where it came from. It just kind of happened. It's funny, though. I think about... Um, I think about... Oh my god, this household's a little loud. I think about how... When I got her, so I got her from a rescue. She was seven months old when I adopted her. Um, she had just come up from Arkansas. She was a stray that they had picked up. And um, they they named her Tess. Like T-E-S-S. -S, Tess. And it's weird to think about that, that that could have just been her name. And I'm just like, that's just so not her. Like, she is olive oil. <laughs> she is not Tess. <laughs> yeah, oh. Uh-oh, am I paying attention to... There we go. Uh-oh, our date's running out. I don't think we're having a good date with Tickles. Can we tickle? Wait, <gasps> we, we're we gonna tickle Tickles. Uh, nut the date with Tickles. I wish... I wish... Oh my god, she's... He's... T the, the matchmaker has taken our money and run. Because look at this. This is a joke. Wait, I need the I need the ceilings. Oh, oh my god. There we go. Are you are you kidding me? We we need to we need to hunt down the matchmaker and demand a refund. <laughs> yeah, I like olive oil better than Tess. I don't know. It just was like I just wasn't into the name Tess. That's just not I don't know, it just, like, didn't... I don't know, it doesn't, like, roll off the tongue in a way or something. I miss Levi. I know, remember the perfection that was Levi? Oh, man. It would have been kind of funny if these two hit it off. Our date's about to be over. He wants to dance with us. He wants to go to a community lot. Play with tickles. Entertain. He just doesn't like anything. We're just, we're, oh no. Scoot's having a meltdown because of Tickle's flopping on our date. <laughs> Bread's just watching from the distance. Look at Bread. <laughs> Bread's just here watching us have a meltdown. Okay. Well, Tickle's will not be tickled. I know. Maybe Tickle's only wants to be tickled. Yeah, he wanted to be tickled by her. He's just back there, like, looking at our, our artwork. It's like, hmm, yes. He's just critiquing our artwork as we're getting <laughs> we're getting treated by a therapist because of him. <laughs> Levi, come back. We're gonna maybe that's it. Maybe we need to bring Levi back from the dead. Not him looking at her like, wow, she's kooky. She's kooky crazy. <laughs> oh my gosh, this bird glitch with the object thing is weird. I don't know why it keeps doing that. 
Wait, the fact she did the chicken dance was perfect for her. <laughs> well, they, see, I wanted them to be friends. I... Oh, she's trying... She's chasing after him to tell him a joke. I had them... That whole time I had them on mackerel friendly and trying to get them to chat and tell jokes and stuff. And he kept rejecting her over and over. And she kept getting fl failed, um, like, aspiration stuff. She wants to have a baby. Wait, I'm going to I'm going to be a cheater. I'm going to give her want um add want lock. I'm going to lock in. I'm giving her two locks. So I'm locking in both of these. <laughs> Brent just watching the mental <laughs> mental breakdown with his resting shark face. <laughs> He's great. Oh my. We need to fill some dog bowls here. He don't deserve her. He don't denut her. <laughs> Hot take, the Maxis cars are ugly. I, yeah, they, they're a little, I don't know. Let's see, I have this, like, one time years ago, I downloaded a bunch of, you know the, the creator, there's a creator that is really known for their cars called, like, Fre I think they're called Fresh Prince, I think was their username. And they had a bunch of cars, custom cars, and I downloaded a bunch of them, and it, like, made my game just, like, melt down because they were so, like, high-poly and high-detail, so now I have, like, a fear of custom cars. <laughs> the only custom cars I have are converted from The Sims 3. <laughs> don't denut her? I mean, I hope you don't denut her. <laughs> that sounds like The Sims... That sounds like the Calicundian version of deflowering. <laughs> the denutting. <laughs> oh, no. Are you okay? You're gonna go to sleep? Okay, I so I'm gonna I'm gonna grant her this want because we adopted. Hello, can I? Isn't it? Is it shift click or is it? Why can't I? Um, usually if you shift click or you, I thought it was control click. Huh. Won't let me uh, grant her that. Is that? Am I confused or is it? Hmm. That's too bad. I don't know, it just changed. Okay. Yeah, control click with cheats on. Let me... See, that one worked. Okay, well, now it's goofing. I didn't... You know what? She got some points anyway. She wants to... What is this? Play with bread. Do that instead. Play fetch. Look, he's asking her to play fetch. I think her and bread are getting along good. Because he was asking her to do stuff before, too. She needed those points. She did. I could give her another free one. I give her another freebie for, for losing it. We'll give her that. Shift right click. Oh. I usually, I think I do control click. I don't know. That was weird. Nothing was working. I tried all the different ones. <laughs> Resting shark fake is funny. Would you ever get another dog or is one enough? I don't know. I, I might, Maybe in the future, but right now I'm happy with just one. I like, I like just have one because I have lots of other critters. <laughs> I have lots of other critters outside. We have the chickens and the ducks and rabbits and... We used to have a kitty, but we don't have the kitty anymore, unfortunately. Testing cheats causes corruption. <laughs> Hi, Parakeet, how are you? <laughs> yeah, um... Is there a way the matchmaker... To ask the matchmaker for refunds? I wish. We should just invite her over and beat her up. We should just murder the matchmaker. I think that would be fine. Okay, it's control... Cl yeah, I was doing that, and it wasn't... I think it was just glitching out on me. I think that's what it was doing. Anyway, she got to play with him. I guess it didn't count, though? I don't know. We'll, we'll do something. Buddy old pal. You need to... How about you just um, go to sleep? It's nighttime. Wednesday, 3 a.m. I think we're just going to power through this day with this household. Um, I'll just play them. Let them do their thing. I'm now in Australia from the U.S. and just... Was just accepted for apartment. Ooh, very cool. Very cool. That's that's very exciting. Congratulations. Yeah, he they they all really are obsessed with the ballet thing. He's wait, well, he didn't go to bed like I told him to. Buddy, you need to go to sleep too. Wait, she culinary skills abound. Why how did she just earn a how does she just earn a cooking skill? 
from brushing her teeth. What just happened? Was that like a delayed thing? I don't understand what just happened. Oh, thank you. Yes, I love the little egg bed. Once again, it's her her theme. <laughs> her theme. Mmm, yummy toothpaste. <laughs> I like toothpaste. Okay, everybody, all the ch everybody's asleep. I think. And the critters are are crittering around. We probably shouldn't let the bird run free. Oh, the kitty's going to use that. Well, I'm glad we got a couple of critters in in this household. I think that's fun. I'm gonna save. I'm curious where the biblically accurate monster. Yes, we. Um, it's BJ. We. Uh, I should have. I should have changed the title after we changed households. But it was the BJ creature. I don't know if you were familiar with the creature that we bred from. Um, from Mr. Uh, what's his name? Blobbert. <laughs> Mr. Blobbert. Yes, you'll have to check. Last stream we had some interesting developments in Calicundia. <laughs> She she will roll the wand to become friends with the clown. So there may that's true. Maybe hopefully she will. Looks like she wants to be friends with Bigfoot though. Maybe Bigfoot needs another chance. Mr. Blobber. That's true. They could night owls for this family is fun. Or early birds. They could be a bunch of early birds. I should have been at cooking level five with all the bathroom potions I've made with toothpaste at three a.m. <laughs> Oh, no. <laughs> okay, thank you for hanging out, Robin. Have a good night. We're probably going to be done pretty quick here. I just kind of want to get... I just it, Sometimes it's like ending on one day left with a household just feels silly. So it's like, I'm just going to power through this day. I don't know what we're going to do as much. We're just going to play and see what happens. And uh, maybe we'll try and have her can reconnect with somebody. Maybe that's our main goal for this coming day. Right now I could be fast forwarding too. <laughs> you need to take a shower at some point here. Okay. Morning a time. Oh, ugh. Clean that up. Let's serve some a uh, breakfast. There you go. Romance Bigfoot. Yeah, uh-oh, she lost the want. She wants to dance with someone. She wants to dance with somebody. The only person she has chemistry with in her in her relationships is Mervy. Which I don't I think that's dangerous for her to get involved with Mervy. I think I don't think Mervy's it. Uh clean up. Serve breakfast. <laughs> no, I don't think Mervy's it. Yeah, I just, I don't know. I'm trying to think any other characters. Maybe, is she going to waste more money on the matchmaker? What if she hires the matchmaker again? <laughs> They're going to dance with somebody. <laughs> I beat you to it. This kid, this kid in the dancing, I need you to stop and eat something here. They're just obsessed with this dance skill. Okay, you need to- oh, wait, I think it's actually school time. Wait, why doesn't it say that you need to go- Wait, what is this then? Go to school? Oh! Oh no, you two- these two slept right past the school. Oh, jeez. I wasn't even paying attention. Walk to school. I just feel like it went by so fast. I guess it was when I was fast forwarding. Oops. <laughs> There we go. Alright, the boys are off. I love that the Zycat kids are in their, their uh, private school era. I think that's great. You know what I need to get? I do need to get the... Um, the uh, Oh, we got, we got a lot of bills to pay, I think. Uh-oh. What are you doing, Bread? What are you doing, Bread? I need to get that custom object that's like a um the matchmaker ball but like just on its own that you can buy okay give the matchmaker and only give like 2.5k should give a different person okay person person 
We gotta get rid of a portion. To find a mate, Christy. Yeah, I need to get that. I thought I had it. Oh, what is this? What do we... What? Is... We got a stinky letter. This let... What? Wait. Also... <laughs> Hi, bud. <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> How you doing, bud? <laughs> How you doing? Anyway. <laughs> it's a bad date letter? Oh my gosh. I've never seen one of these. It's stanky, and it's like, oh my goodness. That's funny. Oh, she's disgusted. Okay, well, pay all the bills. Or should I hit pay all bills? I don't know if there's any others in the house. I'm gonna have her fill this in, too. Um, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, you think that, that custom one is a lot better? It's better than the bag, yeah. Are you gonna- can you please fill this in? He's side-eyeing the bad date letter. Yeah, he's like, oh, guess I gotta stay away from that one. What is- are you not filling this in? What is going on? Why is- Does she just not want to? Is that what's happening? I guess she just doesn't want to. Um, that's- oh my god, you need your food dish filled and cleaned. Um, oh, this TV's broken again. Why is it always broken? There we go. Yeah, we gotta see what the letter says, too. Sorry. Yes. Z Scoot's got some stuff in her inventory. I didn't know. She's got an alarm clock. Okay, I guess I'll let her put her alarm clock up here. Uh, we got a random rug and this chair. I think she bought all of this from Mervy. Okay, let's put her bad date letter up here. I love this. I'm obsessed with this. Wait, cancel. He's screaming. I, I'm. Oh my god, <laughs> it's so good. Um, we're gonna call the matchmaking service again. Look at him. I love that. I'm obsessed with it. <laughs> it's him yelling, and it's like a skull, and oh my god, with the clown. Are you kidding me? That's so funny. <laughs> toxic tickles transmission. It's toxic tickles. <laughs> I love that. I'm gonna read it. I think I have to click on it to view it. View. <laughs> yeah, we gotta fight the matchmaker. Too bad we don't have the ability to pickpocket. Because <laughs> then we could steal money from her. And then pay her some money. Maybe Scoot's just naive. She's just like, well, it's it's just the risk that I take. What's her needs issue again? I guess it's- I think her- her mood's so low because of her aspiration being low. Dear Scoot, our date was just a waste of time. The thought of it is like a knife. So if you think to try once more, don't call again. It steals my life. <laughs> Go away, Tickles. <laughs> I love that. That's so good. I love that. I need more of that. I'm gonna take a- oops, I accidentally took the wrong kind of screenshot. We gotta take a screenshot of that. Oops. Oh no! Save directly. There we go. Oh my god. <laughs> That's so funny. Go away. <laughs> He's so dramatic. That's true, the rug could maybe- I could put the rug in the kids' room. And drop it in there. She likes her new chair. She's got her little thinking room. Okay. <laughs> so funny. Cholerophobia. Chol cholerophobia, yes. Cool. Cholerophobia? I only know that from playing Dead by Daylight because there's a perk called that. It's the clown's perk. Okay. That's great harmonia, darling. Tickles being an icon as usual. <laughs> Prima Donna era. She can sit there and stare at her clown letter. She's, she loves it. Okay. All right, let's go throw more money down the drain. We need another blind date. Give us a good one. She wants a baby and fears a baby. 
male. So what'd you say, like 25? Do that. Let's see what let's see what that gives us. Yeah, I, I'm really happy with how the colors of this house. If I buy them a new house, I'll have to get the same color scheme going. Halfway instead of full. Uh-oh, who do we get? Oh boy, okay. So this was an issue that I was worried about. So we got we got the NPC version. I think I'm gonna have to change this. I'm gonna have to spend some time fixing this. We got the NPC clone of Diego. So we got Diego technically, but it's the clone. So here's the question would be, what if we... I don't know. Would she get along with actual Diego and could that be a storyline? Because I don't, I don't know that I want her to... Or the other thing would be, I have her get along with this sim and then I change his appearance and name to be a regular NPC and not the clone of Diego. Right? Because this is not actually Diego. It's uh, the nod. Well, let's chat. We actually have chemistry. He's talking about marriage. Yeah. Do we want to try actual Diego? Because we could cancel this date and then invite Diego. Yeah, she could save Mr. Diego from his situation. Although he's like a romance sim, so it's like... Mm. <laughs> she's a, she wants a child. Maybe she's afraid of being a bad parent, that, but... That usually happens with first-time mobs. Yeah, I think that's probably... Well, she just got rid of that, that fear, but yeah, I think that's probably the direction. Evil clone Diego sent here to ruin OG Diego's life. <laughs> um, also, I don't know what's going on. Little Buster's student band is scheduled to be the final act in the talent show today, and they've been working on a rocking finale song. After hearing some of the early acts go, Little Buster begins to get a little concerned that their song is a bit too heavy for the parents and the audience. They're gonna rock it out. We're not gonna tone it down. Rocking out is all about sticking it to the man, and Little Bustard isn't about to lame up their song. <laughs> the band goes out and rocks full force, only to find the audience does not respond at all. There is a scattered applause after they finish, and Little Bustard loses music and dance enthusiasm. Oh no. Rip. It's Diego's twin. They have the same name because their family was poor and could only afford one for the kids. <laughs> I, I kind of like that. I think I am going to change some of the NPCs, though, and just go move away from trying to have, like, the townies be NPCs and have the... Yeah. Yeah, I know. It's funny to think a clone appeared. Maybe... What, what, if we renamed this sim... Let's say, let's say we do give... What if this is Diego's twin? What is Diego's twin's name? We have Diego, and what's a matching twin name? Like, I could literally change his first name right now to be the twin. We could do that. Could we pretend that this, is, that this is Diego in an alternate dimension of real Diego, who has his opposite personality? Die Ego. <laughs> I don't know about that. Like, what? Like, I kind of like the idea of him being the twin, and we're just going with that. Um, I'm going to look up... I'm going to go to nameberry.com. Oops. And look up the name Diego. Alejandro, I like that. Alejandro, right? Alejandro Carlos. Ooh, I like Carlos. Dora. <laughs> Dora. James. Um I'm gonna search the name Diego. Let me just see. Here, we can we can look. I do like I do like Carlos. Who's the uh I think it's showing correctly. There we go. Sorry for the light light color. Um so on this website they'll show similar names. Santiago is fun. Oh we got Alejandro, Francisco, Miguel, Mateo is fun. Lorenzo, Marius, Carlos, Emilio, Rodrigo. Javier. Oh, I like Javier, too. Eduardo? Leonardo? Leonardo? Joaquin is also good. Alonzo? Rafael? Antonio? Pablo is fun. Luis is... These are all good. These are all good names. <laughs> These are all good names. 
Hmm. L Lorenzo is pretty fun. We could go with Lorenzo. Let me try that. That's true. Pablo is short like Diego. Do you think Pablo? Pab what do you could do Pablo. His last, no last name is... This was a randomly generated name, so I'm not sure if I'm going to pronounce it right. But it was... Quesada? Qu Quesada? Q-U-E-S-A-D-A. -A. So Pablo... I like that Pablo ends with an O. Two. Like, I like that. Pablo Diego Quesada Quesada that that sounds right Pablo Quesada Diego Quesada we got the O at the end I kind of like that <laughs> Quesadilla Quesadilla I like that Quesadilla I could be <laughs> I think I'll do I think I'll do Pablo Um, let's see. I think it's under Misk. Misk, change first name. We'll do that. Okay. They seem to be getting along. Okay, we're gonna go Pablo. I love that. I like that it's a twin. <laughs> I like that it's a twin. Okay. What she wanna do? Entertain. Let's see if he likes our jokes. Does Pablo like... Oops, sorry. I'm trying to zoom in. It's like... The the twin. He's an identical twin. We could give him actually a little bit different look if we wanted to. Oh my god, the camera's goofing on me. Let me go from this side, then it won't jump down. Oh my god. Here we go. He liked her joke! He liked her joke! Okay, we're in a good direction here. Oh my god. This... Can we, like, go somewhere else, y'all? We... I don't know. Here. What does he want? Dance, play, tickle. Um, it's tickle. She wants to go to a community lot too. I don't really want to risk losing the date though, because I have an issue with my game. It doesn't like us to... Oh god, her without her feet coming up here is, is scared me. We gotta dance. We could do a slow dance. He likes us. We're getting along. Pablo and Scoot sitting in a tree. Yeah, he's the nicer knowledge boy. Unlike his his dirty romance brother. <laughs> I wanted to fight the my, my matchmaker. We could. We can have our fight. I think I have the fight anyone anytime mod, so we can literally just go, ha. Okay, we can stop this. Hi. Um, hi, son. <laughs> hi, son. <laughs> he looks sad. Are you okay, Tuffy? I'm just on it. Mommy's just on a date with a handsome fireman. It's okay. <laughs> Mommy's just on a date with a handsome fireman. Yeah, he doesn't have... Because all I did was change these Sims' appearances and their names. I didn't change their personalities or their aspirations or anything. So they have their own deal. So he's his own Sim other than his appearance. Fight later, yeah. Well, it's happening. <laughs> He's cheering her on. <laughs> now that's what we're talking about. See, this is a test. This is a test. All right, let's get. Let's admire. What does he want? Appreciate. He wants to play kicky bag. Have a pillow fight. He's a very playful guy. Okay, can we stop the fight? Uh oh, she didn't win. I guess she doesn't get her money back because she lost. <laughs> <laughs> she lost. Okay. She wants to... Oh. She still wants to be friends with Bigfoot. She wants to put head on, head on shoulders from slow dancing, but... I guess we'll do some of his wants. There we go. Let him stop. I'm gonna grant this just to get it out of here so that I can get another date want, because I don't have anything to work with here. Okay, she not, doesn't have any date wants. Okay. I guess we gotta go by his. Appreciate. Well, he wants to appreciate her, so this probably isn't gonna count, but... They wanna play kicky bag? He must be very playful. My nose is itchy. Oh, 
go. Okay, we can stop now? That's alright. I guess they can try and just start doing some romance. They don't really have any wants left. I use the cool shade to make the relationship oh much faster. Yeah, I don't I don't even use that really ever. Um I guess they they've got they've got some pretty good chemistry it seems like. Well, that's good. Is it not going up at all? Uh-oh, is the date bugged? Are you okay, sir? Why did I get anywhere? Anyway, thank you very much for the follow, Alex. Thank you, thank you. Um. Yeah, it's not moving, is it? Why is it not moving? Because they have no wants? I guess so, but isn't it supposed to still kind of go up when they do stuff? That's weird. He wants to appreciate her. What if I make him selectable and just have him do that? <laughs> just to be a cheater. Let's let's get a peek. <laughs> I, I like that. I like that first message. Why doesn't the kid have feet? I'm new here, huh? <laughs> I like that. I like that. That's thank you. Hello, welcome in. Uh, my my default is bugging. I've got to get it figured out. Let's have her change it every day so she has feet again. <laughs> She's supposed to have feet. It's just, I have like a default replacement for the shoes, I think, and they're not working, so it's just invisible. I think I'll just delete it, delete it. <laughs> but welcome in. <laughs> okay. What's his personality? Oh, he's super grouchy, but super playful, so he's like mischievous. He also has no eyebrows. Uh, he's a little more active, he's outgoing, but he's sloppy. Interesting. Interesting. He doesn't have any relationships. Maybe that's why. Do you think it's bugging because he's a NPC that is, a, is like an NPC? I don't know. He's a Bratz doll. You take the feet off. Yeah, exactly. You can charm. At least we're building a relationship regardless of the dumb date. Oh, you know what? I think the reason I showed no relationships is because I had family selected. Is that why? If I go... Okay, no. He does have relationships with a few people. Okay, that's fine. That was just my fault. Ooh, a crush. <gasps> they got a crush. <laughs> it's kind of awkward that she's doing this in front of the kids. <laughs> yeah, they got two bolts. That's more than than Mervy. Although I think she had I think she had three bolts with Mr. Levi, unfortunately. But nobody will ever be Levi. Although I wouldn't mind a Zykak Pablo baby. That could be fun with these two genetics together. Mommy's gonna learn you how to woo a man. Watch real close, blue-footed, or little bustard. This is how mommy has babies. <laughs> this is where babies come from. Leave mommy alone. She's having fun with the, the nice fireman. Why isn't baby locked in? I must have accidentally unlocked it. Here, I can also just do macro socialize romantic and just let him go at it because this kid is is struggling he needs fun how about you just come up here he, i feel like he's just standing here doing nothing it's my game breaking i'm gonna save <laughs> little b shield your eyes <laughs> um <laughs> don't romance in front of the kiddos gosh i remember brat's dolls yes i was a big I thought I, oh you thought you were more of a Barbie person. I was gonna say I was a big Bratz dolls kid growing up. I was a big Bratz dolls kid growing up. You doing you doing your thing? You were a huge Bratz girly. Yeah, I like I love I love a good Bratz doll. There's some folks that still really collect them and stuff, which is kind of neat. Okay, we decided to not do the thing. We're just gonna we're just gonna not do the thing. Okay, cool. Okay, cool. Uh oh, our time's running out. Oh, it did go up. We're in the good range. We're in the good range, so it did actually go up a little bit. 
Uh oh, not us blocking the staircase. Blocking our staircase, man. Ooh, little Buster's got one day to grow up, which we're not going to see it this time because this is our last day with this household. But so next time we play, she'll age up. That'll be fun. I was also a Polly Pocket enjoyer. I low nut Polly Pocket. <laughs> yeah, a little Buster. I, that'd be fun if, if little Buster's a family sim. I had uh, Barbie dolls until I was in my late teens, early 20s. I never played with them, but I never got rid of them. Yeah, I don't know where mine are. I don't know where mine went. They might still be in storage somewhere. My Bratz dolls. But I, I mean, I had some Barbies, too. I was a big Bratz enjoyer. Sweet Street. <laughs> Not the Sweet Nut. <laughs> oh, how about Sweet Nut? Does that nut any bells? Butt spot. But no, I've never heard of Sweet Street. I don't know, maybe that was past my time. Okay, well, we had a nice date. Okay, you need to get up so we can kiss you goodbye. I feel like that was a good, that was a good, uh, final piece here. Oh, he, she wants to be besties with him. Can we, like, wait. Can we, like, have him propose go steady so he can be like our boyfriend <laughs> oh sweet street was more niche interesting <laughs> brett is trying to break through the romance <laughs> thank you for the follow our manny hopefully i said that right there we go they are now boyfriend girlfriend yeah let's save we're probably gonna wrap up soon we'll let them kind of li live out their night here a wednesday night um, maybe she should serve some dinner. Make some grandma's comfort soup. I feel like we need more things for these kids to do because they're just, like, so bored. Maybe, okay, first of all, this damn TV is broken again. Do I need a better quality TV? Why can't I delete it? Weird. Maybe just, like, a better TV. A nicer one. What should I get? We can, we can spend, we can spend, look, it's doing that thing again. I don't know what's wrong. This house is goofing. This house is goofing on me. Maybe this? Why? That's so weird. Uh, we'll just, um... I get, I get this? No. Like a one tile? We'll just do that. And I want to get him like a little video game system. Just give him something extra to do. Let me turn my quarter tile back on though. There we go. Anyway. Um, oh, I had a Baby Alive doll. I think I've heard of that. I don't know if I had one, but I do think I recall that. <laughs> the photo? Oh, yeah. I can, uh, oh, is that maybe what's causing it? See, it's, look at, no, it's like there's an OMSP right there. Look at how it goes down. Why does it do that? But there's nothing there. I, so this house... Originally was on a different, uh, was originally on like a different, um, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to put this in her inventory anyway, just for now. Because I might move them to a new house anyway. Um, on my own time. But this house had different foundation. I, re I replaced the, the, the foundation. So that might have goofed something. And, uh, what's CC? So this is, I believe this is converted from The Sims 3. Yeah, so this is by Veronka, I'm pretty sure. Double check. Yes, it's by the creator Veronka. Um, it's from the Sims 3 University Life set, which is a really nice set of furniture. Oops, why did it say redacted? Oh, did you delete that? Sorry. I don't know if the auto mod deleted that or if you deleted it. <laughs> it's okay if, if you're... But uh, yeah, I'll write out the name Veronka if you're curious. That's how it's spelled. Um, it was called that uh, because the battery operated. Oh, I see. But yeah, I love this set. I love the Sims 3 University stuff. There we go. Look, the children are having fun. Goes to download immediately. <laughs> 
Yeah, I like it. I, now, that would be a cool thing to have this default replace the regular base game TV. That'd be nice. That'd be cool. I wonder if that's possible. And that way you can just have it as that, as that TV instead of having an extra TV in your game. I never played SSX3. That's interesting. We got soup. Everybody gets soup. Yes, Veronica CC is very good. Very one of the one of the go tos of the Sims Three, a uh, Sims Two CC. Well, she does a lot of Sims Three conversion, so I guess. <laughs> but yeah. You playing? Anybody want food? You go into the bathroom. How about you stop and, and eat, or are you stopping to sleep? Okay, you're sleeping. How about you come and eat? Can somebody do something here? Can somebody do something here? Yeah. Oh, you just downloaded some CC in the CC haul you did. Oh, very nice. Very nice. Mmm, chair soup. Mmm, chair soup. Look at that soup. That soup kind of looks like... Uh, kind of looks like mommy I froed up. Mommy I froed up on the couch. <laughs> That's what that soup looks like. <laughs> mommy I froed up. <laughs> oh, there is. Is there a default like that? That's cool. Maybe I'll have to look into it. Maybe that's what my next thing is. I'll get get into more defaulting of. Um, oh, it is a BG TV replaced with Veronica TV. Ah, very cool. <laughs> Hope the new boyfriend can get that five grand back. Yeah. Hopefully. Hopefully he's a really good firefighter. <laughs> my mom wouldn't let me actually feed it and thought, uh, though, which was the whole point of it. If you gave it, it gave, it gave you food in multiple diapers. Huh. That's interesting. She didn't like want you to mess it up or something. <laughs> yeah, you can. Yeah, definitely. I'd love to have the link in the discord. Okay, she needs to take a shower. I don't have her go to sleep. What are you doing? How about you just go to sleep? Once if we get everybody to sleep and, and kind of just chill and we can uh we can kind of wrap up. <laughs> ASAP, please. <laughs> I'm sure they'll do it in their in their time. As soon as they can. <laughs> okay. It's alright. <laughs> I keep thinking he's a burglar. Oh, <laughs> that's funny. Yeah, he does look like a burglar. Mommy, I threw up. <laughs> Stands in the hallway at 12 a.m. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> no. Oh, oh no. I have been sent into the desert. I'll clean up these. She's thinking about having a new boyfriend. She's excited. Why is there like a stank cloud over here? I just saw like a stank cloud here. Was it? <gasps> I just saw a ghosty. It's ba it's Levi. Levi's sending us off. Look, it's Mr. Levi. Oh no, not Levi being here when our boyfriend's here. Our new boyfriend that we paid for with his money. <laughs> our new boyfriend that we paid for with his money. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. <laughs> oh, it's gonna haunt something there. Okay, he went inside the chair. I bet he supports it. You know what? Maybe. Maybe he's like, I want her to be happy. Where you going, buddy? Okay, I'm just following him. I love this. I'm obsessed with this. This is fantastic. I need this, like, actually, I need to make this and actually print it out. Why do you say it like that? <laughs> well, he's just down here. Are we getting along with the children? Okay, I think we're getting along with the children. I like that he's just here in his like his his NPC outfit, his fireman outfit. Maybe Levi'll just think he's here for business. <laughs> I'm so happy her dead husband is so supportive of her. Yeah, <laughs> or eight grand back. He also she also paid for a new boyfriend. Well, that that one worked out, I guess. Well, I I knew I see what you mean as far as him earning the money back. That's true. 
Oh, some Rex is calling for Tufted Titmouse. Okay. Maybe they're buddies? Rex is one of the orphanage teenagers. I'm gonna have her say goodbye to him. And then she's gonna maybe take a shower. This is all screwed. I keep forgetting to have them fix that. I could probably just get a new one or something. I don't know, because I have a mod that makes it so when they're broken, you can't use them, and it helps you encourage you to like actually fix it, I guess. But uh, I'm just gonna be a cheater since we got we got we got dead grandpa money. We got dead dad money. <laughs> We got that dead dad money, so we're gonna buy a new, a new shower. There we go. There we go. Um, is there a reason I can't see everyone's chat? Yes, so I am actually currently multi-streaming uh, on YouTube and on Twitch. So if I'm, if you hear me talking and reading off messages that are not in your chat, it means they're in the YouTube chat. So I have both chats up in front of me right now unfortunately there's not a way to like integrate them um so that's why yeah if that's confusing <laughs> that's the only thing i wish there was a way i could also like i wish i could show them both on screen or something like have them both picked up i think that'd be fun <laughs> nut money <laughs> nut money <laughs> i need a little screenshot of that we got some good butt spot moments today Uh, this sounds super weird, but as a kid, I used to make Lego people look pregnant by using a large Brock as the stomach. I could see a kid doing that, though. I could see a kid doing that. <laughs> uh, you should pronounce nut canute. I could see that. I feel like that is like a respectful way to try and pronounce it. <laughs> I think that works. Yeah, I like butt spot. Butt spot's funny. Levi's just hanging out up here. It's interesting. Is, is he not going downstairs? Awkward. Okay, they're sleeping. Who is in here? You. You're sleeping. You're sleeping. You're talking. You need to sleep. You need to sleep. We're going to put everybody to sleep, and then we're going to call it a night. And you need to sleep. <laughs> Hi, Peachy Bead. Yes, but that's okay. Welcome in. We're just kind of finishing up this family. Um, they're just getting everybody to go to sleep. Ms. Ms. Bluefooted Booby is sleeping in her mom's bed, which is like, whatever, I guess. Okay, I need everybody to sleep here. You're sleeping. You need to stop and go to sleep. There we go. <laughs> Thank you for waking me up. Jolting me awake with the burglar sound. <laughs> Kanut futa. I like that. I like how that sounds, though. But I guess, according to all the research I've done, that's not it. But it seems like it could easily be. I have a Le Lego Batman movie in my queue. <laughs> Interesting. I've never watched the Lego movies. I miss Lego. I'm a full-grown adult. I have an urge to go and buy Legos again. Well, you know, there's a lot of adults that do the Legos, because there's, like, those newer, like, hot, like complicated lego sets that are like all these like fancy like they look like flowers and stuff and like different like actual things <laughs> which are cool okay uh, you're waking up oh he's he's haunting our our uh our lamp right now oh he got out never mind oh he jumped out okay i think he woke them up i think that's what happened okay we're gonna save okay okay Sports car Lego sets are for adults. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. We're going to uh, transition over to the chatting here. Okay. That was a fun one. <laughs> that was a long stream. But I had fun. I'm, I'm glad that the YouTube thing worked. I'm glad our, our YouTube moment worked. Uh, it seems to be... I've got to just maybe figure out if I have a way of integrating chats or something. But, yeah, that was cool. I'm glad that the YouTube folks were able to uh, hang out. I am going to do, let's see, I'm just, I'm going to do this really quick. I'm just doing this on this screen so that I can, like, copy it for YouTube just in case. I'm going to share it here. If anybody wants to, um, is curious, that's a, that's a link to the Discord server 
for keeping up on uh, all the stuff we're doing on stream and uh, all our other things. We have all kinds of channels where we talk about all kinds of Sims stuff. <laughs> Ty for stream, heard Herb Oldie. <laughs> well, Ty for hanging out, Dreamy, the Zelda nerd. <laughs> Thank you guys very much for hanging out. I am uh, tired and hungry, so I'm going to go find something. I, I enjoyed stream tonight. I always love Calicundia. I'll be back streaming on Tuesday. We're going to be playing Early Strange Town. And I am going to try and do another youtube -y stream. We're going to see how that works out. So that'll be fun. Um, but thank you guys very much. Let's see. I guess I'll play play some uh, music on our way out. Waves to Twitch. Okay, <laughs> The YouTube is waving to Twitch. The Twitch must wave back to the YouTube. Or else we're, you're rude. There we go. <laughs> All right. Uh, where's my ending screen? All right. See you guys later.